usually come in after I start it. <laughs> hello, everybody. Yeah. Anybody out there? Yeah. Oh, hello, hello. <laughs> mm. Gotta be somebody. I was too busy talking about perfume with mm. Janie. <laughs> I want to see that, how much that Mark Jacobs perfume is. Mark. Oh, of course hey. it's expensive. Of course it is. How much? Let me see. Is that wait? I'm looking perfect. You view perfume. Uh, I'm finding two different bottles. Or what is that? Mark Jacobs hey, for women. Intense, and that bottle looks different than the other one. Why? Ulta Beauty, one hundred and five dollars. <throat> wow. Well, Ulta Beauty, Jacobs, Edu Perfume, so intense. Wait, which one is it? Is it intense or is it called so intense? Because there's one that's intense, and they're both by Ulta. They're both by Ulta Beauty, but I'm so confused. Daisy E. So intense. I'm confused. Oh, Daisy Mark Jacobs. Oh, is that a different? And then there's yeah. Mark Jacobs. I'm confused. Wait, what does it say in the ad? I hate when they do stuff like that. Like, come up with a new name. Yeah. <laughs> Mark Jacob, Jacobs. Is it perfect as I am? Because then on this side it says, on this side it's, uh, side it says Mark Jacobs intense, perfect as I am. So I don't know which one is which. <laughs> Is it called intense or is it called perfect? Oh, is there two here? Oh, there's two here. I didn't see that. I only smelled the bottom one, which was I didn't read the little tiny, tiny writing that said lift to experience perfect intense and lift to experience perfect. So this is the intent. That's the one I liked. And then clear out my nose. Perfect. No, I definitely like the intense better. So I like the, the perfect intense. That's the one I like, which is this one, 105 damn dollars. Wow. And then they're so intense. Well, I can't even with these names. Like, come up with something different. This <laughs> is the one that I like. <clears throat> okay, so oh, you can find really? it all UV for. Well, that just says perfect. I don't get it. Perfect intense Sephora is for three ounces. It's one hundred and thirty nine dollars. I knew it was going to be expensive. With an intense price, Katie. Yeah, no kidding, right? <laughs> uh, oh my god! Get out of here! Get out of here! I'd rather just pay <laughs> get for the out of here. Get out of here! <laughs> yeah, as I got this magazine, look at Jennifer Aniston. She's such a beautiful woman. For being uh, fifty something years old, mm -hmm. I know. It's it. how pretty she is. Really I watched a whole documentary on her the other day. Oh, they have one on. Yeah, yeah. on Amazon. You can watch. I tell you. Hi, Hi Tisha. Hi, Steph. Hello. I got my tea. I had a muffin. <sighs> All is right with the world. Long overdue. I cleaned off my desk somewhat, but then stopped to eat my muffin because I was like, all right, I really stop and eat something. <laughs> and I got most of the paper put away. I just didn't get some of the things put away. I'm still clean. No, not really clean, but <clears throat> partly clean. <laughs> Yours is as clean as it's going to get. That's right. It yeah. is. That's <laughs> it. <laughs> so what are you all guys doing? Off my desk. You're making a voodoo doll? Yeah. You're making the one with the little thing on it? Yeah. <gasps> yeah. I gotta squish him down. He's too skinny. Which, oh, let me grab their bed. <laughs> I took their bed out and I was gonna grab the other one. I expect either. All right, there, baby. She took your bed away. Oh, 
auction, Renee. I did not see you at the auction, Renee. Where were you? Were you sleeping or hiding? Or sleep hiding? Or hide sleeping? Uh oh, get me. Oh, gee, messy, messy Bessie. having some strawberry ice cream yummy you have enough to share you got to share with everyone <laughs> all right i gotta put that away so for the first piece i have to finish cleaning up my mess i got the bulk of it done but well, I got the paper put away, but I didn't get all the paper. Like, I got the bulk of the paper put away, but I didn't get all the rest of this crap put away. Mm -hmm. And the, the little paper scraps that are behind me and on the floor. These dies I gotta put away in a Ziploc bag or something. I need a little zipper bag for those. Little tiny scissors away. I cut so they can get put away. If you talk to uh, uh oh, well, no, maybe don't. Uh, Katie. Talk to Katie? What? Is she seen her on or no? <laughs> Is Katie coming on? Yeah, did she say? Or did you send her a link? Um, no, I sent her the link, so she'll be on. <laughs> Hey, Aaron, let's plan um, a time for you to come on, okay? And we'll plan a project to do where we can do some sort of art or something. Does that sound good? I tried to plan that with you, but then you, <laughs> you disappeared. Uh oh, I lost my. What did I do that for? Oh no. Okay. Mm -hmm. Oh, right. You don't say much. You don't say much, but you say a lot. Yeah, exactly. <clears throat> By being here, right? I gotta fill those up. Glues and that. Okay. Hello. Hi, Rashmi. Is it Rashmi? Hello, hello. I can't butcher the name. Rashmi. Let me. Hey, how are you? What's your name? <laughs> Eric, um, I'm, 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 wait, wait, wait. Oh, well, so long since you've been in. Who? Uh, Mama Cat. Mama Cat. Oh, hey. Hi, Mama Cat. I did not see you ever. Hi, Mary. Why is that? Mary Jane. Hello. Hi, Mary Jane. Jesse. Jesse. Wait, I'm like, like, wait a minute. Am I in the right chat here? <laughs> <laughs> okay, come in here. Oh. Hi, hi Allie. Allie says hi. Hi, Allie. Oh, I'm gonna put that in there. In there. In there. In there. In there. Uh, that in there. <laughs> um, okay, back to school. Yeah. In there. In there. Uh oh. I got a problem. What? What? 
No, my drawer is not shutting because I overflowed the drawer underneath of it and it was kind of banging into this drawer. Okay. Oh. Mm. Thing. Mm. Ouch. I just pinched my finger. Oh. Ow. You still won't close. What's the matter with this thing? Oh, this. You son of a bitch. Get off of there. I've been out to dinner. Alright, that should work now. Alright, yeah, no. Are you gonna go in? There you go. Huh? Seven go. Who's going out for dinner? I wanna go. Seven? Yeah. Yeah. Cool. Five years. Jesus. Wow. Oh, kids. Crying. No, Shannon says, around. guess where I've been? I said, going out to dinner or sleeping. <laughs> <laughs> oh, you've been taking over, huh? Hey, good. oh, what you doing? What you working on? Yeah. Are you building a rocket ship so you can come visit? <laughs> there you go. No, I bet. Yeah, if you've been busy, busy. I have an overabundance of scrap paper for, for, for Laura, and I'll have some in the, probably in the auction next week, too, because I'll have a ton, or for giveaways or whatever. Yeah. I kind of ended up with a lot of extra, I'm trying to get it situated. Make him a little small. Just a little bit. Oops, I think I cut too much. <laughs> Whoops. I would have got him over. Get it. <laughs> I cut too much of a box. Yeah, right. <laughs> Let's see what's out here. Mm -hmm. Get that lost. Mm -hmm. Why are they there? I don't know. Uh, used to weld and carve wood. Oh my goodness. Hi, Heather. Oh, you guys are flying so fast. You used to weld? Is that what you said? Yeah, Shaz used to weld and carve wood. Huh. Um, <clears throat> Aaron said, uh, when you know, or when you know what time, I guess, because you would know. Okay. Send her a message. Yeah. I will. Yes. Me? I am making Halloween stuff. I have. I'm going to make a voodoo doll. My little voodoo doll. See? It's going to be a little necklace. See? It's got a little pin right there. <laughs> and this one's not big yet. He's my little, my, um, this is Devin. <laughs> Devin. Devin the devil. And he's got a tail now. <laughs> Devin the devil. With his little devil Devin tail. Devil. Oops. Oops. There, baby. And then here's a weird looking guy. He's kind of strange looking. Oh, I know. I want to give him some. I'm going to get his bows in. And some witch's hats. <laughs> <Give him. laughs> yeah. There's some earrings. Little earrings. For... I painted that. And then I'm going to. I'm going to glaze all, well, resin. <clears throat> all at the same time. That way I can. Oh. Mm. Yeah. Hi, Amy. Yeah, I'm going to get some. Mm -hmm. I'd like to do a few more of these. Yes. I'm going to be cutting leather today. Hopefully, no, not leather. Pink leather. Faux leather. Not real leather. Faux leather. leather. It stacks up so I can get it the heck out of my way. This is from all the this is leftovers. This ain't even all the leftovers from the last all the cricket stuff I've been doing. This is just oh, some wow. of the leftovers from that. 
Not all of them, but <laughs> a lot of them. <laughs> I just need to get them out my way. There's a lot of scraps, which is a good thing, you know, because I'm using them. I'm Probably, she sent her a um, link. So she's probably going to. Katie, get on here. I know you're out there. <laughs> <laughs> you're like, I know her. I know I'm here. The jig is up. Yeah. Get on here. Mm -hmm. We know it. You're out there. <laughs> she has too much FOMO. She'd be on here if she, if she was there. I know. <laughs> she gets too much FOMO. <laughs> okay. All right, that needs to go up here. There we go. Okay, that's good. Um, I never put these stencils away, did I? No. Nope, I didn't. I left them out all willy nilly. Katie's in front of the store. That's right, Katie. <laughs> Your party's waiting for you, Katie. To the front of the Wait, store. Who's in the front? But ignoring your party, Katie. Give me this. Okay. Why are you I have like my carpet looks like paper. That's how much little bits on my carpet. Confetti. What? Is she anywhere near like any flooding or anything? Oh, no, Katie? I don't think yeah. so because that's a different yeah. county. I mean, she's in a different county than me, but she's not in that. Humphreys County is where the flooding was, and I don't think she's. Oh. I, mean, I know she's not in Humphreys County, but I don't think she's near any of the flooding. I think she would have said something. I'm assuming anyway. Maybe. Yeah. If she I was floating. So I think we yeah. know it. <laughs> yes, exactly. <laughs> we floating. We go. Oh, okay. See ya. I had pizza already, but that doesn't mean anything. My snacks. She's a pizza, pizza head. Pizza, pizza. Okay. pizza. All right, we're semi cleaned up. Yay. Yay. <laughs> now, what I need to do is get the other stuff, put this away, get these out of here. Oh, wait, did I get that stuff behind me? No, I did not. Hold on. I lied. This over here I gotta deal with. Jack in the box. Jack in the box. Scissors. Hi, Diana. Hi, Diana. Fancy meeting you here. <laughs> Well, that's no fun cooking. Ew, Ew. cooking. <laughs> yeah. Ew. I don't want no cooking. Nobody wants cooking. I'm just kidding. Mm -mm. I'll take somebody else's cooking, but I don't, I don't want to cook. <laughs> somebody else wants really? to cook for me. Um, that might be nice, huh? I know, right? That steak was so good. I can't believe I ate all of it because <laughs> that's so unlike me. Rub it in. Go ahead. Keep rubbing it in. Yes. <laughs> so <laughs> I was so excited. I was like, yeah. Uh, Lady doesn't know what it is. Raining frogs and toads out. <laughs> really? Frogs and toads. Catch them. Here, froggy, froggy. Bring us a frog. We'll cook it up. Frog legs. <laughs> Gross. <laughs> Yeah, frog legs. Yeah. I just can't do. Some people like frog legs. Ooh. I don't think I'd even. I don't think I'd want to even try. Hello. <laughs> I don't know what the I did that for, but I did. Hmm. Carla, how are you, Carla? Carla's here. Hey, Carla. Yeah, I'm cooked right. She's here. She's not late this time. I know. I know it. Do you have a fever, Carla? <laughs> all right, you have to get in there. Oh, these were all those things I cut out that I didn't like the way they came out, but I cut them out anyway. Diana has the heater on. 
Who has the heater on? Diana. You have the heater on. Yeah. Well, she's, you know, she's in the cold country. I mean, it's cold for now. She's you know, she's New Zealand. It's cold there. Wait a minute. She's in Australia, aren't you? Yeah, she's in New Zealand or Australia. Yeah. Is that cold there? No, it's not cold there. Oh. I mean, it's their, it's, it's their, their, well, I mean, is it their winter time? Yeah, it's their winter time, but their, their winter time is like your winter time, I think. Oh. <laughs> you know what I mean? That would be, yeah. Ten, oh, not, it's 50 degrees? Oh, that's pretty chilly. Yeah, not, yeah, I know, but that's not cold. But not cold, no. I, I, well, to them, it probably is, because that's all, you know, that's what they're used to. Yeah. But to us, 50 degrees is not cold. You know, I especially have. when we get things like, you know, <laughs> yeah, like, 12 degrees and 10 degrees and, and all yeah. that. It's cold down south, hot up top. Oh, yeah, because they're, they're, they're north of the equator, or I mean south of the equator, so that means everything becomes the opposite. Okay. So our, our in our country, the south is hot and the north is cold. In their country, the north is hot and the south is cold. Cooler, I should say. Oh, goodness. I think it's like cold. <laughs> oh, goodness. Me too. I know, it's like bizarro world. Mm -hmm. It is bizarre. All right. No, no. Um. You know what? Remember when we were talking about, <laughs> about the, you know, holes in his body and stuff? Um, I could make, uh, it may look like wood, but it would, it would have to be like polymer clay to be able to hang from the chain. You know what I'm saying? Like it, yeah. it looked like well, that's what I thought. Skin. I thought you'd make it out of hot polymer clay. Yeah, the little. And it would be thing. Yeah, like a a pin or a stake, maybe. I don't know. Yeah, like a stake. Like, well, yeah, I would do like a stake because it, otherwise the pin will probably bust. Whereas the stake will be thicker yeah. and it won't bust. I'm imagining. Exactly. Yes. Thick. It'll be a little thicker. It'll come to a point. Okay. Yeah. Bunny monster. <laughs> Let me put these like away. Bunny monster. You, you do know he's a tail now, right? Picked you up. Get back here. He's a, he's a tail. <laughs> he's so cute, isn't he? I'm gonna make a different colored one. Mm. Thanks, Aaron. Ten very cold icicles. Ooh. Hanging off your butt. <laughs> I remember ice cold. I used to eat them too. I can't believe that now when you think about it. <laughs> they used to come off the roof. Yeah, we used to eat ice too. Yeah. <laughs> After they came off the roof of a dirty building or house, uh, whatever. <laughs> all right. Ooh. <laughs> Okay. Right, I, I do, right. Heather. Uh huh. Yep. Yeah. At first, I had the, you know, the lower plan, and then I was like, "Ooh, this is too much fun." And then I started like printing, like, you know, <laughs> crazy stuff. I kept going up, up, up. Of course, my husband's like, you don't need that. Yes, I do. <laughs> I started, well, then I started printing so much that it was costing money because he goes, oh, my, you know how much? You, yeah, it's bad. So that's when we upped the plan to the $14.99, which is actually $500. And 500, you mean pages? Uh, or 500 pages, yeah. So, don't say $500. People will be like, wait a minute, $500. I know, right? <laughs> 
what the <laughs> heck? Um, well, whenever, you know, I had the plan and I was, I, I would look at the little ink and I'm like, they better be sending my ink. And sure enough, I was never out. It'd be coming in the mail. There was only a couple times that it didn't only because, um, even though I was on a plan, well, I decided, well, I'm just going to, you know, print and print. And, well, they're not used to that because when you have a plan, they're used, like you have this, uh, say, in a month, I'm printing so much a week. And then all of a sudden, I go crazy and I, like, triple that. Well, you know, that might be a, sometimes a problem. And, like, I called and they're like, well, I see that we had it sent out on such and such. But you have to allow it a little bit of time to get there. So that's the only reason I would have a problem because I'd be like, mm, you know, but yeah, it pretty much was, you were never out. Now I'm stocked up because I have been printed for a long time. I'm like, here, let's stock her up. So and she can't complain. I realized that all my fabric sample books are in the closet in the other room. If I can't get to them, I'm going to grab the one that's downstairs. There's one, the faux leather one downstairs. Well, that was going to be for the auction, but if I have to, <laughs> I'll grab it because mine are uh, in a closet that I'm not sure is blocked by stuff. So I'll be right back. Let me go get that. Okay. Hmm. 70 degrees. Oh, it's, uh, it's 89. I was watching our temperature earlier. And it was like 100. Then it was like 101, 102. I'm like, wait a minute. Because it usually peaks at probably 4 o'clock. Oh, you got your printer today. Stuff. It says I have low ink already. Um, like how many pages do you think you printed? Because usually, this is what people tell me, when you first get your printer, they put the bare minimum amount in there. Because, <laughs> you know, yeah, they put the bare minimal amount. And... But how much would you say? Like how many sheets? Bigger than him. I guess not. A little bit. I print, I, you know, and then when I was printing, I got all bunch of digitals too. <laughs> so I was like constantly printing and print. And now I've got so much and I haven't used it yet. I mean, the, the digitals. Now I've printed out things from, you know, Pinterest and all that. So, which is fun. Oh, so like 30 pages? Yeah, um, because the lower one has 50 pages for like, is it 50? Yeah, I think for 2.99 or 3.99. So you should should be getting your ink. They have to, you know, they get like on a, a thing. That's pretty well. These error messages too. Huh. It's odd. Hmm. Hmm, but that was about. Do, do you know what your printer, which one you got, Aaron? Uh, Aaron. I don't know his name. Um, Heather. <laughs> Mine probably needs cleaned. I didn't even realize it about the cleaning until they had sent me one cartridge. And I'm like, wait a minute. It says no ink in here, this one. And it wasn't, um, well, anyway, I had called and they said, well, here, try this first before we send you another ink. So we went through and I had to clean it all, which was really strange. Cause, and that was surprising how much hmm, it needed clean because I was printing so much. 
This is oh yeah. <laughs> I know, right? He's like, it can't come quick enough. <laughs> Probably this week, I bet you it will. Yeah. You know who has a really cute Christmas out is uh Tsunami Rose. She had a buck, which just sounds like a lot. Five fifty dollars work and get fifty free, fifty dollars free. But if you look, it's like, whoa, that's a lot. I mean, because her stuff yeah, it was like three, say three dollars, two fifty for a set like of a uh, certain digitals, like so many. And um I got that one time. She has cute stuff and uh Artie Mays also has really nice stuff and um ooh, who else? Well there's several, but those are the two that I've bought from so far. Aaron, I'm doing some doing my Halloween stuff. <laughs> yep. I'm doing my Halloween. Plus I love to cut out the, the butter or Prince of Butterflies. And they really um Nice butterflies on, on Pinterest. That's fun. I want to I I want to get that eco tank, but I, I can't. I mean, we looked into it and they said don't even bother. I'm like, why not? <laughs> because you know, and they said because here in Arizona, it's so dry. Before you use that ink up. It's going to dry up. And I'm like, oh, I print so much. I don't think so. And they're like, um, yeah, you will. I'm like, okay, well, I'll take your advice then. But still, I like it. Oh, I'm sorry, Carla. That sucks. Hmm. I have the ink plan six months. Six, six months okay maybe that's maybe that's just a new thing because i hmm. that's jet 274 hmm. i've got so many you know hi cheryl what's she doing nope you haven't missed it she's looking for her <laughs> she's looking for a book <laughs> all her, her leathers in I have to ask, uh, that's called Noreen tomorrow. I was telling Shazzy, um, I was telling Hubby there that her sister lives in Connecticut, right where it's really flooding bad. So, and they're just, the nephew bought a condo for them and they moved, I think they moved out. Did they move out? I think. I don't remember now. And he's going to sell their house because it's just it's too big, supposedly. Yeah, you're probably in a place that it wouldn't uh, it wouldn't dry out. I had a Nepson, and for some reason, I don't know what it was. Maybe it was just me, but the Generic. I just didn't, it didn't. Maybe it was the printer I had. I have no idea. Where in Connecticut? Um, oh, good question. I noticed. I can't. I don't really know. I was seeing some of the the things on TV and. A lot of them sounded so familiar. I'm thinking, oh, that's where she is. But, you know, I've probably heard her talk about it so much. I'm not real sure. I have to look at my address book. <laughs> oh, you're in, are you, are you in a bad place there? Sure, oh, you stand dry. Hi, Rhonda. Stacy has 
Well, I have that printer too, the HP. Um, I can't remember the, the number. She, Stacy probably would remember when she comes back. I'm so bad at that. If I don't say it for a while, I forget, you know. Oh, good. I'm glad. I'm glad. It's really scary. It looked terrible. Jeez. Beyond that. Yeah. And, oh, and um, um, I was buying the generic ink, and it just didn't seem to be coming out nice at all. But neither did the regular. So maybe it was my printer, but the you know the regular ink for that Epson was like whoa. So it's still in our closet. We put it on Craigslist. Nobody, there's so many printers on there, you know. I think I'm gonna have a heart attack on how much I just bent over and dug through things to find my dye. That's what took me so long. I couldn't find my flower oh. dye. I found it, but it took oh. forever. Oh, I have good. Them. Screwed up is I have them all organized together, but that one was not in with them, and I'm like, what the hell? <laughs> of course, that's yeah, that's always the way. Hey, Stacy, before I forget, what's the name of that? Uh, the printer that you know, the the HP. What is it? The I don't even know the, the number. I don't, I don't know what you're talking about. Which one you're talking about? Laser printer, inkjet printer. The uh, one that I have, yeah. the one that you have, is different. Uh -huh. The one that you have is different now. I don't know what yours is called. I have the seven six four zero or something. Yours is different. Is, is, uh, Stephanie was thinking of getting a printer because of the ink, the the instant ink. She just wanted to kind of know what a good one is. That well, uh, well, I mean, I'm happy with mine, but I can't. You can get the instant ink one, or you can get an Epson and get a well, get a, a continual ink system, which is even cheaper and better. But that's up to you. Uh, you know what you want to do and what you want to spend. Um, that's not the eco dyed, right? No, no. Well, you can get that too. You can get the eco tank, the Epson eco tank, which is where you fill the inks in the tank. It has it in the printer, and though because Epsons are better printers than HP, so uh, you know just. But it depends, you know. Remember, um, she's in Arizona too, and that's all right. Remember, I, they said uh, it's not worth because it'll dry up on you here. Who said that? The places that we went to check on the eco eco dying thing, and they said because it's so dry here. It, yeah, but they're it, in like, a tank; they're not going to dry up. That, well, that's what I thought too. I mean, they're not gonna dry up any more than any of your inks would dry up that are you have in a cartridge. It's not gonna make a difference. Yeah, you know what I mean. Well, that's what I'm, like, that's what I don't I think I'm like. I'm like, are you serious? I mean, I'm yeah, I just think they were trying to sell you a, different, um, a higher price. <laughs> I don't know if it would be cheaper. I would have. Oh. Well, I mean, when this one breaks, I'll still get it. Watch, it'll never yeah. break. I mean. <laughs> I, I would think any of them dry up. See, see, I wanted my faux leather, and these are more vinyl than they are faux leather, but I couldn't oh. find it because it's somewhere in that closet, and I can't find it. There's a couple pieces back here that are more like leather, like that one. I mean, the vinyl's fine. I just really wanted the more faux leather ones, but hmm. aggravating, I couldn't find it. But that's you like okay. your Cheryl? I mean, I don't know anybody who doesn't, but, you know. <clears throat> Canon printer? We had a Canon one time, but it didn't last. Uh, yeah, I don't. Yeah. I don't do Canons either. Yeah. Oh, I don't like Canon. Oh, no, I'm very picky about printers. Yeah. I like. It, it didn't really. I don't know. Open. Let me open. Oh, you signed oh, this. Okay. Keep forgetting. I keep forgetting how this thing opens. <laughs> mm. Oh, this ain't the thing. Oh no. I gotta find oh. the cord. She she just she loves us all. Sure. <laughs> yeah, she loves us all, Mom. Here it is. Yep. Sweet. Damn sweet. I found it. She's on her mother's um um uh, Facebook. <sighs> but that's Aaron. Yeah. <laughs> well, she'll come on with us sometime. Uh, okay. Yeah, what you eating, Steph? Oh, you were getting jack jack in the box. That's right. They have good. Uh, I do have these, which are like suede, like 
feel suede, but suede -ish. And then I grabbed a couple of these, which had some solid color, or grabbed this one because it had some solid colors I can mess with too if I wanted to. I just grabbed the first ones I could find there that would do the trick. <laughs> because, you know. Yeah. Otherwise, I'd be here all day. Yeah, gee, Stephanie, if you know, if you didn't mind buying ink, I'd give you my Epson because I never used it. <laughs> now I bought another one sitting up in the in the closet, but what but of course it's buy? not. I bought that. It, I don't remember, but it's up in the closet. <laughs> I'm putting it on. How long ago did you buy it? Well. It's probably been sitting up there for at least two years, so it's probably like three years. Because maybe it's an eco or no? No, 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 no. Uh -uh. Well, why didn't you use it? I I didn't like the. Was it I didn't cheaper? Like the generic. I the generic. Yeah, I don't think it was very expensive. Yeah, the uh, generic ink and oh, we tried the generic and the regular, which. I think it was maybe the printer that didn't it just was so cheap it didn't look good or something. You know? Oh yeah. I mean if you get one of the ones that are like fifty dollars, I mean mm. Yeah. This was like like a hundred and something, but it was still then cheap. It, you then, know, it, no, then it should have printed better than that. Yeah. I do. We do have and, and I, I, I you we probably do. probably didn't have your settings set right. Yeah, it just was like Okay. I need better scissors than that. I need to cut leather. Oh. oh, Jack and Buck. Oh, yeah. <laughs> There's a lot. You know, when people ask, well, where's this and this? And I'm like, uh, I get confused because we have things like on every corner, <laughs> you'll have the same. I'm like, which one you want? You know, which one you want to take? Mm, I know. Yeah. Oh, you lived in Arizona? Cheryl, where'd you live? Like, what part of Arizona? Um, She's having Jack in the Box, Aaron. Okay, Shazzy. I don't want to this. This? No. I think going to work with that. No. What is this? No, that's the wrong thing. This and this, right? I forget how to do it. I forget how to do it. Was it these two things? No, I don't think it was this thing at all. Actually, I think it was the thinner plates. Stephanie, have you ever had the In-N-Out burger? I don't like it. It's too, uh, this. too, like, healthy <laughs> for me. <laughs> too healthy. <laughs> <laughs> I don't like all that. Uh, I'm missing. I need to find my plate. We see enough. I have the wrong plate. Mesa, okay. My daughter was up in Mesa because she went to ASU, and then she worked in Mesa. But she's, I'm in Peoria, Peoria, Phoenix, Glendale. They, you know how they run together. But okay. she's a friend now. Her friend lived over on this side, and she was over in Tempe, and then mm -hmm. she'd always come over this way. Now her friend moved to Tempe, is going to ASU, and she moved over here on our side. Now she keeps going to Tempe. <laughs> I'm like, what is it? Why do you take turns? So much money for gas. Way too much. 15 years? Really? Oh, wow. No. Oh, my gosh. But he's the, the, uh, the shakes are very good. That's what I really like. Leather gears. Oh, oh my God. Look at that. So cool. Sometimes you might have to clip a little spot to get stuck like right here. It's stuck like by a hair. Sometimes you got to clip it a little bit. Like that. Yeah, one of my friends took me there. I'm like, um, I don't know. I think it was just like too bland maybe. Is what I got, but the shakes and the fries, yeah, definitely. Oh, I like, see, well, I like Subway. Looking at 
Dan Tan. Is that? Wait a minute. I know that name. What? Dan Tan Valley. Is that California? That's terrible. See? No, thank you. That is so cool. Well, that is so cool. Yeah. Years. Oh, years. I don't know where my glasses are, but oh, he doesn't need these. I'll use these ones. Oh, I can see. I can see. I can see. Let's make some. Um, I can see. I can see. <laughs> Let's do some. Let's see your Apache Junction. Oh, okay. Um, my daughter. Uh, works with uh, some autistic uh, uh, kids, and she has a family, I believe, that that's uh, in Apache Junction. She never keeps track of her half the time. That is, yeah, Leticia, that's cool. Can you cut vinyl using manual dyes? What's a manual dye? I've never heard um, of that. Like a like a like a like a die cut machine like what you crank? Yeah, sure. This this would oh. I can use the, a machine that cranks to do this as long as you're using a steel roll die. That's the trick. You can't use a like a finlet, it's not gonna happen, you know. Right. As long as you're using a steel roll die, yeah, you sure can. I'm just using this because I don't like manual crank dies because they hurt my hands. Yeah, they they're yeah. This thing is, uh, if, if you have a Vagabond or one, one that'll fit this, you know, the regular, you can't use, I don't think you can use it in a Gemini, but this plate right here is, oh my God, lifesaver, best thing I've ever seen in my life. It never oh. warps, I've been using it and using it, using it, it doesn't warp because it's made of like solid steel or something, I don't know, I think it's plastic with a solid steel piece in there or something, I don't know, but it does not mm. warp at all, it's like perfectly straight, and this thing makes everything so fantastic. That oh, cool. is yep. I bet you that is kind of like the precision base plate on the big shots because without that. No, the precision base plate will warp. This is better. I have the precision base plate and it came apart and broke because it started to warp and then it busted away from the thing. This one will not do that. So that's why I, I like this one. It's, I think this is this is the uh, a precision base plate. It's the chrome it's chrome precision base plate. It's an upgraded version of the mm. precision base plate. It's a Sizzix chrome precision base plate. Plate. I have the other one. The other one warped and broke. This one has not broken oh. and hasn't even even remotely warped. So that this one's amazing. That must be. Um, I've not heard of that one. The precision base plate uh, from my big shot. I got when I got the big shot. So it's yeah. probably like five years old. And it's yeah. But how many times have you used it? What, every time I use my big shot, which it used to be all the time, you know that. I used to, okay, then it hasn't, yours hasn't warped at all? Not at all, uh-uh. That's surprising because mine did. Mine oh, warped wow. the hell. Really? It broke, popped right out of the thing, yeah. Oh, and then a lot of people, I guess, are having that issue because then okay. they came out with this one. Okay, so is that fairly know. new out? Yeah, or? this has came out in the last, like, two years. Okay, that's probably why I just didn't, yeah, because but when I need another one, I'll definitely... <laughs> Yeah. Maybe average. Neat. My hubby. Oh, really? I think that's die cuts yeah, with it. Flowers. Yeah. Ooh, that's really that's cool. cool. That's I'm gonna cut a different color so I can put them together with a different color. A different color. Oh, you're in Ohio. I'm in Arizona. We're part of Ohio. We lived there a couple places. I'm originally from Erie, Pennsylvania, but Ashtabula, Painesville, and then let's see, I'm going to get it mixed up. There's Palms Rivers in New Jersey. The yep. Perry Nuclear Power Plant. That's where Dwayne worked out there. Nuclear power. It's part of Ohio. What state do I live in? 
for oh I'm missing, I would I'm missing, I'm missing. I'm missing. I'm in two square head. That is you got a square or not a square head, but a oblong head. He kind of looks cute that way. I don't know, I might keep his head like that. It looks cute. I like his head like that. <laughs> yeah. I was messing with it when I was looking at the chat. <laughs> not around anymore. I'm gonna keep that one. I'm gonna leave it. Somewhere. This vial is pretty thick too. It's not like lightweight stuff. I can keep these and use them for something. Okay, Mary Jane. That's so cool. Oh, Famous Dave's. Oh my gosh, yeah, that's just down from us. I love Famous Dave's. I haven't been there in a long time, but we used to go there all the time, get the ribs. We started cooking them at home, but <laughs> still very good. It's right along the uh, 83rd Avenue where they have all the restaurants, right along the strip there. It's kind of cool. That would be cute flower. Oh, that's really cute. Wow. I can do this little one. I can do a little one. And then I can Baby. do this one and put something in the middle of it. Make all kinds of flowers. Flowers. All kinds of flowers. Pretty flowers. Mm hmm that took a long time to get the, my die cuts. Um, I still have some around, but I took, you know, as many as I, I mean, they were all over. So I got those together and at least put the like ones together. So I still, I know I'm going to find them around. Me. That took forever to get those together because I had a million and one of those. A million and one of what? Of uh, the die, different die cuts. Because, you know, it's been oh. trying to, oh, you never know. I might as well cut them ahead of time. <laughs> yeah. Like, so that's why, you know, I was cutting and cutting and cutting. And I don't think I use very many, but I had to cut them. You know what he reminds me of? The little Michelin tire guy? I don't know. You know <laughs> yeah. <laughs> He's a little, little bigger tummy. Oh, there. Oh, wow. I've not been past. Oh, 35th. Okay. Yeah. yeah. I'm sure they have the other ones there, too. Yeah. I live by the Arrowhead Mall. There's a mall right here. I went to the Arrowhead Mall when I was there. Yeah. That's the mall that me and my niece went to. Are apple trees. Apple. Oh, apple trees. Finally grew large enough this year. Oh. Oh, wow, Lakeisha, that's cool. Mm. Oh, you got apples on your apple tree? That's cool. Lorraine, oh, right on the, okay, Lake Erie? Yeah, that's cool. Because I was only like five miles from the lake <laughs> in Erie. Yep, it's a lake effect. Yeah, that sounds really good. Let's see. So, we have to be at that hospital at six. We have to leave at six because it only takes like like fifteen minutes, not even to get there. On Tuesday, at right? Hospital. Yes. Yeah, he is on Tuesday. I might cut these together. Early. In Payson, okay. That's where we used to have our little retreats for our group. Payson's pretty. That and Prescott. Very pretty there. I think Dwayne cut that. <laughs> I know you had that little, the yucca tree out in the front that has all the 
it's part I guess it's part of the aloe vera you know plant thingy but anyway it has these things that grow out of the middle and has flowers on it and stuff and he says he went out and he trimmed it I go I hope you didn't trim too much because you can't trim a lot off that thing and it won't look good. And he's like, no, no, no. I saw it. I'm like, oh boy. <laughs> he, yeah, he cuts things so he doesn't have to cut them again in like a year. <laughs> it was like, mm, yeah, it was a little, it was a little chopped up. But, you know, well, it was with that or do it myself, right? Oh, happy to jump to give to our neighbor. Oh, wow. Hey. We're going to get after our new neighbors that are next to us to cut the tree because they have the the big tree over there. And the, the, lead, the limbs are getting so big now. One is actually hanging right over the house. I mean, touching the house. That's not good. Oh. Mm -hmm. So, I'm like, yeah, because we'll end up getting damage from it, end up paying for it. Mm. So, break some but, balls, Jenny. I know. I'm going to have to it's crack like, them. Neutral. Oh. Color and brown flour. Mm -hmm. You can mix and match with these. I know it's not flour. Okay, just keep them on hand and make flowers galore. Yeah. Use them. I'm going to go video chat and chat with Judy. Oh, Judy and Aaron are the same person. That's her oh. mother's uh, thing there. Um, but it's Aaron. Okay, we'll see you in a little bit. Okay. Take care. We don't see you later. Oh, yeah, the sunflower. My sister used to like the, the sunflower seeds. She's, I tried, but I'm like, um, I like the salt. <laughs> I have to spit the seed out. I don't know why. I mean, it just wasn't <laughs> with the sunflowers. Let's see, green and what other color? It's hard to see the. Black, black, black mat. Whoa. And Dwayne was telling Peyton, You're calling tomorrow. I said, I'm not calling in tomorrow's my first day of school. <laughs> He's like, No, I mean your client. She goes, No, I need the money. Who I said know. that? I have a uh, Peyton, she I have a feeling. I think mm, Sicky McGee needs to stay home. If she was that sick, she went out the other night. Okay, good night, Heather. We don't see you later. Bye. I mean, she was supposed to be going out with her friend, and so how do you do that when you're sick? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. But I don't know. I could be wrong. <laughs> Doubt it, but <laughs> Dwayne says, We well, should just keep Sophia overnight because he goes, Then I'm gonna have to go tomorrow because he volunteered to pick Sophia up on school days because it's very early and her school's right by where she is. And he says, Well, why drive over here and drop the dog? Which is, I guess, he wants to go do it, but. I said, nope, let her take Sophia home for the night, and then you go pick her up, because Sophia needs to be over there sometimes, even if it's just asleep. Oh, 
I've got my thing caught on the thing. My thing caught on the thing. You got your thing caught on the thing. Yeah, I don't think it cut all the way through these because I uh, I was trying to see if I how much I can cut through. So I'm gonna take and we'll, well, I'll take these off and see if I can't line it back up to get those on. I usually can. Okay, yeah, cut through all of it except for like one, two actually. Okay. I'll line it back up and see if I can't get it to sit straight on there. <laughs> You're right. You're doing Ricky break. That's what I thought too. First thing I thought, this dude, we're Ricky a break. Yeah, right? He doesn't need a break, right, don't he? <laughs> I know. <laughs> These all cut. Yeah, he really snapped at her. And mm -hmm. then I look over and then she's biting his head again. <laughs> but he heard him. He was like, ah. <laughs> well, she'll learn. Well, maybe not, but <laughs> she's. Oh, she's <laughs> Gets her good. She'll learn. Look at how much hair I pulled. <laughs> it's not funny, but look at this. Oh my god, that was her tail. She was. She, I didn't feel her try to get out, but she must have. I must have been on her tail with the wheel. <laughs> I was like, I didn't mean to laugh, but I was like, oh my god. And then she was pawing at it, trying to get it on the wheel. <laughs> Poor Sophia. She <laughs> took a big hunk out of her. Poor little thing. Her on her tail. <laughs> I know. She didn't squeal or nothing, so I was thinking that she was, you know, probably got up and trying to, and then realized that she was stuck and then hurried up and, but I didn't even feel her pulling. Yeah. I looked down and saw the tail under me. I'm like, oh my God. She just send her home. She didn't have no tail. I know. <laughs> Those two tails, groomers, but what is that? What's what's that? Those broom tails. Broom tails. You mean her fluffy tail? The fluffy. Yeah, it looks. It's so you know because she always has it up, and it looks like a waterfall. Mm -hmm. That's how our peak was. Yeah, it's really pretty. We had I take some of this off the tail because it's getting to be too much, but it's pretty. <laughs> Dwayne's like, hey, why don't you just take the hair off of her tail altogether so you don't have to? She's like, what? And I'm like, oh, do I, no. You know what? <laughs> no, 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 no. Just take her tail off. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it's really pretty. I don't think she's brushing her. Again. I mean, Go to the party. I know why I'm gonna go after the tree. Oh, I'll be right back. I don't have to worry about her. Are they I'm gonna go past here. Yeah, she wants to go out so she can have a treat. Um. <laughs> trying to cut out because I screwed up that last one. By pushing it to the limits. And now I just dropped it into the garbage can. No more thick black. I don't know. I don't care. I can't be bothered. I don't know where it went. Oh, there it is. Never mind. It's so tiny. I was like going to leave it. <laughs> but I'm trying to clean it up because this is the one that I screwed up and had to reline it up. And it didn't line up perfectly, but it's fine. It's just not. I didn't line them up perfect. Mm 
but yeah, this one, this is something you can use the fabric sample books for if you don't, you know, do a lot of fabric stuff or like, you know, like you don't sew and all that. You can make these, but also how cute would it be if you did sew and you made like little stitching around the edges of it? Mm, how cute would that be? Like around each flower and then put it together. You can use these as appliques on clothing. Like if you want to dress up something you got, you know, because obviously it'll stay permanently and you can wash it. I feel like this one here is like cut wonky. See how it's like cut a little wonky? I just have to cut around, cut the excess off because I put it in the thing and maybe this one. This is a little dulled out like crazy. Okay. What are you guys working on? Anything? Come on, cut, fool. Not perfect, but it'll do. Next time I won't try to cut so many at once. Four would have been sufficient of those because they're thinner than the than the, the fake leather ones. But instead, I tried to cut like six. <laughs> I like to push things to the limits. But anyway, you can use them together and do like some of them like that. Oh, this color. Even that one I cut. I was like on the edge of being too many. I cut it, but so yeah, four is definitely the limit of these thinner kind of like suede pieces. Oh, suede. Those cut out okay. Okay. Cool. Lots of flowers. I'm gonna just cut up a bulk of them and then I can move the machine and sit and put together the flowers. That'll be fun. The flurs. Put together the flurs. Here I'll cut this. I should just cut all these pages out. If I had a good razor blade over here, I would it would be quicker and easier, but I'm not, well, actually, maybe this one. This one should be fairly sharp. Yeah, see, it's quicker. Razor. Are they all good now? They are. You know what they got? <laughs> I went across the, like, oh, I see a flower over there because, you know, I'm trying to get flowers to do the hibiscus, the dying. And uh, I saw a flower that. I to Your pick. hibiscus are dying? No, remember, I was going to pick a bunch of flowers and then boil oh. it and try some dyeing. Oh, oh yeah. Yeah. Oh, but dying. Oh. <laughs> I thought yeah. you were saying that my biscuit plant was dying. I'm like, well, oh, no. I think dying like <laughs> the, yeah. the other dying. Yeah, the, the other mm -hmm. dying. Well, I went across, oh, I see a plant or a flower. So I went and kind of crept across the, the grass there. By the time I got over there, I'm like, 
what am I doing? Do I want, I was like, I don't want a creature crawling up in my pants again, remember? <laughs> I'm like, what, what the heck? It's dark in here and I'm creeping across the grass. Mm. Ew. Anything could be lurking. I need to get back. Yes. It, did, it happened when I was right on the patio, which is, you know, cement. Here I'm in the grass. Mm. Yeah, I forgot that, but I did that flower. Like the old time. Oh, cool. Oh, for chemo hats. Oh, that's cool, Amy. Oh. What happened? That'd be really neat. Um, Amy said she plans on taking her fabric flowers and gluing them on hats, like the old hmm. time swimming hats. Kind of for oh, oh, that would be so house. cool. I know. That's neat. Little books. Stamping. That would be so cute. I know. If you make them out of the vinyl, it might even be better. Because if you make them out of fabric, they might, uh, they might just kind of like... Unless you're... And like, you know how sometimes they'll make them in their... And they're like only the center is glued onto the hat or whatever and like the the petals are left fluffy but if you get it wet it's going to flop whereas these might be a little stiffer i don't know oh yeah yeah i, mean, I see what you're saying or if you're going to put it unless you're going to put it like on there like even the petals and everything glued down completely yeah oh I bet you they would be. Yeah, the hospital? Sure. I bet you. That would be so neat. It's not hard to do this. It's harder to do it with the scissors. So much easier to do it with a sharp blade just to go just go across. I mean, unless you're going to take this whole thing apart, which that's too much of a pain in the ass for me for this. That Katie, she must be sleeping, huh? <laughs> mm hmm. It's definitely like, Katie, where are you? Is she think Janie thinks she's going to invoke her. <laughs> I keep saying her name. <laughs> I know. Katie, hello. Okay, all together now. I think, Katie. She went to bed. I think she probably went to bed. Yeah. Let's call her and wake her up. She didn't answer no, me back. Hmm. She didn't answer me back, so I'm assuming she went to bed. Oh, yeah. Usually she'll answer her text, you know, her messages pretty quick, within like a half hour if she's awake. It's just hard to get an angle on this to, to do it. That's all. Med check. I miss you, Katie. Where are you? Nightbot? Oh, yeah. He's the auction mod all the time. Night's not. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah. All right. He's a snot. Snot. Snotty boy. Sure is. Yes, I got. Where did I put him? Oh. I have a few in there. I got a few. Ow! Oh. Mm. That would be really cool, Amy, to make cute little swim caps. Mm -hmm. Good idea. Good idea. Little flowers for swim caps. That'd be so cute. Yeah. Just cut it all out of the book. Why not? I lost my ears. I could do it all today. Oh, 
can go off anything. You can cut, use any of the steel wool dies and make little appliques and things for anything, you know, fabric journals or fabric pillows. You know, it would be cute to have like, you know, that they have the dress form. The, oh, uh, yeah. The, uh, the steel wool dress form. I have that one too. I have uh, the butterflies would be cute, and you could put them like on the front of a pillow, or you know, and they could be the faux leather or the spokes suede. They'd be cute little accents on things, you know. Yeah, yeah, it oh, would be. All right. Oh, I've got it. Oh, pieces. Squishing these on my. There, before you on this poor little booty doll. One. These should be easy to get out here. Get out my way. <laughs> out my way, flowers. Out my Mother. way. Mother. Mary. Hi, Mary. Would you stop holding on on the corner, please? Thank you. What you doing now? Project crafting. You know, mm. that kind of thing. Suede, I guess, is the best way to describe it. Oh, that sounds cool. Let me put this garbage can under where this keeps flying on my leg. Instead of my leg, it'll go into the can, hopefully. Well, kind of. Mm -hmm. Oh, your nebulizer. How's that going, Mary? Are you, uh, Did you end up quitting, or I know it. Quitting what? Time before smoking. She didn't try smoking. Yeah. Uh oh, oh, that's right. I remember you mentioning that, didn't you? Yeah, it's been a while, but. Yeah. Floops. Gotta get off all the floop. Floops. Little floops. Strings. You know, little bits I don't like. Little bits. I don't like the bits. Bits and bits and bits. Bits and bits. <laughs> bits. <laughs> Oh, good, good. 
hey, when I always tried, then I thought, hey, you know, it's better than, hi, Linda, you know, than what I Linda used to do. Oh, that's good. Yeah. Yep. Anything is, is yeah. good, in my opinion. I went down from four packs to three packs and 19 cigarettes. I cannot believe you smoke four packs a day. Like, honestly, I cannot believe you smoke four packs a day. And for how long did you do that for? Well, I would probably say, probably when I was like, I'm going to say 20 to 33. Because I smoked before well, that, but I don't think I smoked. You know. Something about you is you definitely yeah. don't do anything half acidly. <laughs> no. You're gonna do it. You're gonna do it all the way. <laughs> uh huh. <laughs> oh yeah. Hmm. Yes, I did. Oh boy. Shouldn't be yanking on things. What you up to, Linda? Linda. Linda, Linda. How would you how did how did the day the day go? Were you glitched out? <laughs> Shelly. Hi, Shelly. How that hurt. No, definitely not contagious. So for sure. My son's like, oh my god, we have babies all day. Oh, I know. That's good. No doubt, Linda. <laughs> They're so cute. They are so cute. We have little faces. Hmm. Are we able to just sit back, sort of, and Leather wasn't, or the faux leather wasn't the mess. It was cutting that other book with a razor that was just slicing shreds out of it. Oh. Same time, it was. Oh. Oh, little, you know how I feel about little fabric bits everywhere. Oh, yeah. Me, especially. And they were just all over the place. Hmm. fun? Yeah. I bet. Oh, were you with the grandkids today? Okay. Oh, that was a pain in my ass. Gee, you probably sucked in so much of that. It, you know. I don't care, right? <laughs> what difference does it make? It'll come out in the wash. 
Yep, it'll all come out <laughs> the end. It'll come out the end. <laughs> yes, exactly. <laughs> exactly. Up to work, yeah. There you go. Mm -hmm. big. Oh, no. oh, very oh. Trees. Oh. oh, my friend had a mulberry. Well, she has a mulberry tree, but whenever it would grow the mulberries, because I know I had never had them at that time, but then she's like, try them. Oh, they were. Mulberry. I ate every one I could find on that tree. Oh, mulberry, big juicy one. Oh, they were good. They were delicious. Yep. Oh, growing too close. Okay, yeah. Oh. <laughs> you don't like them. <laughs> I remember when Peyton was little, we'd go over there and be like fighting over the mulberries. Give me that one. No, I want that one. Mm -hmm. Thank you. I'm going to try putting this down. I'm going to on top of this. It's not the noise. Why? Oh. Ew. Well, mm -hmm. see, I ate them all. <laughs> the flies didn't have time to be attracted. Uh, mm -hmm. Three. I didn't as good as the last mm -hmm. time. Not cool, man. Not cool. Feed cord. <laughs> oh, <laughs> oh Linda. Just do two. Mm. So that was real good. <laughs> oh, think, this corn's going to be good. This is sweet. Mm. What's that mean? Sounds like something's breaking. Yeah, that sounded weird. Well, it's, I, don't know, I guess it's just what it sounds like. Yeah. Yeah, you know now. I have some corn in there. I ended up getting some more because the ones I had in there, I'm like, oh, I should eat that. Well, I think they were in there a little bit too long because when I, I took them, you know, I husked them, they looked, well, I mean, they weren't, well, actually, one was moldy. <laughs> Throw it out. Yeah, I'm notorious <laughs> at getting things, and then they go bad. Like, uh, but I need it too, though. Yeah, it's like oh, no. buy a pineapple but, and then never get cut up. I see that. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> but, yeah. Hopefully, it's only two dollars, but usually. Yeah. Now this corn was was it was cheap. The other ones I just cut off. The, I mean, they weren't moldy. The other two, they just. You know, had kind of shriveled up, so I just cut the shriveled up ones off. <laughs> they were fine, but then he got some more. This week. Eat them. We have gum gum trees. This is a paper bark. This 
Oh. Oh. Ooh. Ooh. It's expensive. Six hundred or two thousand. Oh, I cut myself. Oh, you got a paper cut or a cut cut? Oh, paper on the cut. No, I'm fine. It's fine. Ooh. I think those cuts like if they, they kind of like they hurt but they burn more than anything. It's like yeah, it it's really cut as much as I thought it did, but Oh good. Oh good. <sighs> yeah, pain in the ass. Yeah. Is there... yeah. Oh. Oh. Make sure I don't do twice. Good Yeah, right, Leticia? That's what it is. I don't get it. Hmm. Kind of like, I, this has nothing to do, I'm not comparing, but talk about ignorant. When I went to, <laughs> went to visit my sister, and uh, when she lived in Florida, this is a while back, like quite a long time back. But uh, I went there, and she, her dog kind of had fleas, and if there's a flea, it'll find me. Well, I was bent <laughs> from head to toe <laughs> the whole time. It was so, I was so miserable. And we went swimming. Uh, I was like in an indoor pool or something. Well, and you know, I had bites all over me. Well, not like a ton of them, but I was standing there and this lady kind of swam over to me. And my sister was there too. And when we get going, it's like <laughs> laughing or whatever. We can't stop. Well, this lady goes, she goes, what are those on your legs? Are, are they contagious? And I'm like, See? no, they're just flea bites. And she even said again, well, maybe you should swim in the pool because, I mean, aren't they contagious? I'm looking at my sister. She's behind the lady. And what? she just swam. She was like dying laughing. I'm like, flea oh, bites? Are you contagious? <laughs> I know. I'm like, no what? bite is contagious. <laughs> I mean, I mean, so oh. I mean, unless you get rabies and then you bite somebody else or something. But, I, know. <laughs> I mean, even that's not contagious unless you bite somebody. No singular bite is just going to be contagious. Like, oh, here, I can put my mosquitoes. Oh, don't let me catch it. I know. I'm <laughs> thinking, did I miss something here? Or yeah, what? <laughs> you missed something in biology, apparently. Oh, no. I was sitting there going, huh? <laughs> I was so young then, probably now I would be like, uh, <laughs> yeah. Right, you lady. Weird. It's contagious. We were dying laughing. I was like, <laughs> didn't know nothing That's for sure. I'm just cutting a whole bunch of flowers out. Then I'll have some for when I want to play. Yeah. I don't need them today. Build a flower. Yeah. I think that's how the steel rule sounds on the on the uh, on that metal cutting plate underneath the chrome plate. Oh, <laughs> that's right. Plate, you know. I, yeah, you know, I noticed. Crunchy, crunchy, crunchy. Yeah, making. Mm -hmm. It's mostly for intricate dies, but I find it works well with the steel rule too. Mm. To make sure everything cuts nice and straight or straight through. Yeah. And it doesn't warp, so you don't have to worry about it eventually warping because mine's never warped. Wow. Because, you it had that. Warp, because it doesn't warp, it seems to make it so that this one doesn't really warp either. You know what I mean? Because that oh, one, gee, that by now, this would be warped. But because I've been using it with the precision base, but it hasn't been like getting like that, which nice. is, you know, weird. So I go through, yeah, those plastic yeah. things are just like, no matter how much I turn them and, mm -hmm. you know, whatever, it's, you know. Yeah. They should come up with two like this to put in, two of these metal plates instead of the... They probably will. It's well, no, they just want they want you to keep on buying their plates, I think. Yeah, that's true. 
they make money off of the buy and keep having to buy the plates and whatnot. I mean, if they make it indestructible, mm -hmm. then how are they supposed to make money on your repeat business? That's <laughs> right. Yeah, right, Leticia? Jeez. Oh. Hmm. Wow. Mm, I've seen that one. Should have been looked at before. Maybe I just didn't get it. It didn't seem like scary to me, but maybe it was just because I don't I don't really remember it that well now, but children of the corn. Mm. <laughs> what about it? And Diana was asking if she, uh, Linda saw the children of the corn <laughs> because of the <laughs> corn deal she was talking about. Oh, I was that out three by accident? I think I did. Oh, put on. I think I did. Oh, imagine going in there like for mazes and getting lost. I got lost in a corn <laughs> maze years, years and years ago. Did you really? Oh, I wasn't like lost forever, but I was in there with my friend and we got lost and we were just laughing because we couldn't find our way out. And then it was starting to get dark and I'm like, oh, we better find oh. our way out instead of messing around. Oh my God. And we followed up this other family who seemed to have figured it out. And they kept saying, this is, for kids, this is too rough to get out. We, I'm glad we, they were saying they were glad they didn't let their seven-year-old one to go by himself with this, with the, somebody else, oh. with friends. He's like, I'm glad I didn't wow. let them go by themselves. Mm -hmm. I'm like, yeah, I'm an adult. I can't find my way out. I said, <laughs> we, laughing cause we couldn't find our way out for like an hour. I mean, we were screwing around in there and like scaring people and this, that, and the other. Like, I, but then all of a sudden we realized, okay, we've been in here a long time and we still haven't found our way out. <laughs> oh my! God. I don't think I could step foot in one of those things without having a, a panic attack. Well, they a lot think... of them have like, uh, like they'll give you like, you know, clues to get out. But <laughs> there are things that'll get you out. But on the one we were in didn't. But ever since then, like this was in my twenties. And ever since then, anyone I've gotten in, there was always like clues to get out. You know what I mean? Whereas that one was just like very piss poorly made, I think. Yeah. Wow. But a lot of people are getting a little lost. But I mean, they don't. If you were to get that lost, I mean, they're not going to let you stay in there. They usually come in, the owners of the thing, because even the guy said when I when it came out, he, he was like cleaning up the front because it was getting dark. And he goes, I was just about to come in and make sure nobody else was in there because oh yeah you have to go in at night and you know or before they close <laughs> up and just check make sure there's no kids or nobody in there you sure. know? Right, like, hey, yeah. you guys came out I'm like yeah we got lost Imagine. Stuck mm -hmm. in there till morning or something it was a big one it was a big corn maze and they called it like oh. the most difficult corn maze or something like that too so <laughs> probably oh, wow. but i've never been in one Pain. like that since you know painter friends used to go like to those type of things for Halloween, you know, when they were young. Yeah. Stuff, but I'd be like, okay, whatever. <laughs> I have to cut that one out. I'm done. I'm going to do one at a time for a while. Stupid things. Some of them are thicker than others, I guess, and they get, they don't want to cut all the way. <clears throat> Some of the pieces. Plus this tattered flower dye. I mean, I've had this thing for so many years. I, I mean, it probably, it's probably like, you know, after a while, over time, they start to dull, you know? Yeah. I mean, it's not, it's fine, but it's probably not as sharp as it used to be anyway. Right. I mean, it's only going to be as sharp as the blades on it are, you know? Yeah. There. Yeah. At some point, the, you know, basically it's a blade. I think I'm not sure is if it's a blade or just like a. Uh, yeah, I, don't know. I think it's, it is it's metal, but yeah. Because I mean, on a thinlet die, they're not blades either. You know, they're just metal that when you put pressure on it, it cuts. So I think that mm -hmm. might be what this is, but still. Yeah. Yeah. If you use it, you know. Yeah. Have a lot. Pull out. 
Yeah. That's fine as long as I'm cutting through one. I can cut through two as long as I cut two. A couple of them are thicker, and I kept cutting, forgetting that. And like these are a little thicker with the with the ones with these designs on it. And I kept cutting two of these oh. together or three, and then I'd be like, "Well, damn it!" And then it would get stuck, mm. and I'm like, you know, and the edges would get stuck a little bit, and I'm and I kept forgetting. So that's why I'm like, "Well, I'm just gonna do one at a time, so I can't forget." So yeah. I forget the count. And I'd be like, "Wait, how many things I put in there?" Oh, I don't know. It's fine. <laughs> I just did it. Mm. I'm just gonna yeah, cut like, a crap ton of flowers. Maybe oh, I'll open okay. baggies of flowers and put them in the auction too next week. Oh, yeah, that's a good them. idea. And then people can use them for making their flowers. Right. See, fabric books work great for that, especially these little flat, you know, fabric books and the ones that are like suede and stuff. The fake leathers and stuff. I wish I could find my other fake leather one because I have a really nice fake leather book. I just don't know where the hell it is. It's somewhere in that closet, but I didn't, I couldn't really dig in there very much, but it is in there. Oh, uh, Leticia wants to know how long have you had your Vagabond and if you like it. It's worth the oh, I love my Vagabond. And I've had it for like probably two years. I always get it confused, but this is the one, this was gift. This is the thing. This was gifted to me. I got around the same time. I got two things. Um, I got a uh, the Zyron, the newer Zyron, and I bought that one on eBay. And this I got from somebody that watches my channel. A lady got this for me. Um, uh, but I always get it confused, and I say that I got the Vagabond and she got me the Zyron, but it's the other way around. I always flip mm -hmm. flop because I got them around the same time. But it was she got me this this one, and before that. You know, I, I got the, the Gemini, but, and I love the Gemini, but it does not cut. I love how big it is. I can fit a lot of dies on it at once, um, but it doesn't cut steel rule dies. That's the only downfall of it. So one cuts my <laughs> one dies. And I, I like this because of the plate too. See, this plate doesn't work with the, the Gemini. So I'm at some point, you know, if, if I, if, I can't decide if I want to keep the Gemini. I mean, it was gifted to me by Marie and you know, oh, yeah. I don't want to give it away unless she's okay with it, you know, but sure. at some point I want to pass it along, you know, since she gifted mm -hmm. it to me. If, if I find that I use this more and that precision base plate works good for me and this works, then I'm going to pass on the other one, the Gemini to somebody else, you know, that right. I come across or something, you know, like as like a little happy male or something that who doesn't have one or whatever. But right. I'm, I'm waiting to see if I really you know, which one I really like the best, which I'm thinking it's going to be this one only because I like to have my steel rule dies and I can't cut those with the other one. Yeah. So, you know, either one of them, if, you know, because she gifted it to me a, you know, a couple of like three years ago, I would right. gift it to anybody else. You know, I'm sure she would want me to. Oh, sure. Yep. But I'll also message her first before i would do that because I, she did give it to me and i wouldn't want her if she wants it back she can have it you know right. but i wouldn't, I wouldn't want to gift it out without her knowing or being okay with that yeah yeah i do think so. oh i, I know linda yeah wedding and i think i don't know rumor has it that tim holtz is coming out with another vagabond but it's going to be like better because mm. i really like the vagabond to be honest the only thing i don't like about it are these little side walls that are on the this area here i don't like those i don't know what the purpose of them are but i don't like them that's the only thing i don't like otherwise i love this thing i think it's i think it's you know very powerful it works really good it's compact because you fold it up and it's just like little so yeah. i do like it I like that it isn't, I, one thing I really don't like about the Gemini is that once you start putting that mat, the, your plates in, it just automatically grabs it. I kind of don't like that because oh. I always forget and get fumble fingered with, oh, you know, wait, it's in raw or it's in crooked. And I have to like keep hitting the button to make it go the other way and like stop it. Whereas this, I have to keep my uh. hand on the button. So as soon as it goes crooked, I can stop. You know what I mean? Like, and I'm not getting like, oh no, you know, like. <laughs> Like, yeah, like you can't get going. That's the only reason I don't like that one, the 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 automatic feeding on that one, is it kind of like throws me off sometimes, mm -hmm. and I forget what to do when it if I don't yeah. want it to keep going for just whatever reason. Suck it in. <laughs> You're yeah. like, wait, it does. It just sucks it right in. I'm just like, uh, <laughs> wait a minute. Exactly. 
Hmm. Yeah, I probably wouldn't care for that either because I probably do that a lot. So. And the rounded top? And the round oh, yeah, the rounded top of the Gemini. But that's like, that's nitpicky, but oh, it is a pain in the ass. Because when I go to put my, I this, I can't put my plates on this one because it's got a handle. But that one, it's kind of like you almost, because it's so big and like wide, you and you have to like, I don't know. I feel like I need to put the plates on top of it for some reason. I don't know why I don't feel that way with this one. Maybe it's just a stupid hmm. habit. I don't know. Because of the way it sits, I don't know. But hmm. I always feel like the top should be flat <laughs> on that thing because it's rounded and you can't plates on top of it when you're done now why don't you like the side you said side walls on that yeah what, these are they getting away here are kind of annoying because when you go to put these in it just fits these plates like just fit in between the side walls so if you don't get them in right oh, it could oh. like do weird things so that's why you got to watch but i wish yeah. they would have it with this i don't understand the purpose of the side walls i mean is there a reason is it just like i don't hmm. know but I don't really care for those, the side walls on it because it has these like lips on either side that stick up. And I don't but like just said Maybe they're in there so things don't move around. Maybe yeah, I guess, but no other die cutter has that. And I just don't understand, yeah. you know, because like it, this literally just fits in here. I mean, I don't have a problem with anything moving around in any of the other die cutters I have. So I don't, you know, or, or have hmm. had. So I don't really know, but I don't know. That's the only thing I would say to, that they can omit from the next one is get rid of that feature yeah. and either make it a little wider or, you know, whatever. But I don't really like those side walls. I just don't feel like they're necessary. Not necessary. Not necessary. I like that. Yeah, all right, Leticia, yeah. Get their brains and wonder why they do things the way they do, you know? This on there, if I'm not mistaken. It's a little warped, I'll go down. Do Stephanie? 
What you gonna craft? Me. What are you doing with all that trunk? All that trunk up in that trunk. <laughs> what you gonna do? What you gonna do? Oh, what you gonna do? What? What? Probably nothing. Mm. Nothing. Why nothing? I don't know. Why? 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 Oh, <laughs> Marcia said, sorry, I fell asleep. I'm fade up now. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks, Marcia. <laughs> this is funny. Yes, we got Asleep. I was like, I bet you fell asleep. Yep. Mm -hmm. No motivation. Yeah. Well, you made some pretty pages the other night, though. Yeah. I can motivate you. Yeah, see? You're motivated. <laughs> <laughs> there you go. Did you feel that? Do it. <laughs> I love seeing you create, Stephanie. It's sad when you say you're not motivated. Yeah. You make such pretty things. I love that page you did last night. Mm -hmm. How can you not be motivated after making such a pretty thing? I know. Really? Say, hey, look what I did, guys. Such a pretty thing. I'm thinking this dye is starting to get a little dull. So I bet you if I get the dress form dye or something else, it, it'll cut through. Because this was cutting perfect before, but now all of a sudden it's like, all right, starting to. Because <laughs> you cut a lot of fabrics, dulls things, I guess. Yeah. It's just being ornery. How did you know how I feel? <laughs> oh, not motivated. She knows, see? <laughs> yes. Yes, Miss Marsha. Can I get the one piece out? Oh, did it fall on my lap? No. Let me go get um another dive. Wait. 
Waverly. I'm going over some good ones I think would work with fabrics. I have this other flower guy. Butterflies and birds and things. Oh, wow, Marsh, that's terrible. Oh. This one. Oh. What happened? A friend on Facebook uh, she went to school with her 16 year old niece was swept away oh, in the blood. Oh, no. Wow. That's horrible. Oh. Scary. That's yeah, this freaking crap is. Mm. Crazy. Mm. Yeah. Wow. I just heard about it today. I didn't even realize there was flooding because it's not where I am exactly. And I, I hadn't been following the news or anything. So I was like shocked. I was like, damn, there was flooding? I didn't even think it rained enough to flood. Yeah, I think I saw with, uh, with Shelly when I was reading uh, that Waverly. Yeah. Tennessee. Oh. 16. Hmm. Bird. Oh, and Dixon, and she's not. Yeah, see, I'm closer to Dixon than I am Waverly, and we, and yeah, Dixon is closer to me. Yeah. Tennessee is a relatively large state. But. Did I swing it? 
Sounds like it, Marsha. It's a lot. Deal with all that. Oh, wow. It, that's in one week. Jesus. Mm. That's terrible. Mm. It's hard to hear that. Mm, it's got to be depressing and stressful. Yeah. Yeah, I remember that, Marsha. Super bad thunderstorms. Yeah, I remember. thing happened to one of my friends in high school. Her boyfriend was, you know, doing all kinds of crazy maneuvers and then went around a car and hit a tree and it was a mess.
husband would know. He said the camera driver wasn't wearing a seatbelt. Uh-oh. Oh. <sighs> it's terrible. Oh. Oh, boy. Wow. That's weird because when you said about seatbelt, my best friend in, in high school, she um, married him. I think, yeah, Dwayne and I both went to the wedding. And then, you know, went to the apartment and everything. And she, she lived in the area. She had a pretty big family. And um, he was part of the, like, the JC, JC, kind of, uh, kind of like a lot the Lions Club, you know, just like a club. And um, the JV Club, you mean? I think it's called JCs. Oh. JC, JC Club. I, don't know. I think, but uh, <laughs> um, great couple, and they had, I don't know, let's see. Rebecca was one, and they had the boy was Andrew. He was like, they're pretty close together, like two and a half, and the least it was like three and a half or something. But anyway, then her husband worked nights, and he went around a sharp curve, and it was that night, and supposedly hit a deer. Hmm. And they said something about not wearing a seatbelt. And she said, that's very, because Bob was always very, like, you put your seatbelt on. You have to have it on. Right. Huh. And he flew and he broke his neck. And he was in a coma for a long time. Wow. Never, basically, never came out of it, really ended up in a nursing home. And she held on, of course, for, you know, years. And her kids were very young, uh, obviously, at the time. And hmm. um, and as time went on, I remember saying to her, Cheryl, you know, it's just something, I, I, you know, I'm not in the position, but do you think, you know, for your sake, you should move on? And nope, nope. Hmm. That was, she was, I'm going to stand by him. I'm like, okay, well. And, and then she ended up, she had cancer, and then she, she had cancer, like, go to one area and another area and another area. Mm -hmm. um, then she had, like, these cortisone shots, and she, not cortisone, but uh, some kind of shots that blew, her face, like, blew up. I remember when we went to visit Dwayne's parents, and... She came over to visit, and I'm like, oh, my. She didn't even look like her. didn't recognize her. Hmm. And um, I remember I was uh, not babysitting, dog sitting for my hmm. neighbor back at the other house, which ended up that, that neighbor, you know. But we had a, we watched their house uh, a few times when they went on vacation. And they said, you know, Go ahead, do what you want. It was like 4th of July or something. And I think I had come home from a trip from my group and walking in and Dwayne's like, sit down. I'm like, what? So she, she had died. She died her, I think she was, she was 46. And I remember her sitting there you know, when she had all that going on and we would talk on the phone, she said, she goes, Jane, what, I mean, why do you think these things happen to good people? <laughs> I'm like, Cheryl, mm. I don't know. I don't know. Yeah. Like, oh my God. And she ended up, and then her older daughter had called later on and said, you know, thanks for being such a good friend. She talked about you all the time and, you know, and I'm like, well, you know, kind of a, it's a high school friend that you were friends with for yeah. a long time. But it's just so sad to see, you know, people go through that. And 
what her mm. kids must have went through with both of her parents. Oh yeah, like that. Oh my god, that's it's sad. Terrible. Yeah, good thing they had a big family like they did because um, the sister was able to take care of the kids, and even my my one brother went to school with one of the brothers, one of their brothers, and uh, kind of knew the one of the sisters. So my 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 two brothers and sister ended up knowing some of their family because they were such a huge family. Mm -hmm. But it's just sad. What's wrong with your corgi? When we start Thursday of high school Thursday, by 9.22 p.m., she was fighting for her life. By Friday afternoon, she was declared brain dead. Oh, that was when they hmm. didn't get the head hmm. of that tour. He will survive. Oh, oh, oh. oh. You're talking about the car accident. I thought you were talking about a different situation. I'm like, Jesus. I didn't yeah. see it. <laughs> Wow. <laughs> Don't most dogs have that? <laughs> no, 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 mine does. <laughs> he has good little parts of dog. Yeah. Hmm. It's just his mom donated her organs. Organs were harvested Monday morning. Hmm. Yeah, that's what I have on my license too. I knew. The one lady in this in my group, she needed a heart replacement. I think she, well, okay, it was a 40 year old. I think she was 50, late 50s. And when she got her heart transplant, she got it from a 40 year old. And she said, never could feel, because the rest of her was great, you know, but it was obviously her heart. And uh, her name was Dottie. She lives here. And I tell you, she, I said, that is just the coolest thing. So she pushes the, like, you know, donating big time. Yeah. And I mean, I can see why. What are you going to do with them? When you're yeah. I mean, you know, just do it. Some people are freaking about that stuff. I have not on my, on my driver's license to donate, you know. Yeah. Yeah. Me too. Because. Whatever they can take. I mean, yeah. Take, I mean, say your organs are bad, but you know, just skin and all that for burn victims and stuff. Definitely.
Yeah. <laughs> right. That's funny. Because they were at the tree. They were at the tree Wednesday and it was left across the road. Oh, no, oh boy. Wow. Yeah. Hmm. That's fine or nothing. Yeah. So the, I didn't see that part. You said the electric company. It was the one that left the tree there. Oh God! And there's no sign or anything to. Huh. Hmm. That yeah. Oh, that's crazy. First thing they should have done. I bet. I'm like, let's just imagine. Hmm. Wow. I know. You wonder why, just not that they're, you know, people aren't equally important to you, but it's just like sometimes, you know, they're harder than others. And for whatever reason, you know, it's just how we deal with it or, you know, but, you know. Hi, Maria. Maria, is that, is that a plastic cutter machine? I don't know what that means. What do you mean a plastic cutter machine? You mean the whole machine? It kind of looks like plastic. Mean, or right, it looks or like does it cut hand. plastic? I didn't know. I'm not sure. I, you know what I mean? Like, oh, does it cut plastic? Is that what you mean? Or does it, I don't know. What do you mean the machine itself? Oh, good, good stuff. <laughs> a little bit. Again, I don't want it to be weird. Hi, busy. Busy. Are you busy? <laughs> Are you busy, busy? Are you busy? Yes. What are you busy doing? Oh. It's a cute name, just busy. Yeah. Just busy. Mm -hmm. I don't run. It took off. Oh, that's yeah, it's scary. Plastic, obviously, it's very heavy, though, and it's not plastic all the way through. Obviously, it's just plastic on the outside. Hmm. 
vinyl or faux leather, but that's why I'm confused if you meant in my cutting plastic. Is it for cutting plastic or if it, you know what I mean? If I am cutting plastic. I'll be right back. I'm going to look. I'll be right back. Where's my flowers at? I lost my flowers. Oh, here they are. Nope, that's the bird. She has the same printer as I do, it's just a different model number. And she has the same thing where you pay you pay monthly for the ink. Is this a Sizzix machine? Oh, yeah, this is a Sizzix. The Tim Holtz Vagabond. Hey, why didn't you cut? Oh, maybe I didn't go all the way down there further enough. Okay. It's a it's an HP Office Pro 8025. I didn't know you were getting the same. I didn't know you went to go get the model number. <laughs> And I told her, I said, HP, different model. I don't know what model number it is. But I thought, <laughs> oh. I thought you went to do something else. Office Jet Pro. Yeah, Jet Pro 8025. Mm hmm No. <laughs> Sorry. Mine isn't. My printer, my printer isn't. No, just a just a regular printer scanner. You know, you want a oh with a the, the in tanks, yeah. No, it's not a unique one. Uh, yeah, if you want the one with the tanks, you can get the Epson Eco Tank or whatever. Um, but, you know, but if you're just wanting to put cut or print basic stuff then the, you know that one with the h with the hp ink works good yeah it's an 8025 definitely it's an office office jet office jet pro 8025 is the number i don't i had the one before and then i've got this one i have had two of them I don't want to crank down on me. I'm using it so much. I think I'm way too much. That's for yeah, that's what I do with mine. Yeah. It's all kinds of little digital stuff off of Pinterest and just everything. Oh, exactly. Exactly. That's what this, that's what I like about the, this one. My brown. Yeah, this one doesn't. It, it, it 
last for quite a long time. A lot of ink. A lot of ages, I mean. Before it runs low. It's 1 a.m. Okay. Yeah, <laughs> oh, bye, Courtney. <laughs> Thanks for stopping by. Yeah. I didn't even see you come in. Thanks, Courtney. That's good. She snuck in. She snuck in. <laughs> Did you see her come in? Well, just when she asked that question, <laughs> I don't know. Oh, 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 oh. Yes, yeah. Sorry. Sorry. Mm -hmm. Brown. Oh, I have brown. Where is it? Where is it? It's brown. Yeah, that's what I like about the eco tank print uh, things. The cheap, the ink is like cheap, and you can print and print and print on those forever. And I have a tank system on my Epson. Um, you can you can buy it for Epsons. You can buy a standalone tank system. And that's how it is with mine too. That's why I usually suggest trying to get one of those if people can, just because of that reason. Hey, baby, what's this win? Hey. Let's go to daddy. Let's go to bed. Let's go to bed. Let's go to bed. Yeah. Yeah, you might want to check on it, um, Stephanie, and see what they see what they say. Cause what if my stuff? What if I, oh, like I said, it was we went to Best Buy and asked about that, and they just they didn't recommend it for here. But hmm. if you check somewhere, or maybe you know, just any Best Buy. I mean, it doesn't mean you're going to get the same. Or answer. Because so. I thought same thing, yeah, because it'd be. Well, I mean, if you know, if you don't think you're, if you think you're gonna have a problem, you know, obviously go with the other one. I just like Epson better. But if the other one's cheaper and you know you're more concerned with price, then obviously get the the HP because you know at least yeah. that you'll you get decent prints and. You know, you get the same basic concept of the ink, you know. Carla, why don't I see Carla? Hmm? Carla? Yeah, I don't see Carla either. Carla's here? Yeah. Oh. I don't know. She said, hi, Carla. Maybe she was seeing up, up when she was oh, here. She? I don't know. I'm like, where is she? I'm uh, missing Gordon, yeah, it's Carla. No. Am I missing Yeah, where is Carla, by the way? She was here and then she disappeared. Yeah. She fell asleep. Rat. <laughs> <laughs> Carla. I'm going to get her. <laughs> I bet you she's listening, Carla. Carlotta. <laughs> <laughs> Come out, come out, wherever you are. Oh, she hid Stephanie. 
Who hits that? Carla. <laughs> oh god, she's asleep. Whoop. Yeah. Mm, naughty girl. Uh, or she dropped her phone. She usually, she's just like, oh, yeah. no. she probably I've dropped her phone. That before. I hate that. <laughs> I grab it and I hit a button. <laughs> so she did fall asleep. <laughs> oh. <laughs> I'm going to have to remove her as mod if she don't stop doing that. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I'm just cutting out the one flower from here because I like this one. And I don't have any of it. And the other one. There she is. <laughs> I'm hit. Yeah, I knew she'd <laughs> pop up. <laughs> it's easy to do, huh? Oh, Carla. Big trouble. <laughs> Big trouble. She was having dreams of people coming in and being a pain in the ass, so she just started hiding people. <laughs> Doing it in her dreams. <laughs> when it updated, we could use generic green cards. Oh, yeah. this is going to be tricky. Hmm. I'm not going to cut. Well, we're going to make it happen anyway. Hmm. Yeah, you unhit her. Hide her again. Hide her again. <laughs> oh, oh. <laughs> can't go and get you in trouble. She deserves. <laughs> oh yeah, the regular ink is more expensive. Terrible. I hope you feel better, Carla. You feeling good? Mm -mm. For the set of what? Epson cartridges usually aren't that expensive. The whole set. Ours all we ours was sixty five. For generic, so, I mean for the Epson inks. Uh huh. Oh wow. I usually get the generic inks. I have the generic inks in all mine, and except for the you know the HP, but I don't have any problem with the generic inks. That's why I think I just don't. I I think I might have expected like too much or whatever. Or no, I mean I expect a lot. I you know I'm much I'm very much printer savvy. I have several different printers, yeah. laser printers. I do a lot of graphic stuff. I would not accept anything but the best on my printing. That's why I'm very particular about my printers. But I don't know whether you just got like crappy ink from somewhere. I or something. I don't know. But you know what I mean. Like or a cheap what, model. What, yeah, because you know, but you said it was a cheaper model, but at the same time, it shouldn't even the yeah, I've, I've had even the cheapest Epsons work fantastic, so I don't know. I'd have to look hmm. at your printer. And I'll have you to know, see what you, know, you what ever want to sell it. You let me know because I'll take it gladly off your hands because I'd love to have another Epson. And uh, play around with it, it's have one like, down there. Have, have one for here. my office or whatever. Just I like to have extra printers on hand because I'm always printing stuff. Yeah. But if you ever want to get rid of it, let me know. It's, I like Epson printers. Space so. no. here. That's what we both say. Yeah. Well, let me know. So I'll definitely look to see uh, exactly what it is and because. Um. 
You're hiding. Who's hiding? Stephanie. Who's hiding? Stephanie. Stephanie. I don't know what model it is, so it could have been the crap model that, you know, every now and again, any company puts out a crap model, you know, not all perfect. That's true. I've just, I've had a, my first Epson printer was like a $30 add-on printer that came with a, uh, came with a computer I got. I had never had mm -hmm. an Epson printer. I had other printers that I hated that were others like blah, they were okay. Um, and then I got that Epson, that, that little $30 add-on Epson printer was, I was like, what the hell? I'm like, this thing prints so much better than other printers I've had. So then I, it prompted mm. me to get another Epson and get a nicer Epson, a little more money. And I was I'm very impressed. And ever since then, I've always been impressed. But that's not to say that they they don't have their moments where they have a model that's not so great. But you know, yeah. or any of them do. But I know that you know I've had the most trouble with HP printers and Canon printer, printers. I just hate the way they print. Um, but that's yeah. just me because that's just my preference. Everybody has their own preference. I'm just very picky about things, and I like them to be a certain way. And I could never. I just hated Canon printers. Um, but then again, you know, I can't, say, I can't say that a Canon printer nowadays is any bad because I haven't had a Canon printer in 15 more or more years, you know, so they might be great now. Who knows? I don't know. Yeah. I just said, well, from my experience, the ones I had, who knows what exactly. they do better now, but I just didn't like them. Let's sit on there. No, fine. Don't sit on there. See if I care. See if I can make that piece with my new heater. Or heater. Ow! What'd you do? I dropped it. Almost, almost hit me in the head. It was just a little charger thing. Here's my new. It's black instead of white. My oh, white one was spotless. And of course, those things are quiet, right? And can you emboss with those or no, right? You're not supposed to. Uh huh. You can emboss with them. Oh, okay. It's actually ma it's made for that. Um, it is? See, because that's not what yeah. Tim Holtz says. Tim Holtz always says these are made for drying, and the other ones, the louder, more powerful ones, are made for embossing. So I always got confused yeah. because I've always seen people emboss with those. So I was like, what the hell? I'm like, mm -hmm. I don't get it. In fact, <laughs> Does it for a powerful, though, right? What? Oh, you're breaking up a little bit. It, it doesn't blow really powerful, right? No, not okay. at all. So here's the, it huh. says, used to melt embossing well, that's not powder. This one, is it? Ranger. Oh, it is the Ranger. See, that's what I mean. Why do? Why does he always say that? He always says, this is not the one you want yeah. to use for embossing. You want to use the other kind. Yep. This is the kind for drying. And I'm like, oh, okay. I always thought that was for embossing. I got, oh. you know, you know, I emboss with mine, but. Because I would yeah, think gentle if air. Blow a lot, you would have an easier time embossing things because it wouldn't exactly. blow it all over the place. Yep, doesn't blow powders and keeps them in place. Quick dry yeah. ink, blues and pinks. Uh, melting, heating, shrink, uh, plastic. Let's see. Quiet. <laughs> blah, blah, blah. Let's see. It's very hot. Hot, 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 hot. <laughs> very hot, hot, hot. Very hot. And you know what? <laughs> Which is really weird because it says, well, at least Dick Blick says, if you're not, you know, completely satisfied, we ask that you return it within 365 days. And I'm like, what? <laughs> 365 days? What the heck? Hey, good Lord. I know. I know. You it's like, like, and then return it? Isn't that weird? It is weird. <laughs> Interesting. What is it? Um, those two? No. Hundred percent. Okay. Um. Hmm. I've heard Tim Holt say that on several occasions. He's like. You know, you wouldn't want to emboss with this. You just want to dry your papers and blah, blah, blah. You emboss with the other one. And I'm like, oh, I always thought that would be embossed. Yeah. 
So he must have his Look, info on. Right here it says to return merchandise which is not damaged. We ask that you make return decisions within 365 oh, days. Oh, that's if it's not damaged though. Yeah, yeah. Right, yeah. But if you just don't like it, you can return it. <laughs> Get your money yeah. back on this. It's like this will allow exchange or refund or credit. Well, there's nothing wrong with it. Why do you need to exchange it? Just to get exactly. a new one? Okay. <laughs> I know you use it right until the time it's, it's up. Yeah. And then it's like, okay, well, I was going to see. Oh, there it is. Oh, I wanted to see the, um, the heat on here. Because the thing is hot. Very hot. Uh, I see. Mm. It's a shrinking decorative shrink wrap, drying glue, okay, emboss on paper. The best results stamp image. Okay, yeah, ink. Blah, blah, blah. Perfect cover. Okay, we know how to do that. To create a raised embosser. Okay, yeah. Okay. Two inches above what surface? Okay. Okay. Quiet, yeah, I know that. <laughs> Make it easier to talk. <laughs> Here. Yeah. While crafting. Mm-hmm. Gentle flow, yeah. Won't blow your embossing powders or glitter. Yeah, it has a hang up thing. No, I'm not the only one that's heard him, right? Other people have heard you've heard, you know, other people has anybody else heard him say that? Tim Holtz about the that his heat gun that he uses, which is the Ranger one. Or am I going crazy? Because I know for a fact I have heard him say that, and I, that's why I was so confused. Because I always thought that one was the one that was supposed to be for mostly, you know, you can emboss with any one of them, but you know, because it doesn't blow them around, blow your stuff around. And so yeah. I, you know, and when he would say that, I got so confused. I'm like, wait a minute, I'm <laughs> confused here because I thought. <laughs> Yeah. I heard him say it not just on one occasion either, several, several times. Right. So yeah. I was dumbfounded. I was like, what? I'm like, wait a minute here. <laughs> now, see, so do not leave any more than 10 minutes at a time. Yeah. I'm going to slow. Okay, cool for 10 minutes before restarting. Oh. Mm hmm. Yeah, yeah. Whoever you me on Amazon? Hmm? Where is she looking at? Where are you looking at? Leather. I'm assuming Amazon is going to come today. This is not a hair dryer. The novel exceeds 230 degrees Fahrenheit. Yeah. Well, okay. I'm not going to use a hair dryer. Not a hair dryer. Don't dry your hair with it. No I'm way. You will burn off your hair if you want to burn it to a crisp. You don't want any hair left? Okay, go ahead. Oh, it takes longer. Is that fine? Ouch. Pinch my finger. Ow. Oh. That was hurting. Yeah, it's hurting. It was very hurty. Warning to pet bird owners. Wait. Huh. Do not use heat. Heat it all around pet 
birds of any type. Usage of the heat heated tool may be harmful to a bird's sensitive lungs and could possibly cause injury or death. Okay. What? Ooh. Around the bird or like on the bird? Like not that anybody <laughs> would, but I'm confused. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. Um, do not use the heated tool around pet birds of any That's type. Well, uh, so is, wait a minute. So our lungs aren't sensitive? <laughs> yeah, really. I know, right? I'm like, uh, 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 it does. So our lungs don't matter. Mm. Usually, isn't isn't a, a bird an indicator of like like that's why they have birds down in mines so that if it dies, you know, there's not enough oxygen or something going on. Oh no! <laughs> the bird will die first. They're sensitive. They really want to <laughs> use that. Mm -hmm. So I just tried to put that in. That's not. It doesn't. I'm going to put it in my bag. I'm going to put The stinking thing is hot. <laughs> That's hot. I thought it said the temperature that it, it, it you know, but I, I guess it doesn't. I thought, Forget it then. <laughs> but I'm going to cook the piece of clay. I, I just need it like. Oh, yeah. Can you hear it? Mm -mm. Not at all. You're gonna cook your clay with that? You don't hear that? No, I don't hear it at all. Wow. But does it take longer to dry your paper with that because it doesn't glow as much? Uh, well, um, <laughs> a little bit. It does, but not that you know any just the world amount of time. A little bit. Now see this on, like I said, on Amazon was like uh, 36 and the cheaper one was the same thing. Woo! I just broke it. What? Oh, no. <laughs> I broke it already. But it said it was for UK standards right. or whatever and, and it was cheaper. But I thought, well, I, I don't know if I could, you know, if I'd have to have a certain plug for that or whatever. But yeah, that sounds like it's got a UK plug on it. You wouldn't yeah, I was like, well, I don't want that. So then when I looked at Dick Blick, it was like 26, which was a really good, no, I'm sorry, 23. But then it was almost $8 shipping, but it still came out cheaper. Hmm. So, yeah, then even Prime would be. Just Prime would like Gives off a chemical that is bad for birds. Oh, please. That's scary. I'm <gasps> <laughs> <laughs> oh, that 
Now that see now the it won't bend or anything, so I can put it, you know. Need to get you some stamps or stencils for Halloween. Who? Oh. Stephanie. She loves stamps and stencils? Yeah, for Halloween. She likes that. Oh, for Halloween. Yeah. You're not allowed. <laughs> Heard it. Is coming out of its case. That's how much I use it. <laughs> oh, <Jeez. laughs> interesting. Oh well, it still works. <laughs> well, there you go. That's the important part. Mm -hmm. I think it does. What do I do? My favorite dye is better not die on me. <laughs> They're not. Sure. I mean, I've gotten I've gotten my money's worth out of it. That's for damn sure. Mm -hmm. no, no. But still, still better not die. Don't die, guy. Don't die, guy. Don't die. Don't die. That could be why it's kind of cutting crappily lately. Hi, Vanessa. Dying. I don't think so. Dying. How are you doing, Vanessa? How's your Hi, Vanessa? How are you? How are you healing? Hopefully, better than. Yeah. You think you're better? Didn't even cut it all. All right, what's going on? Mm 
of the like the trigger thing probably where do you need to start pp thanks when do you start uh -huh. you still can't use your glue gun oh that sucks Yeah. Oh, it is it. Wow. Oh, gosh. Oh, wow. Hmm. Okay, Marsha. See you later. See you, Marsha. Thanks for coming by. Christmas music in my head. <laughs> Christmas music. Yes, Christmas music. Mm -hmm. Stephanie. <laughs> I have Christmas music in my head. You ruined it. No, oh, ruined it. not really. It's okay. <laughs> I'm done die cutting for today. I'm going to not do that anymore because I'm tired of that. <laughs> yeah, you've been doing it for a while. I know, my hands are hurting too. Oh, well. Time um, to quit die cutting. Time to say goodbye. My little vagabond. <laughs> I need to heat up my heat gun, my glue gun. Get off there. Heat it up. Lots of flurs and my bird. Oh. Make my bird again. I see, so it's supposed to have a different. Oh, yeah, Marsha, for sure. Yeah. Hmm. I forget how the stupid bird goes. First. Hmm. Marsha. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Need to look up. Mm -hmm. 
can't remember how it pieces together. <laughs> Um, that's not it. How the hell is it? There it is. Okay. So, okay. Okay. Huh? It's hard to see. supposed to be like I don't, I don't know something like that I forget we have three of those things coming out mine don't have three of those things what kind of games are they playing here <laughs> <laughs> games on you they are they really are mm. Playing now, Stephanie. I don't, this picture does not help. This picture is terrible. What you trying to trying to put something together? Yeah, I'm trying to see this stupid die. Oh. What? Why am I not? Oh. Two went down. Am I missing a piece or something? Christmas music. What? What, what kind of die is it? Well, I guess that's the eyeball on the head. I don't know why. I don't remember how to put this thing together. It's the heck out of me. Hmm. And I'm missing a piece. Mm, that's not good. No, not good. Missing all kinds of pieces. Mm -hmm. Hey, you're my pieces, bird. Stupid bird. Are you talking about that one bird that you like, the plaid? Yeah. yeah. yeah okay. <laughs> I forget how it goes together, and I'm just like, what? Oh. I'm just confused, but I got it now. I just, I think, oh. missing a piece. <laughs> it just con confused me. Because we're looking all over for that bird that not. I know. I just completely forgot how the hell it went together. Hmm. I want the dark green one. I can't find it. Vanessa has a question about Nightbot. No, he cheats. No. Yeah, he does. <laughs> when I have him on with my lives, he tends to put people in time out right away. Oh. He does. Oh, uh, go to your settings in your in your nightbot. You need to go to your like settings, um, because it, you need to turn off all the uh, little doodads in nightbot. Like, uh, oh, I still have mine on from the suit auction, don't I? I just realized mm -hmm. I never turned it off. Idiot me. 
Um, my coffee is warm. It's like cold and gross. Oh. My tea is. Anyway, you need to go. Um, let me look. You need to go to. You need to go to spam protection and make sure it's all disabled. No, nothing should be enabled in there. That's probably why. If you go to the spam settings on the left side, you know, when you go, you know how to set it up and where, you know, the website. And go over to spam protection and then go just make sure those are all disabled. And that's most likely why. There's something in those spam protections that you have on that's forcing it to do that. Well, eventually that little piece has to come up somewhere. So the other bits are missing. Bits and bits. Bits and bits. Yeah, they're in, they're in the pile here somewhere. Find them eventually. I'm going to turn on my oven real quick. I'll be right back. Don't do it, please. Don't do it. Oh, well. I can't worry about it right now because I don't want to put it together necessarily right now. When I find all the bits, it's different. I don't know where all the bits are. I'll put you over there, chicken foot. Mess. Big old mess. I'm covered in bits. Bits and bits and bits. Tibbles and bits and bits and bits. Well, if, if if any of your streams are unlisted or private, it won't work. But yeah, sometimes he has trouble with some things. Most of the time he works though for me. Only a few times here and there he gives problems. Where's the uh it doesn't show up for work. Yeah. Fire him. Because that's because he's over in my live stream flirting with all the girls. Yeah, see? Mm. 
Este. Okay, well, yeah, hopefully that does the trick, Vanessa. Was there any of them turned on in that little thing there? Just this flower because I don't like it. Flower aggravates me. You don't like it? Hey, Michelle. Hey, Michelle. Hi. 
What are you doing? What are you doing awake? Don't you have school in the morning? <laughs> school. <laughs> oh, she's only sixteen. Oh. <laughs> she wishes. If you wish it. Really? How old is she? She is if I'm thir if I'm forty eight, she's thirty eight. She's ten years nah. younger than me. She's young. You're young. She's young, she's young. you're young. Yeah. How are you feeling, Michelle? I hope better. Wait a minute. Is that my oven? I don't like it. Well, it's heated up. It's heated up awfully quick. Okay. Yeah. Low battery. Please charge. Okay. Little duty. Watching Golden Girls. Oh, good. You watching Golden Girls? Do what? What? You break, break, break me up a little bit. Uh, raffia. What about it? I'm trying to think. Where did I put it? Mm -hmm. Bedroom, and I've got one of those rolly things. It was a, it's cheap to keep it's my extra stuff in there, like napkins and things like that. It might be in there. It might be. Hmm. That's cute. I don't want to put Mr. Pumpkin's hair in. I need wrap. Yeah. Um, Mm. 
Hmm. What else you been up to, Michelle? To do some art, Michelle. I'll be right back. I'm going to put my clay in the oven. Okay. for as unless as much as you can. Well, that's good. 
how's my mom and everybody doing? Side of the witch again. That's the back side. Beats me. Works for me. And Chrissy just work when he's with her girlfriend a lot, but they're good. My job is a huge adjustment. I need to stand. Oh, really? It's a huge adjustment, but it's a lot probably easier on you. You know what I mean? Right? I would imagine. It's not as rough on the on the body. Which is good. Actually, the beacon will stick to this color. Or that one. Put this one behind a darker. Or, there we go. A little bit darker than the other one, I think. Get out of the way. to it over time of course it's going to take an adjustment but i think it'll work out good for you and it's more money right so that's always good you can't beat that more money is always good
Mm. Oh, Linda. Linda. Well, that's good. See, that might make it all worth it. It's not everything, you know, of course, but it might make it worth it. Yeah. And the ones what you know what you're going to do with all them flowers. What? Me? Oh, I, I haven't a clue. I'm just putting them together. <laughs> and I don't know what will happen after that. Beats mm -hmm. me. Save them for... Save them for a rainy day. Yeah. Fourteen items in my cart that I won't buy. <laughs> you lie. <laughs> <laughs> you will buy it. <laughs> you know you will. Don't lie to us. <laughs> That's right. You can't fool us, Stephanie. <laughs> I'm gonna buy every last thing. <laughs> you should anyway. Buy it all. For me. Buy it for me. It looks like a floral garden, doesn't it? There's so many flowers. <laughs> this is my garden now. Mm -hmm. Got an indoor and an outdoor. <laughs> They all need to be glued together. So over here, sneaking away. Mm. One of those leather, thick leather cream pieces, little ones. I don't know if I have any left. I'm going to have to cut a few more of those because I did kind of go through a lot of them. Path. At least you don't have to water. Yep, don't have to water these. Only two I have left. Uh. Oh no. Oh no. See, I, knew, I was trying, I thought I cut enough of the little ones, but I always end up cutting not enough of them. I think I kind of like this one with that one for sure. And then I'll put that one on there. It kind of matchy matches it, but I don't know what else to do. Maybe this, put that one there. That's good. Let's get off there. All right, so I'm, I think I'm out of the little littles. The little littles. I have these guys. I have these guys. I have those guys. Put all the like ones together. Oh, wait, there's 
Does this Mary get a bouquet for them, please? <laughs> She's just kidding. What? One bouquet of flowers. <laughs> they are pretty. I'll pull apart now. centers out and the glue these together first. See how I feel about that. There is this little green center I could use somewhere. I don't really like it that much though. I could stick it there. I have got like bits of bugs every which way over here. Those little fuzzy bits of fabric and such. It's pretty crazy. Fuzzy bits. Hate it. <laughs> Hate fuzzy bits. Yeah, All right, my glue gun should be plenty melted, melty, hot. Mm -hmm. I'll call it by now. Okay. We're going to stick all these suckers together. Yeah. Stick them all together. Like a good little flower family. Come on. I know some people these days just never. never. I find it funny how I'm on Amazon looking for flower stamps and other stamps, yet I don't use any of the well, stamps then. I have now. No getting any more stuff. Use the ones I have, really. <laughs> What makes you think you're going to use the ones that you buy from Amazon? <laughs> you wackadoo. <laughs> Let me buy some stamps. Because I don't use the ones I have, so I might as well buy new ones. Yeah, try it. See if that's, use good, that's a good way to look at it. Mm -hmm. Hey, get off my finger. Get that together and that one's together, right? I did those two. Okay. We're on a roll. I don't like this one very much. I think I like. Um, I think I want to change it. Um, I do these all out of the leather stuff. I don't do any out of fabric. <gasps> weird. Mm -hmm. Good. How weird is that? Huh. That's kind of odd. I do need stamping blocks though. I might just find that. Well, good idea then. Okay. Mm. Michelle, what days do you have off from work? The weekends? <laughs> Which is, I like the opposite, like the leathers on top of the felts and the felts on top of the leathers and stuff like that. I kind of like, I didn't cut any of these out of leather. I did. I just don't have that many of them left, I guess. Let me see. Mm. I have one. One. Do I like that better? And then that? Or... I'll stick that one on there. 
I kind of like it. on the floor. Don't tap on the floor. Trying to escape. He is trying to escape. <laughs> trying to escape my wrath. It is. Whatever my wrath is. <laughs> Switching things around as I go. Oh. <laughs> Great. Out of glue. Yep. What you made me do? Out of glue. No way. <laughs> it's all your fault. Fine. <laughs> hey, let me in. Bless you, bless you, bless you, bless you. <laughs> you got one on record. I didn't use it. <laughs> I sneezed twice and you said it like, bless you, bless you, bless you, bless you, bless you. I did. For, for good measure. <laughs> Give me some extra. Yeah, just in case. Yeah. Just in case. Just in case. No, I don't want you this. never know. <laughs> The middle one for that drives me nuts. If I switch these two around, I'll put that there and that there. Sounds good to me. Sounds, Sounds good, 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 good to me. Yes. Hmm. Flurs. Easy peasy flurs. Flurs and more flurs. Oh, can't beat it. Okay, goodness. I put a brad through these, but meh. You like it? Yeah. Well, it's easier to put the glue on there and just stick a rhinestone on it or something. And try to go through the trouble of putting the brad and all that kind of like that. I cut this out. That's good. Stand out there where the waves are. Let me get you. What you do, Lee? Where are you at, Michelle? She left me. She done left me. No, get off my finger. That's they're going, Mr. I can I can understand you. I can't read lips and the mute is on, but I have the closed captions. <laughs> I could have been reading that. Oh well. Twenty foot happened? Wait, I'm just using what it's <laughs> on the news watching about the storm. Oh, and yeah. Reporters talking and talking. I'm like, I can't read the lips. And here I have to <laughs> forgot about the closed caption. <laughs> that was up there. Hmm. It's scary. It's scary. Some clay and make, make his. Him a little head in the back since he's in the back. Is, there is a party 
Coca Cola stamp set. A party Coca Cola? Party Coca Cola? What does that mean? Mm -hmm. It's got to be a Stephanie. Who's sneaking? I hear one of the girls sneaking. Oh, really? <laughs> He's sneaking. One of them is sneaking. Just sneak a peek. I don't see it. I don't see her now. She must have run away when I said that. <laughs> so he was trying to get over here. Sneaking. Check on me. See what I was doing, probably. What's that mommy doing in there? <laughs> She's certainly not playing with me, though. Oh. <laughs> that was cute, Stephanie. Um, let's see. Do I want a different one on another one and another one on this one? Oh. Doesn't uh, Chris start his job tomorrow? Um, yeah, if he gets his freaking computer. But they haven't sent him yet. Oh. He has to call them in the morning. I don't know what the hell he's doing up, honestly. Oh, it's Damn it, I don't have a middle. So I can't put her. Yeah, kind of. Oh, that's right. He, he'll work at home, right? Yeah. Yeah. Stephanie? Oh, that's cute. What? That is cute. A little stamp set. Has a Coca Cola bottle, a glass, a straw, a can, like a little float. Uh, what is that? A top, 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 top party. Have a great day. Biz, cola, mm -hmm. soda, enjoy. Oh, that's cute. Oh, oh, I missed it. What is it? So. Did you send it to Casey? No. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> oh. <laughs> oh. <laughs> I didn't check my messages, but I didn't hear one come through either, but, you know. There, I sent it to you. Ha. Huh. <laughs> Maybe sent it. Oh, oh, oh. I broke my finger. 
I love it. Oh, you did? Oh, okay. <laughs> Sorry, I didn't see it. Oh, you think she said one too? <laughs> oh, I love it. Where is that? Oh, that. Where's my Facebook? Oh, huh. Facebook. <laughs> Five minutes ago, she said that. <laughs> she said it five minutes ago? Uh-huh. Oh. Well, I don't check my messages on the thingy. That's right. I'm like, ooh. ooh yeah. It's yeah. crazy. <laughs> Is it a stamp set? Mm -hmm. Oh, it's cute. Oh, that's I like cute. it. Cola thing or cola thing, sort of thing. It's cute. Mm -hmm. I like it. Are you buying it for me? <laughs> Is it for me? <laughs> no, it's for me. No, it's mine. Popcorn time yet? <laughs> Almost. Mm. I think I like that one there. Oh, I might like something else there. Mm -hmm. Not what I just had. No, similar, but no. That's all right. Mm -hmm. oh, what is that? Oh, <laughs> she hasn't said fuck. Excuse me, I want to see him. <laughs> no. Shazzy wants to see. Shazzy doesn't get to see. Mm -hmm. <laughs> this will be a really cute live stream, Shazzy. <laughs> so come on, get on the live stream, then you can see. Yeah, when are you going to come on with her? Huh? What are you? <laughs> Wait. <laughs> I have a a pin that says that. What? Bite me? Bite me. <laughs> it's a cute Halloween pin. And it has a what cute. Yeah. Hello. What's he in here for? <laughs> what? Ricky's like, he's like <laughs> in here on that. Tricky Ricky. Tricky Ricky. Tricky Ricky. Here comes Polly. I'm in trouble. She's like, I don't want to miss nothing. Mm -mm, she has FOMO. Hi. Hi, Chloe. Hi, baby dog. She's a FOMO dog. <gasps> really? Yay. What? And she sets her for camera. She said it's nearly ready. Oh, you're doing it tonight? <laughs> yeah, are you? Like in the next five minutes? <laughs> yeah. Do it now. 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 Jesus. Right this very instant, Missy. I got FOMO. What's FOMO? FOMO. FOMO? You don't know what FOMO is? You know what FOMO is. It's actually a word. Yeah. Oh, that's uh, let me that down the whole time. Dang it. The let fear of missing out. Oh. <laughs> Women buddy buys. Oh, and your bed. <laughs> Think about that one. Oh, I can't think about it. Do I want to 
want that there. I don't want that there, I don't think. So what now? Switch it. Better work. Yeah. What better work? <laughs> this one. <laughs> oh, my. Uh, I'm sticking the head on the back here because you know he's flat. Oh. And I don't think I've ever put the pieces of clay together, so I'm like, oh, I'm not trusting this stuff. <laughs> I'm gonna do spit right here in his little. Uh, his little spits. His little spits and his little pom poms. I'm going to cut them down, but <laughs> they're all lost. Oh, you just fell out. Hey, come over here. Whoa. Put his little spits. <laughs> his little spits. Let's drill his head a little. His little drool. Mm. This little drill is really mm. sharp. It don't work good. Ow! You're hot. Stop it. Mm. Not hot in a good way either. Oh. <laughs> You're so long. What? <laughs> That is so funny. <laughs> I love it. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> uh, long. oh my god. That's so funny. Get out of here and nap. When I cut it down, it'll out to hold and make them even when it's cut down. I think they have actually kind of some different colors of raffia too. I think they're in the bedroom. I'm not sure. I've got black. Ooh, black. What? I'll wait on those. Where's the back? Yeah. Oh, yeah. Back from there. Oh, my baby boy. Yeah. <laughs> what in the hell are you doing? Well, in the dark. Shit. <laughs> Just put a little bit of this on for now. I got black. Uh... Hey, slide over there, dude. Oh, let go of me. Why do you always gotta stick to my fingers? It should yeah. not be a swipe and stick to my not stick to my fingers. Stupid. <laughs> you stupid. But it's open. Do I like that one there and that one there? No, I kind of like this one on here. Kind of partial to it. But don't stick to my finger. Thank you. 
very much. <laughs> oh, off I insist. Hmm? You can dry his little spit. Black. Stop sticking to me. I'm telling. You're telling. What are you telling? Mm -hmm. telling? Sticking. Don't leave me yeah. alone. Just don't leave me alone. No sticking. <laughs> no sticking. Ooh. No sticking allowed. Stupid thing. <laughs> I'm going to make dresses for these. I'm going to put the. Dark teeth. Yep. He is gonna glow too. Let's make sure. Let's make sure he glows. All right, we have these many left. These many. These many. Thanks, Daddy. Let's see. Chloe. Look at Chloe. See it even just with. Oh, cute. Oh, I have. I don't think it does glow. Oh, I'm sure it does. It's very hard to show glowy things though on the on the stupid computer on the camera really hard i tried that with yeah. those resin pieces i made that were just like not working out when i was trying to show it yeah and the plus the upper light there is just right yeah. above <laughs> yeah you have to shut everything off and, and it still doesn't always work very well i know My other little voodoo dog cooking. Ow! Bastard. Mm. You bastard. Are you yourself again? Burning myself. Well, it can be sad. Owie. Owie. I'm going to use this one. Yeah, sure. Owie. Owie. And that's it. And then I did other flurs. I'll have centers. I do need the centers. For those, I can make some other ones. Um, Thank you. 
looking at me? I will save this. Jazzy says your flowers are pretty. Thank you. Mm -hmm. Oh, yeah, now they need a rhinestone or something in the center. I forgot about my little cup here. It turned out pretty good with uh, doing it on these things. Oops, on these. Yeah. Little cup. This one oh. Just went for it. oh, yeah, that came out great. Yeah, huh. I just sanded it a little bit, and then this one. Yeah. Too. Oh, cute. I love that. They came out yeah. so cool. Thanks. Let me run to the bathroom. I will be right back. Okay. I'm put my, my tea on, too. I'll be right back. Oh, okay. Let's see. See if we can see. We should know by heart. Thanks, Jazzy. Yeah, I will. As soon as she comes back, then I'll get it. Speaking of perfume, we we're just talking about the magazines and the perfumes. <laughs> I said, "Yeah, I've been mean, taking them out of the magazines. I used to. I used to have so many magazines. I tore them all out." Jador collection. Okay, let's go. You can also put them in your. your some drawers for your desk drawers and oh no no Oops. Pudding. You know what? White cooler and pudding. <laughs> oh. My yeah. pudding. Pudding. Chocolate pudding. Mmm. I love those. I can eat a lot of them. <laughs> More than one, I get like. I store my clear stamps in drawers. I do that with my stencils. Well, actually, the, yeah, the um, clear stamps too. Okay. 
to party. Oh, are you sure you It's another party. Oh, that is pretty. Who likes those? Stephanie? I sent the um, thing over there. Thank you. Look at all the Get all the cookies. And it's in a deep in a container. <laughs> I store, yeah, I have it, um, take the CD case. And then I have the sheet and the magnetic sheets, and I cut them, and put them in the CD cases, and then I. That's how well. That's actually how I do the, the dies. I was waiting for stamps. Mm -hmm. You're welcome. Yep, the dies in there. I've got a lot more to do yet too. I thought, well, after I'm. Pretty done with this, I will. I'll never be done. I'll never be done. Your work is never done, Jane. No, it'll never be done. I found a big, big old gouge in the floor. I was like going to pick something up, and I looked and went, What the heck? A huge gouge right over here by the, the door. My. Oh. You got a lot of gouges in the floors. How? Hmm. That's bizarre. They melted. Oh, man. It melted. Oh. She has these stamps. Oh. That's not nice. Uh, they melted. Your stamps? Uh, How the hell did your stamps melt? Like your clear stamps or, melt? Or was it the CD cases? No, I imagine that would be the stamp, if anything, but still, how the hell they melt? Oh. How do you live on the sun? <laughs> she does live on the sun. Apparently. Oh, oh, wow. Were they, like, mm. in the sun? Like, directly in the sun? Or the first... hmm. She lives in hell. <laughs> <laughs> Put a green one on. <laughs> Jason, or Stephanie said, I'm going to look and see if my milk is There's stamps. It got too hot. In well, I think oh. where he lives is probably harder. That's why oh. they moved it. But still, I never heard of that. Wow. Hmm. This is weird. Is your place like now I think of my house being <laughs> like too hot in the in the summer and hmm. mm. already a hundred oh my gosh. Winter? Yeah. I wonder where she lives. Hmm? I say it's not winter where she lives, apparently. <laughs> she's in its winter. <laughs> she's in its winter and it's 100. I don't know what, what? she can do in winter. Hmm. Just because they call it winter doesn't mean it is winter. <laughs> well, <that's true. laughs> not when you live in that kind of BS. Yikes. I'd be right in the government saying shut off the sun. Mm-hmm. Yeah. That's for sure. That ain't, that's a thing, right? That ain't right. That's, that ain't right, that's right.
So free air. Yeah, right. For air for everybody. Yeah. Hi Nora. How are you? Hi Nora. Now we need some rice. I'm going to put the beads. Actually, I'm going to put the beads. Are you ready to walk in for work? Oh, Monday. I think you should take off today. What? Nora needs to take off work. Oh, of course. I'll give you, I'll write you a note. Mm -hmm. I'll get right I'll write you a note. It's good as gold. I swear. <laughs> Take off work and hang out here. Ow. Yeah. Crap with us. Yeah. Oh, they work. work. I know, right? Will be to work. Why are you breaking up so much, Jeannie? Is your headset going yeah. wrong on you? Yeah. Being a little willy wonky. Willy nilly. The willy nilly's. You know, actually, I don't even know. I don't have to even wear this. Why am I wearing it? I don't have any sound in the back. Yeah, you don't. Yeah. You don't. yeah. <laughs> if only I could work at home. So Sundays are the only day I really morning day, right? so I wouldn't worry about it other than Sunday. Yeah. Unless, unless he's banging pots and pans with him. <laughs> Even then. Oh, you work from home? What do you do? Don't touch my pudding. Don't touch it. <laughs> I know you want to. Don't. I said don't. She's muted. Why are you muted, Janie? It's mutiny, I tell you. Limestone, you want to over. Excuse you. Oh, hey, my bye. goodness. I'm sitting there talking. <laughs> <laughs> well, I said, why are you muted? <laughs> you have to, gotta, you gotta tell me. Because <laughs> I'll sit there and blah, 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 blah. Uh, she, she, uh, she wishes she works from home. If only she could and she gets this email. She's mm -hmm. a payable analyst. Oh, that sounds unfortunate. Oh. <laughs> she goes, in other words, we type all day. <laughs> oh. Oh. <laughs> oh. I can. I can. Kim. Kim. No. Not as But these men know that. This is my other one over here. Not over here. That mm, looks like. Just flowers and stuff. I don't think I'm gonna put flowers in the center of the flowers, but I cover up the centers I already put on there. That would be kind of silly. Mm -hmm. I'll get the other box. So I don't know wherever they are. That's it. Yep, that's it. That's it. This one here. Let's see. Let's see what we got over here. Now we're cooking. 
Oh yeah. yeah. We are cooking that one. That one we go over there. Oh, there. Hopefully, oh there. That's a good one. Okay, Shazzy. <laughs> Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah, my name. I didn't do it. Oh, that's mm -hmm. That one. That's a cool. You can't have it. I'll steal it. I'm just kidding. I want it. <laughs> you can have it. Give it's it. for you. Give it to me. I said you can have it. Oh, okay. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> like the one other thing? No. This one? Not really. Mm -hmm. About these, these. I could do one of those. What are you doing, Kim? I swear I'm not doing anything. Kim and coffee. Hmm? Coffee, tea, toast, English muffins, cereal, <laughs> chocolate cake. I want frosted flake cereal. <laughs> They're great. They're great. They are great. Mm -hmm. I put an iridescent blue heart on that one. Ooh, fancy. Very fancy. Mm -hmm. Oh, that was nice. Mm -hmm. That's very nice. Yeah. What's nice? Mine always says, well, well, do you want me to do you want me to do this? Well, I'm like, well, if you have to ask, then forget it. It's just not the same. You really complaining. Well, do you want me to go get some or whatever it is? And I'm like, no. You didn't do it and ask me. It's not the same. Like, I don't know. Like tonight, it was like, um, Oh, potatoes. It's like, um, I'm just going to mash potatoes. I'm getting tired of baked potatoes. He goes, well, I can go to the store. Do you want me to go to the store? He knows I'm going to say no. <laughs> yeah, I can go to the store if you want me to. I can get some. I go, no. Really? You sure? I am saying no, actually, yeah, go ahead and go to the store. Hmm? You start saying yeah. Yeah. <laughs> okay, in there. Oh, that's a pretty one. Oh, I've got these. I can bust them. Oh, you know, drop them on the floor. Crap. I remember Peyton used to say, surprise us with, with breakfast in bed. Her breakfast was. Cheerios and be like, oh no, we'd be like, uh oh, and only they'd be sitting there forever. <laughs> By the time she <laughs> got them to us, it'd be all oh bad. <laughs> no. so I, like, well, we gotta eat them. I'm like, yep. Mm -hmm. I heard her friends would set it all up and then tell <laughs> us what was ready. <laughs> Come out and be all soggy. Oh yeah, I knew you already. <laughs> I work on my Halloween stuff. Yes. I made another one of these and putting some back of the heads on these poor skulls. Oh, I hear my. Is this your zombie? Is this, I mean, the, the, the thing or bobber? That. Hmm? The thing or bobber? What? The sticky pin guy. What is, what is his name? Oh, oh the voodoo doll. Yeah, he's voodoo doll. doll. He's in the oven. Wow. In the oven? He's cooking. I like He's done. I hear him. <laughs> yeah, yeah, I hear you. I do have an idea. I, got, I gave myself an idea. <laughs> I done gave myself an idea. Popped right in my noggin. <laughs> Kim says those flowers are beautiful. Thank you. Oh, I'm... What you're saying? I'm gonna pop popcorn. I want to pop popcorn. You want some popcorn? Oh, yeah. Okay. I've got some. No. Heat gun way. Heat gun. Not my heat gun. My. Mm. 
some of these iridescent heart things. They're so fun. They're so fun. Okay. Anyone else that can get a heart? Who gets a heart on? Who else gets a heart on? Mind guys, I got it. I meant for my flowers. I was asking which flower got one of the hearts put on the center of it. Dirty girl. Sheesh. You so dirty. Go to the other rhinestones over here. No, not these. Um, where are they? And then what's that one get? What do you get? No, you don't need that. You need a. What do you need? You need um. No. You need a smack in the face. Globey marbly thing in it. Globey marbly thing. That one does too, but it's in red. This one has an, uh, an oval. Oh, 
Oh, you know, that's pretty. Right, this one has a clear. <laughs> Do we want to know what you did? <laughs> I lost my popcorn. Oh, no. Whoa. You lost your popcorn? Yeah. Oh, you know you got popcorn. All right, now we have 90,000 flowers. Just run right off the table. Off the thing. All of it is gone? Oh. It fell in my lap. Some of it, I gave it to the dog. <laughs> Oops. I love popcorn. Mm -hmm. As I eat chocolate pudding. I love popcorn. Chocolate oh, pudding? Mm -hmm. Oh, corny pops. I love chocolate pudding. Mm. See, what I can do, I came up with an idea while I was doing those. Just a little idea. Mm -hmm. I could do this and take my, where were they at? These ones here. And I can try to make a pretty center using some of these maybe. But I'm not sure how that would work because they're funky colors and I need like, like not that. I need some colors that I can use that'll match full. Like that color would be good if I could find more of those. I need more. Oh, did you see Kim with if I already nope. did? How no. did you come out? Oh, with my steel rule dies on my my vagabond, you know, my cutter dude. Yeah. My steel rule dies. I sat and cut out. You know how I sell the like faux leather and the fabric sample books and stuff well i used that i cut them out with the fabric sample books and faux leather books yeah. and i cut them out of like this is from the faux leather you know and and then i mixed matched some of the leather ones with the fab more fabricy like microfiber book to ma put them together cool mm -hmm. you know i could find four like that one, two, not exactly the same, are they? Really? That's different. Oh, I'm sorry, I didn't see that. Three. Jim. Thank you. Separate them. Okay. Those are the clear ones. I'm like separating them out here so I can find what I need. Oh, here's another orangey one. There's two orange ones, there's two gold, three goldy ones. There's, there's all the silvers and the bronzes there. Red, there's another weird green one. Come on, give me what I need, fool. There's it, there it is, there it is. I found, nope, I need one more of those. Dang it. But I had four already. Hmm. Clear one. Oh, wait, some of those are purple, some of those are clear. Red, more pink. There's a light pink and a dark pink. Still haven't done enough to do. Come on. Red and red. Pink. Pink and pink. Pink. Purple. Pink, pink, pink. and more pink. Is that red? That's red. That's a light pink. Next, next, next. All right, come on. Stop making me fish for them. <laughs> oh, now we get a blue one all of a sudden? Where'd that come from? They say, go fish. Go fish. Mm -hmm. oh, got one of those. We can do that one. That one goes up there, and that one goes there. That one goes up there, and that one goes there. I'm going to make a few of these, but I need the right color combinations. And I don't really need hot pink and pink, but I seem to have a lot of those. I guess we'll put the purple up there, the green in there. That's what I get for having a random mix. There we go. There's the other orange one. There's the purple. Pink. And more of those orange ones. Purples. 
here from Telecoms and a couple of greens. Let's see how many flowers I can actually make with these. I'm going to make flower centers with them, but I need four of a particular color mm. in order to do it. Are those rhinestones or just like flat back? They're, rhinestones. Rhinestones. they're flat back rhinestones. They're rhinestones. They're just uh, iridescent. You know, they have like a very iridescence to them. They're like real pretty. They have like Except an A quality to them. Her YouTube video is low on quality. <laughs> it's it is? Why? Can you fix it? To like the settings down there? Is it the one you're watching me you mine? The quality's low? You need to go into the little quality yeah, setting right. thing in Bobber. Boy, you give me four little, little. How many green do I need? I don't need that many green, dude. Mm -hmm. that one? Probably, yeah. Oh, wait. No blue, but one blue. There we go. One got one. Same thing. Okay, now it's four pieces of popcorn on the floor. Eat it. You've got them all lined up. <laughs> huh, another blue. Shocking. Mm -hmm. Oh, finally got another one of those. Jeez. Mm -hmm. And a couple more oranges and a blue. Alright, I can't do anything with the blue. I was hoping to find a, another blue, but no, of course not. No blue. So this way I can take this one and take these colors. Actually, I want to do these colors on this one because they might go better. Because the name of the orange will show up. Better or worse on here. Yeah, it's probably better on there. I'll zoom in a little. Let me do. Let me see what the hell I'm doing. Oh, it's a one baby. There's four pieces right there. You can eat those. <laughs> four pieces in front of the stove? She looks the way like, oh, I can't. <laughs> Look at all the pretties. Eat your checkers. <laughs> Thursday and Friday, 110, 110. Wednesday, 108. <clears throat> <laughs> right? Mm. Mm. It's bitten already. It's got slobber on it. <laughs> what? Hello, pumpkin. Oh. It's drying. It's... Hello, saliva. Mm -mm. 
and then I have to do his his hair implants. Yeah. <laughs> hair implants. Did you actually put those in the other one? Uh, the other pumpkin? Yeah, that you put. Remember no. you showed it. Oh. Hmm. Well, what's this one here? I was. He actually gets the hair implants when his saliva dries. <laughs> oh, got to wait for the saliva to dry. Oh, you have popcorn, Diana? See? Oh, right. We got to have our popcorn. popcorn. See, no, I need, really need to have popcorn. Mm -hmm. I'm not going to be part of the club. Mm -hmm. Pumpkin popcorn. <laughs> you ready? Mm -hmm. I want to be part of the popcorn club. See, I think I have the black raffia for his hair. That's why I'm just going to put the regular in, but I think I've got the black in the other one. Raffia. Raffia. I got green, red, glass. That's better. Now I can put little things on. Yeah, let's do it. Let's just do it. Let's just do it. We don't have to think about it. We're just going to do it. Uh oh, let me stick it. Let's do it. Crap. I need a stick. This thing needs to learn to stay down because I don't like it popping up every three seconds. That's the only problem with that. Their little plan over here to have this thing is that it don't like to stay suction cupped down to the desk. Oh. Stay down. Don't move. It's a good plan until it don't work. Everything's a good plan until it don't work. Hmm. Now we need a glue stick. I like cutting these in half because microwave. Too long. Mm. Microwave. Popcorn. Microwave. Microwave. Diana has all Aldi. 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 You have Aldi where you live? Yeah. Wait a minute. You have Aldi in there? No. My mind. Aldi popcorn. I didn't know that you guys had Aldi over there. So, is it something that's made up or you have to make it up? Is it a bag of popcorn or is it you have to pop it? Mm -hmm. uh, I need my glue now because this probably won't stick. Well, I could do it with the thing, but I think it would be better with the glue. Mm, let's try... That. That, that I could do five. No, I have to do four because then I'll only be able to do four in another one. Or I could. No, never mind. Oh, wait, let me see. Nah, no, I'm just going to do this. I'm just going to do it and just shut up about it. Damn it. Shut it up. Oh. Um, 89 cents a bag. Microwave. 89 cents. Well, that'll Actually, this wouldn't be that expensive. I'd have to break it down because it comes in a box of, I don't know how many. Extra butter. Let's see. Can I get this to watch? It's a good kind. Extra butter. Yeah. I'm, oh, no. I dropped my rhinestone. My long rhinestone. A tragedy. <laughs> tragedy of justice. Tragedy. Tragedy, Your Majesty. Hmm. I don't know if that's going to stick there or not, but we're going to try. Sometimes this stuff doesn't like to stick to. You have another one. Huh? There's another storm. Another storm? Where? Who? Uh -oh. I can't see the chat. Uh, the way. Mr. 89 cents a bag. Yeah. Oh, craziness. <laughs> Our popcorn here is at least $10 a bag. I'm just kidding. Can you imagine? <laughs> No, you can get popcorn for like a dollar fifty a bag. 
It's got gold in there. At Aldi, yeah. though, at Aldi, to be honest, at Aldi, you can probably get it for 89 cents here if you go to Aldi. Aldi does have those type of prices. That's just how Aldi is. I'm just like, surprised that she has an Aldi. Oh, being sure. that she lives in, what is it? New Zealand? Or does she live in Australia? I didn't see her respond to Australia. that. Okay, Australia. Yeah. I didn't know they had them there. Hmm. Okay, aside from the white glue that isn't dry yet. Is that like a big lot or something? No, all these, you guys have Aldi out, out there. I know you do. It's just a discounted store, but I think they're all organic now. They've gone all organic. But they sell things really, really cheap. I just, they don't, a lot, they, they have name brands, but they don't sell a lot of name brand stuff. I can't find my poker tool. What do I do with it? Anybody see my poker? Anybody see my poker? I done lost my poker. I done lost my poker. Jamie, did you take my poker? I told you a hundred times not to touch my poker. Oh, here's one. I'll use this one. I'm just trying to clean up the glue. Did I already show this? What? Did I hold this up already? I think I did, but I can't remember if I did. The glue's still drying, so there's glue, but it'll clear. Oh, Isn't that pretty? pretty? Yeah, these rhinestones are pretty. Mm -hmm. Now, if I had littler ones, I can put little ones in there, but I don't have littler than that. <coughs> I have bigger ones. <laughs> Yeah. And these big ass ones, I should do some of those. Those would be fun. I should on like that one. Uh -oh. I don't have any. I think Chris is dying. It's cheaper than the normal supermarket. Hmm. Ooh, that would be cool. Yeah, they are cheaper than a normal supermarket. Definitely. You know what one rhinestone I don't have is orange. I don't have any orange rhinestone. We need to get some stat. Yeah, full flowers. We do that. No, oh wait, I do have orange. Look, those. Oh, well, they're not really rhinestones. Though. They're more like those weird faceted metal stone thingies. They're not rhinestones. They're like, they're oh, like yeah. the hot fix things, but they're not hot fix. So I can use that. And put a couple of like here. That would be pretty. What if I did that? Where's my... I don't know. I need my stick. Did you take my stick? I took it. My gem stick? Mm -hmm. Oh, no. We there we go. Oh, my left it in there. Who's behind what? Leticia said, bless you. And I said... Is oh, it boy. Her? She's really behind. To the point mm -hmm. where I'm going to have to say something in the chat for her to see it. Mm. Potty. I'll be right back. Okay. <laughs> mm. I'm thinking because that's when she sneezed. <laughs> Aid fever? What the heck is that? Hmm. I can't believe that was. It had to have been a tornado. Or whatever. You know? <gasps> Oh, you thought you heard somebody sneeze? <laughs> wow. Chloe. Country legend Loretta. 
It wasn't wind. Swept away. Terrible. Mm. Yeah, pretty bad. Be a caught in a flood like that. Jeez. It would be awful. Hmm. Good night, Diana. Well, hopefully I'll see you soon. Night, night. Night, night. Okay, sorry. What's amazing? What happened? Leticia, did you leave and come back? Huh? Leticia, did she leave and then come back? Yeah, she she just she oh, okay. sneezed in the background. Mm -hmm. Oh, that's right, that's right. She was sneezing, yeah. and she, or I was, yeah, that. She was behind in the video. I need to find my thingy, and I think I left it on my cricket, which is over here. Hmm. You said I didn't read the. That couldn't have been. It said. Um, country star Loretta, I think it said Lynn, but the house was swept away. Really? Oh, wow. wow. I know. <laughs> Terrible. There it is. I knew it. I found it. More rain. Hmm. Huh. I found my pick her up her thingy. <laughs> oh, good. Yes, she came to dozed off, came back in. This way. Oh, you dozed off? Oh, you thought you heard somebody sneeze? Because I sneezed earlier. That's why we <laughs> thought maybe you were behind. I know. <laughs> <laughs> Like, whoa. <laughs> that was quite a while ago. She's hearing ghosts in our 
microphones are picking up the ghosts. Mm. Yeah. Well. She's hearing the ghosts of crafting past. The ghost. Mm. Chunk of wax fell off my thing. It's moving. I don't think they can move. What's wrong with this thing? It done be stupid. That's what you call lots of butter. Mm hmm. Mm -hmm. Oh. <laughs> That's even more than I put. I put a lot. <laughs> That's a good amount of butter. It is. Yes, it is. I went to the bottom. A lot of it did. I'm still going to eat it, too. Eat it. So there. Do it. Me. Yeah. Is this broken? <laughs> is this breaking? What's the matter with this thing? Why is it? Oh, there we go. Okay, I fixed it. Never mind. Hmm. A lot of them didn't pop, though. I wonder why. See, it's either they don't... I mean, it's not like a heck of a lot, but then if I let go anymore, it's going to burn. Right. Oh, I, yeah, mine does that, too. Yeah. Sometimes it'll not pop everything, and if I... Sometimes it'll be popping like crazy, and it'll still have burnt things that'll come out of it, and I'm like, yep. what's going on here? Mm. That ain't fair. Oh, mm -hmm. not fair at all. Nope. Mm -hmm. Alright, I made a mess there. I'm trying not to make a mess. I made a mess. Mm -hmm. I'm not making more of a mess because I tried not to make a mess. Mm. Is that all of Garden? Oh boy. All of Garden? Maybe mm -hmm. that sounds good. Oh. Maybe I'll put an Olive Garden someday. Right someday. Out. Olive Garden. Garden. Stop it. Turn over, jackass. Who's going to Olive Garden without me? <laughs> He's on TV. Oh. Commercial. Just had all of bird on Friday. Hmm. You didn't invite us. <laughs> yeah, I invite us. What did you eat at Olive Garden on Friday? Did you get the fettuccine Alfredo? Hmm? Laura, she had Olive Garden on Friday. Wait, did you need, we need to get out and we, I want to go to Chili's and I'm like, <laughs> uh, we will. You know, then you can stop and get your haircut. <laughs> I'm like, oh. He's trying to bribe you with a haircut. I know. <laughs> oh, Friday is girls night out. Oh, we're welcome to come. We should go. Yeah. We're inviting ourselves to your girls' night out. Yeah. <laughs> that would be fun. those in the oven bake the rest of their heads <laughs> their heads pretty flour mm -hmm. yeah. 
Sparkly. Ooh, that's a pretty one. Pretty. I oh, how fun. fun. They oh. eat and craft, or eat, thrift, and craft. <gasps> Shop. Cool. I'm coming next time. Sounds fun to me. Sounds like fun to me. I'm going to cut this one like I did the other. Cut it like I did the other. Yeah, it's good Indiana. Indiana. Oh, she looks yeah. Well, hell. You have a lot of thrift stores there. Got a crate of wreath. Ooh. Yeah. You got a big house so we can come sleep there? Yeah. <laughs> but I bought most of mine, Kim. Mine just haven't been using them. What? Oh, don't even tell me, Chloe. Really? <sighs> What's the matter? What do you want? Oh, whoops. <sighs> Trying to make me get up again. Goodwill on Fridays. Goodwill on Friday. Tiny, tiny house? No. Oh. Well, you don't mind staying in the hotel while we stay at your house, right? Oh. Uh, I'm joking. Of course. What did you, what'd you, what'd you, what'd you say? What? What did you say? I said, I asked her, you don't mind staying in the hotel while we stay at your house, right? Oh. <laughs> I'm thinking. Oh, really? <laughs> That's why she said tiny house. I'm just making a mess out of this now at this point. That's okay. We would adjust. <clears throat> Camp out in the backyard. Yeah. Because Liza has a pool. Mm -hmm. She has a pool? Nice. <laughs> For her to stay in the motel. Uh uh uh. Our motels have pools, definitely. But... Oh, you don't have a pool? Oh, well, forget it. <laughs> <laughs> She's going to stay in the motel with a pool. And mm -hmm. then, yeah, yeah. she thinks. <laughs> she doesn't enjoy it. That's what I just did. I made a mess of things. I made a mess of my flowers. Dallas and Oklahoma City. Why are they showing those? Mm -hmm. I don't know. I don't like that after all. Memphis, 95. Where are we at? I'm in Arizona. I'm in Tennessee. This is in Timbuktu. I'm in Timbuktu, Tennessee. <laughs> Timbuktu, Tennessee. <laughs> yeah. Too bright, nah. Too 
Slightly not. Where's the green place on that? I don't know. Oh boy. I don't have any green either. What the hell's the matter with me? This is a tragedy of justice. <laughs> <laughs> this, is this is a tapestry of justice. You and justice. Put one of these guys on. Hmm. In the center. Yes. Hmm. Okay. Okay, Letitia. You have a good rest and good night, Letitia. See you soon. Night, 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 night. Do we dream? Can we dream? I'm sorry. <laughs> it's a hairball, you know. No, you're not gonna stick. You're not gonna stick. If you don't stick, I'll kill you. Mm -hmm. Where is my pokey thing? One. We got one, two, three, four, <clears throat> four on the baking block, and two more. The back of their heads will be done. Done, done, done. Do I need it? Yeah, I need it. Um. <clears throat> Around the glue, right on the glue side. Why is that? Because the world is in bone cold. Rhonda. Rhonda with an R. Would you sleep it? Are you catching some Z's? What do you think of them apples? <gasps> Ooh. I like it. That's perfect. Do you like them apples? Perfect. Yeah, let's see that they're green. Green iridescent, but they are. Really nice. Very pretty. Thank you. 
Oh, you're getting ready for, I remember you saying you were going to have a garage sale. Mm, garage sale? Uh, fun. How much are you selling your garage for? Phil <laughs> uh, uh, said it's killing her because she doesn't get ready for the... Another one. <laughs> it sounds like <clears throat> me and Noreen, we'd always have every weekend for a long time. <laughs> you just yeah. have yard sales? Yep. Awesome. What, what were you selling? Oh my God. Ah, I don't know where we got half the stuff I swear. It was, you know, stuff that she's collected and just didn't want and stuff. Same with me and, um, just oh my gosh, we'd just be selling away. Functioning <laughs> boys that care not. literally had a yard sale every single weekend? Yep. What would you do with the stuff during the week? Put it back in the garage? Mm-hmm. <laughs> oh, you know, then we, we slowed down, of course. You know, I mean, we wouldn't, like, but even in hot summer, we'd, she was up to it, Noreen, she would sit there and she'd do the money. <laughs> and Dwayne would help, too. He'd bring everything out and 
okay. I actually put everything back. So that's pretty good. Pretty nice. He was probably happy that you were making money. Yeah. Well, actually, it was for me, it was mine. He didn't get any. Right. Uh, but you were spending less of his money. Exactly. <laughs> exactly. He was like, hey, it's fine with me. They're spending less of my money. I know. <laughs> I mean, we were, we probably make on the average of about five, six hundred at least, just on a weekend? Yeah, yeah not any big things either. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Nickel and dime stuff, I see. Jesus. Uh huh. Mm-hmm. Yard sales don't usually do that well. Mm-hmm. They loved them. You know, the neighbors, you can have another sale, you can have another sale. When are you going to have a sale? Mm-hmm. But then, you know, she couldn't really, you know, handle the work and stuff like that. And so I'm like, well, and I didn't, I actually did it on myself a few times, but. Hmm. I'm sure it was boring. Mm-hmm. Rather than have your, you know, to have a friend there, at least, at least you're not as bored. Yeah. I said when we did it, Carla, we'd be, people would still come around, but they'd drive up and, like, say their husbands would just wait for them in the car, and they would just go and kind of shop around, and then get back to them. <clears throat> Off they went. Yeah, it was, it was hot. Yeah. They are a lot of work. So you want to put everything away. <laughs> when be putting stuff away, I'd be yeah. Well, you live in a more crowded area than I do. Yeah. I had like two yard sales here, I think, and neither of them did that great. So I don't see those anymore. I can't be I remember bothered, you but... filmed one. Yeah, we were live streaming that time, I think. Yep. I think. Either I was recording or live streaming or something. Um, something. I think you did the live stream. And, oh. Yeah. All right, I'm done with these stupid flowers. Moving on. Huh? I said moving on. Moving, moving on. Moving and grooving. You say, well, you got to get rid of all that stuff. You, you know, we'll give it, put it out for the big brothers, big sisters. And I'd be like, yeah. So whenever, a lot of times, whenever we'd be done the weekend, he would call them up and say, we, you know, go pick up in the area. Well, we can, you know, so. But, I mean, I wasn't going to get rid of stuff that I really, you know, I said, well, I'm going to keep it for our next sale. I just don't want to. Yeah. You know. But it was stuff that did not sell after, you know, too many garage sales. <laughs> like, okay. Right, right. Let me get rid of it. Hmm. You remember it, Carla? Remember what? The yard sale. The live stream, I mean. Oh. Yeah. Hmm. 
when I had my bike out there, remember? And then I ended up not selling it. <laughs> I said, no, nah, I'm not going to sell it. <laughs> uh -huh. My bike. I, I was almost going to sell my bike, and then I decided not to. Oh, yeah. <laughs> You'd be very ready to. So I'd be like that, too, and I'd be like, no, I'm not ready to sell this, or I'm not ready to sell that. You That's know? the only thing I wasn't ready to sell. Anything else I didn't care about, but the bike I did. I was almost gonna get rid of it, but you know, anything else, I didn't. I put a bunch of stuff out there I didn't want. Yeah. I don't care. I can get rid of anything. Not anything, but you know what I mean. Like I'm not somebody who can't find things to get rid of when the time comes. Because oh boy, can I? Yeah. I'll go through and practically empty the house out of stuff. And be like, okay, I'm getting rid of this. 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 <laughs> it's all going. Oh boy, what I just drop in the garbage Ron said you need to come there and help her. <laughs> come where and help who? Rhonda. Help Rhonda? Uh-huh. With what? What are we helping with her yard show? Oh. Uh -huh. When I lived in New Jersey, I used to have awesome live yard sales. I'd make funky funny signs for people to follow to the yard sale. <laughs> I put like these big post. I we'd spend like all night long making these big poster board signs, you know. And I put things like you know, um, humongous, extravagant, amazing yard sale. Blah, blah. I'd give them signs like every road. And some of them I put, "Hurry, tell your husband to turn left, yard sale." <laughs> oh jeez! <laughs> like we put all kinds of things. And we would just put all kinds of funky things. We put, you won't believe what you'll see at this yard sale. <laughs> All kinds of, like, we'd put some crazy signs up. And we'd get people there, and we tons of people there, and they'd be like, we just came because of your signs. They were so funny. We get, like, I'm talking, we'd have lots of people there just showing up to oh, see yeah. what the hell, uh, what, what, what was the deal of the signs. Uh, one day she was like, I was laughing so hard. <laughs> oh. I normally don't stop for yard sales, but that was so funny. <laughs> they were not buying stuff, and then I, you know, so I made good money at those yard sales. That was up north, though. It was a lot more easier there because of where I lived. I'll be right back. I'm gonna get my my stuff out. Open. Actually, okay. I'll get this stuff in. Hook it up. Last steel skulls. Steel skulls. Alright, where am I putting these now? Somewhere. They will go somewhere. Now they just go out the way. I do have these butterflies I cut out too, which I'll save. Different sizes and things. And some dress forms. And a couple of these. And there. Little school pieces. Circle. Some butterfly pieces. And big butterflies. Extreme. Mm, 
gear. I don't know where the other gears took off to. They're around somewhere. I cut that out of a piece of faux leather. And I need to find a place for those. Something to put them in. Crap. I have nothing <laughs> to put them in. I'm sure I have a basket somewhere. Hmm. Okay. Let's see. Let me get her here. Hmm. Let me see if I can find a basket. Hold on there. Oh, wait, I found something here. Something here. I found something right here. I'll just pile them up in this thing on my bobber. Flower power. Now that won't come off. Since I wet the bottom of it and put a stuck it on, now it's really stuck on there. It ain't coming off. Look, mom, no hands. I see they're different. Are they different sizes? No? No? No, they're not. Okay. I don't know. I ordered all these, but I didn't realize some of them were exactly the same. Okay. I just cut out multiples at once. There's Carla. Where have you been, Carla? Sleeping? Or been sleeping. Slacking off. Sleeping and slacking. How dare you sleep, Carla? You're not supposed to be human. And sleep. You should 
try out my new dies. That's a good idea. Don't you think? Let's see. Let's do whatever the hell this will do. Hit at this here thing. Since it's here, otherwise I guess you use my other one. But... Okay. This was your green right here. What's this? What's not, what goes on this one? I always forget. This go on this? Like that? It seems off the list. I forget how this goes. This doesn't go in there, does it? Both of these. Am I missing something? Um, oh, not, yeah, but that should be the same thickness as it, no? I don't know what's happening. I don't know what's happening. Oh, okay, maybe that does go. Oh, never mind. It goes. left us. She no longer wants to be in our family. She deserved this. Sorry. Where'd you go? I had to go floss my teeth. Oh, popcorn? <laughs> yeah. I felt like I was pushing my crabs or something. It was really weird. I was like, oh my god, what, they fall off or something? There must have been something under it, like, pushing up on them. Yeah. <laughs> like, the pressure. Did flossing help? So I kept, no, pretty much. Yeah. I hope they're not popping off. Hmm. I'm still coming way too far in, I think. Oh, those are cool. Oh, I have those. You do? Yeah. Um, yeah, I got this whole set of dies, and I forgot that I got them, because I'm a dumbass, you know, as one is. I saw it sitting on my chair when I went to put the things away, and I'm like, what is that? And I opened it, and I'm like, oh, normally it was in there. Hmm. You know what? Normally, you know. Uh, uh-oh. Uh oh, what? Oh, crap. Oh, no. You gotta be kidding me. My thing just went in there and now it's all at the bottom. Jackass. Come on, man. Oh, hi. hi, Carla. Let's see. There it is. Oh, no. Son of a bitch. Oh, it went into the trash. You know those last two crowns I said that they had to put them together to have more. Yeah. I think they're loose. Oh, oh really? 
Yeah, we need to go to a different dentist. This dentist can't seem to get to get his shit straight. I mean, how many times are you gonna lose your crowns before? <laughs> and, then, and then he's probably gonna make you pay for them. And they shouldn't be coming loose. Either that or you're chewing on rocks. <gasps> they are. They're loose. I can feel them. I'm, they're moving up and down. Yeah. They're, they're guaranteed. So. Oh, that's good. Well, at least they're guaranteed. They don't have like they probably could take them up and then just i hope put them back down because but they're don't use them they're loose oh, man. So bizarre. why would they be loose that's so weird <sighs> but, I mean, they, sh they shouldn't go that get that loose i don't understand why they, they keep having I know. <laughs> you know i wonder because they said because well, remember it took longer because they the lab just didn't they didn't like the way they came back like and so they sent them back to the lab right and maybe they they're just weren't glued on right you know sometimes that glue gets it doesn't set right or something yeah. i'm like oh my god don't tell me uh, yep that sucks uh -huh. I don't know. They're yeah. loose. I can feel them. Huh? <laughs> I know it's loose. I can put my nail underneath and lift, and I can feel it. Oh, no. Well, don't play with it. Leave it alone. <sighs> don't mess with it because you're gonna make it worse. Damn, no matter. <laughs> I love call my dentist. Only first so open. I'm trying to get in by at least you know tomorrow or the next day. Yeah. Tell them to cement the damn thing in this time. Yeah. Tell him either he cemented or you're gonna cement it. You're right. You Tell him your friend it. offered to cement it for you. I'll do it. I'll come and weld it on. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I was like, here. <laughs> Which side is it on? Just don't chew on that side. It's the the right hand bottom. Yeah. yeah. Don't chew on that side. That's all for the next day or so. Yeah. Chew on the other side. I was just thinking, you know, everything's done, Dennis is done, and I always said, well, you never know about that, but. Yeah. <laughs> sure enough. We were just talking about the dentist the other day. Yep. Darn. Well, now I'm going to mention the word dentist. <laughs> That's what you do. Trouble start. Don't mention the, the oh, he found the garbage. Oh, no. <laughs> Oh, Doo -doo -doo. Poor guy. <laughs> oh no, that means whoever whoever he's modeled after. <laughs> is that me? Am I gonna be, I just dropped something in the garbage. How weird is that? <laughs> I'm the one that told you to make them, so maybe I'm gonna go in the garbage. <laughs> oh, I need to drill them out a little bit. have to be well um yeah because well Dwayne's well you might be able to drop him off and then go because you can, probably can't even go in the hospital anyway and then go to the dentist and come back and get him maybe if you you know if the appointment is set right you know what I mean it might work yeah. out this they, is cool. uh, it's gonna take at least an hour and a half or so yeah. They can take that long for them to glue that back in, I'm sure. I hope not. <sighs> I hope not either. With you, everything seems to be complicated, though. <laughs> I know, right? You'll get in there and they'll be like, well, we got to do this, we got to do that. <laughs> Send them back. $2,000, please, and you could say, kiss my ass. Oh, my God. <laughs> can you imagine? <laughs> you better not. <laughs> well, that's when you tell me to kiss your ass. That's right. Much money as I spent there. I know. You're putting his kids through college every time you go in there. <laughs> Going to. He's, he has twins and a little girl, and they're like uh, oh, one. Yeah. You're paying their college fund. <laughs> Give me a credit card, and I'll just, yeah, put, just, it put, it on, yeah, just put it on there. Let me punch all the way through. Stupid 
thing. Hey, get back here, fool. Hey, Jesus. Mm, they are, yeah. Plus the, you know, the insurance company will be like, okay, well, you know, say so we can get, Dennis says she can either get an implant or the two crowns. Well, and then the insurance comes back with, <laughs> well, two, the two crowns are cheaper, so that's, that's what we're paying for. No implant. Oh, yeah, they don't pay for implants. Are you kidding me? Uh, I'm like, fine, whatever. <laughs> Much cheaper, yeah. Hmm. At least I have some leaves. There's a gnat. Gnat? Get rid of them. Or a, or a something flying around here. Something. Yeah. Get rid of them. <sighs> You've been flying around. So that goes in. Oh, I forgot. We've got some of these out. There he is, where is he? Let's put that. We got a silver cardstock here. I think uh, my finger can use a little help. Yeah. Oh, I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm drooling on the side of the head. Uh, um, Stephanie said, Jane. Hey. get frustrated die cutting but not with that I don't yes look at that yeah that's good that to this once before. Me? I could have sworn I did, yeah. I I, I, don't, I just feel like I did. Hmm. You can miss. You might have. Let's cut another, shall we? Mm. I will send you another link. Okay. Because you need it. Okay. You need it. You do. Mm. Everybody. <clears throat> I'll say, it'll, it'll change your life. Yes. Yes. Yeah. 
Mmm. We made cookies and cream the other day. Ice cream. Well, ice cream? Ice cream. Yeah. Oreo cookie. Yeah. Oh, Oreo good too. Whoa. Oh, crap. Just drove right. Get my Fig Newtons at the store. Do you know what he did? He got me no name brand Fig Newtons. I was like, what the hell is this? And he's like, they didn't have Fig Newtons. I'm like, then don't get me anything. I don't want no name brand. They're gross. Oh. They are. I, I, you know, fig, the no name brand like snack stuff is gross. Never oh, yeah. I was very disappointed. He did yeah. that with the cookies too. So both the cookies I wanted were both they didn't have them. I'm like, well, how? I'm like, okay, whatever. Oh. Yeah. Oh, well. Thank you for wasting my money. I appreciate it. I ain't gonna eat yeah. it. Wow. Eight brand cookies. Ugh. Gross. Yeah. I don't like them either. I just can't get the formula right for some reason. I know. Cheap, cheap everything. Yuck. Yeah. Yuck. Skim. That's it. Skim on things. He's a skimper. Who is? On those cookies. They skim. No, they just, yeah, well, they, yeah, oh, yeah, they do. They just taste like yeah. crap, yeah. We do. Yeah, they didn't they just didn't have them at the grocery store, but it was frustrating. I hate when they don't have things I want. But you thought he had to get those? Yeah, I'm like, since when do you know me to ever want the no name brand? I would rather have nothing. I'd rather wait and go to a different store. Right. I don't know what, who he thinks he was buying them for, but he knows me better, well enough to know I ain't gonna eat the no name brand. <laughs> I'm like, what? Well, what are you doing? <laughs> yeah, I, I don't like those. I don't like most of the no name brands on those either. They're grody. They're grody. Yeah. They're grody. I know. Not the same. They hold up. You want to float? I have enough. I have stuff to make with your float. I should make a move here, Flo. Make you jealous. <laughs> <laughs> she has to go buy some stuff for me. Always stuff on hand to make a root beer float. Are you kidding me? <laughs> I haven't had one in a while, but I always have the stuff on hand just in case. <laughs> Keep a bottle of root beer and the vanilla ice cream always. Mm. It's a staple. Yeah. You know how that root beer float craving is going to hit. You got to make sure you got your paraphernalia. <laughs> Ooh. Oh, that's that one. Oh, man. No, actually, this is a different one than that other one. I have that other one, too. This is slightly different. Oh. Yeah, I have that. Where is that other one? Uh, is it in my binder? Oh, it might be. Let's see. Nice. Let's see. My mind, uh. yeah, it's scrap paper. Oh, this is that journal. And I said I wanted to work on a journal, did I not? Yes, you did. And here I started doing something. <laughs> and I started doing something. What's wrong with me? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. All right, so I just get off. I don't like you. Get off there. Oh, you are not welcome here. Uh, I'm cleaning the air. Mm. The sense will go down here. It's sitting in the heat. Oh, and my jelly's just sitting in the heat. Good place for it. In a heat. In question. I'd like to cut some more of those because I always use them a lot. 
and cut some onions too. Uh, which one do I go for? Oh, that. This, this one. Let's see how this one is different than this one, but these would make a cute layering. Mm. Yeah, these are some of my favorite. These guys here. We'll cut some of those. Mm. What else? What else? What else? What else? Um, what else? We cut. Feathers. Love that one. Ooh, background eyes. I need background eyes. Mm -hmm. This one. Let's try it. Oh. What's y'all doing in there? Okay. Mm -hmm. My tree. What the that for? My other tree. Let's just cut them. Let's just do it. Yeah. Just do it. Do it. Just do it. that are in like a thing somewhere around here. I don't know. I think I put them. Where did I put those? Oh, they're over here. No, that's not them. Where did I put them? Oh, I have these. I don't even need them. I have those new ones that I got. Those like framey things. Let's see. Um, let's just we'll do this one. And the... Uh, this, some of that, some of this, and some of that. Some of that, some of that. Some of these, some of that. Sticky. Ooh, sweaty. Sticky balls. 
You can have root beer or ice cream. Definitely. Order some. Post made it. There you go. Time to get here right now. It's an emergency. I need root beer and I need ice cream right now. Punk tool. Who usually use Stephanie's Postmates? Do they deliver this hour, or would they tell you no? Who delivers? Postmates. Never heard of them. 
yeah, they'll deliver groceries, or you can, like, ask them to deliver, like, if you, I need a, you know, a pair, I need some NyQuil and this and that, they'll go get it for you. Hmm. You, know, you can have them go to CVS or Walmart or wherever you need them to go, and they'll get it for you. Hmm. Okay. Personal shopper. Everybody needs that. Hmm. Yeah. Rhonda wants to know what you're working on now. I'm die cutting. Mm, die cutting. <laughs> Cut it back and pull it out. Yeah. No. One of my favorite dyes is this brown. It's like some ghosty thing. You don't trust them? Really? Oh, really? They stole huh. money from me. Oh, and really? They kept asking me. Sucks. No, I never. Give it back. Oh. Because, I, mean, I don't trust the, the other one that we have around here is called, um, uh, what is it called? Mm -hmm. Um, oh crap, I can't remember. I'm trying to put them both on here, but I'm having a hard time. I can't remember the name of the one that we use here. It's um, Instacart. That's it. They stole from me. Oh, yeah. Postman's but not here where I live. It's in Nashville. It's down further towards the city because where I live, they don't like to come over this yonder way. Mm -hmm. Come on, why it was that stick, jackass? Carla lives in the middle of nowhere, so no postmates that way. Dots. That die leaves behind little fun little circles that you can punch out of things. Put those in. Make them this one. What are you shooting over there? <laughs> My drill. <laughs> you drilling it? Yeah. Yeah, that's glass. <laughs> get excited now. Don't get all excited. Come on, fool. Get out. Hey, there's the middle of nowhere. I don't know how I feel about. 
so it's not like a very good quality one. Hmm. I remember that one always giving me issues if I don't run it through several times. Oh, wow. But it's good now. It's all good. All good. Good. In the neighborhood. Good in the neighborhood. No, I haven't. Have you, Stephanie? Poking little tiny holes. Poke, 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 poke. Pig in the poke. Poke, poke. Very intricate little guy, but it's not fun. It's a fun one. I love that. It's always a bit of a bitch because of the fact that it's so intricate and it's a cheaper die. So it's a little on the wonky side. It's wonkified. to know what that is. She goes, what is that? What, what is? I think it's the, the die. It's just a what, geometrical shape or something? Yeah, it's just like a geometric die that's good for, you know, like putting in backgrounds and stuff. seen that yeah gross mm, yuck. <laughs> yuck she says mm -hmm. i'm saying no thank you but uh, back to the next person Oops. Thank you. 
Dana. Dana. Hey, Dana. Let's see if this one pops out because I didn't mean to pull that out of there without checking it, and I don't think it's gonna do the trick because of that stupid thing. Hmm. I don't think, but I don't know either. Maybe. Oh, I'm missing one of the dots. Get back here. No. Oh. I'm losing my dots. Problem. Thanks, Dana. Mm -hmm. Yeah, little creatures that they are. Put that there. Yeah, my my skulls. I forgot. And I overcooked that. to cut through because they have that plastic behind them. So they don't like to be cut properly. I don't know if I've ever tried cutting them upside down. Maybe that would help. But this thing does the best job on it, but it's still not perfect. But at least it's not as nearly as bad as without it. What's the matter? That is that glitter cardstock that has the plastic behind it that I hate cutting. Mm. I love the way it is because it's like you don't have the glitter fall out, but unfortunately the stupid plastic prevents it from cutting properly. Do you know that I found that little tiny cutter does the best job? Oh really? Yeah, on this mm. stuff. I don't know how, but here I'm gonna cut the same die out of the same glitter paper and show you how it'll cut out, and I don't have to even do anything i think it'll i think i've done this die before i think i think it'll work okay. like in other words it'll fit i think this one fits with the other one rondely uh-huh how are you and to get him out out mm -hmm. uh, lemon a lemon. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Who needed a lemon? The dogs? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. 
Miss Outshine bar I have. Oh, oh, you got your lemon ones? Uh-huh. Found them. Where'd you find them? Ugh, see, like this is not cutting properly. I think they were at one of the Walmarts or Fry's, I can't remember. Mm -hmm. Yeah, they're good. <laughs> Addicting. I'm going to have some cookies and cream Coke float. Ooh, go. See that? Boy, Stephanie. Sounds good too. Sounds like it all tastes good. You can make a Coke float, it'll be good. Mm -hmm. I used to drink those all the time. You, can, you don't have to use just root beer, you can use all kinds of things. Yeah. Make a float. Yeah, let's see. I'm okay, tangled up there, but oh. I'm going to do the same one on some glitter paper. The same glitter paper. It might not be the same color, but it's the exact same paper. I'll put on this green one. And I'll use the little one and show you the difference. Because I think I've done this before and it was cutting perfectly. With this little metal piece, which is mangled. Get the glasses. Hmm. Why can't I read that first? Wow. Oh, jeez. You going to take them back? Fun. You get your back, huh? Mm -mm. I guess it's a problem. First of all, some of these things have like perforation that doesn't perforate. A little rip it. I don't understand. Cheap ass mother truckers. Yeah. Make your perforation work it or don't put it there at all. Mm -hmm. Idiots. Stupid idiots. Mm -hmm. Now you, back to your regularly scheduled programming. Stop slipping and sliding, fool. so don't work freaking at monitors. Right. Yeah, mine used to be that way. <laughs> Not used to them, I guess. I went through one time. It's slipping and sliding because <laughs> I wet the thing. <laughs> And see, and it's always this exact same spot that does it. Always the exact same place it does it in. Doesn't that, it, that it doesn't cut the, right there. So I think it's this dye. I think it's because it's a cheap AliExpress dye. Mm. Yeah. It's 
I guess I'll have to tell them. Yeah, I would. I wonder if I I wonder if I took this because that was hard for my hands to crank. I put that metal thing on there too. Put it above it and see if that makes a difference on that one. It's the little paper. Here we go. I get it to cut. Right, would you hold still here, dude? Problem. Hmm. Oh, yeah, anyway. yeah. oh, there we go. Right? Mm -hmm. No, Rhonda. He's like mine too. Still doesn't want to cut all the way through, though. It's like that plastic or something. It's got this weird plastic coating on the back of the pieces. Mm. I, don't, I don't understand. And it, like, it'll do this instead of like cutting, it'll stretch oh. and pull off. Yeah, yeah. And it doesn't like to cut through very well. It'll cut through in some spots, but like a lot of other places it won't, no matter how much pressure I put on it, too. It's just a shitty die, that's all. It's just shitty. Mm. Run it through a thousand times, but it probably won't make a difference. Carla says, um, the smaller die cut machine puts more pressure all over where the larger machine and platform has more on edge on the edges. Right, right. Yeah, I could be right about that. Oh. I could be right about that. Mm. Mm. Mm -hmm. Rhonda, um, that's if you tried adding more shims. Yes, I did. I've mm -hmm. added more than, more than enough, and if it ain't going to work, it just ain't going to work. 
It's just a really shitty, cheap ass dye. That's all. It was from AliExpress, and it's just a cheap dye. I've never been able to cut this thing properly. I don't think once. It's always had breaks in it, or I had to cut it in some way. It just never has cut through properly since I got it. So it's not the die cutter. It's the stupid die. If you have that much problem with a die, then it's not, you know, ow. And yeah. it's not you. It's not the die cutter. It's the die. They just made a, sh you know, it's a, just a shit die. Mm -hmm. There's nothing you can do about that. I think they might have cut it uneven or something. The metal was not, doesn't touch evenly in spots or something. Yeah, right. Too. And this, this glitter paper is extremely hard to cut with any dye. This glitter paper that has this weird plasticky background back on it, very difficult to cut because it wants to cut through the one layer, but not the other. And then when you try to pull it, it just rips the whole thing. So it's, right just a really crappy paper for dyeing, but at the same time, it's, you know, I don't have much other glitter cardstock. Well, it's got to go. It cuts good on the, with my, um, you know, with my steel roll dyes will cut through it, of course, but not the thinlets have a real hard time with this stuff. Hmm. It's not a paper. It's more of a plastic. You know what I mean? Like, I, I don't think there's much paper involved in this cardstock this glitter cardstock i think it's more of a just a plastic because it literally stretches and breaks it doesn't like rip it like stretches it'll like i can't even explain it it just like it'll stretch and then it'll pop because it's just and like it peels off layer like right here like it peeled off the white you see the white underneath because it'll literally peel off the, to the plastic and it does that a lot too. It's just a combination of a crappy die and a crappy die, crappy glitter card stock. Cheap glitter card stock, I should say, because that's what it is. Yeah. It was like the cheap kind. It wasn't like anything. I just thought because it had the no glitter like fallout, I was like, oh, that would be nice because then I don't have to worry about glitter being everywhere. See what it does? Look, I'll show you here. See if you can see it. I don't know if it'll show. Let me see. <laughs> move this out of the way you can see what i mean by the fact that it stretches and rips instead of instead of rips it stretches and breaks like right there that's that right there is oh see it you see how it stretched oh. it doesn't rip it's literally plastic wow that's why this stuff is so hard to cut because it, the thinlets don't want to go through this stuff <laughs> I've been with other dyes. I'm able to get it to go through on the little machine and other machines. This dye is it's like this dye sucks. I was able to get it to cut. This is the same glitter cardstock. I was able to get it to work with this. You know, it's just this dye is really difficult. So it makes everything twice as hard. Because hmm. this die cut doesn't even like to cut paper. This particular die cut. I have a hard time. Like, like I'll show you when I cut paper. I also have a hard time with this die. It's just not a just not a good one. I'm not gonna fuss with that now. I can't be bothered. It's too tedious of a thing to do. I don't like to do it. Mm -hmm. uh, so and like all these little bits it leaves behind as you're trying to get it, like it looks like snow on my hand. Those are plastic pieces. It's a nice cardstock to use when you want like something with no fallout, but but not for die cutting. Here's purple. I'll use any other dye will pretty much do fine. Or it will actually I'll first show you that on paper. This one has a hard time as well. I think I'll just cut it out of the green here and it'll a lot of times it'll struggle with this too. Not all the time, but a lot of time. Oh, let me dry that off. I wiped it with the baby wipe.
there are usually spots. Nope, this one actually cut pretty good this time on the wire then. It looks like it anyway. Let me see. It looks like it did pretty good. But I usually I do I usually have problems with this one more than any other die. It's probably because I put those shims. Yep, see right here it's getting caught. It didn't cut all the way through in some spots. Like right here it's stuck. The pieces are like stuck right there. It might come off though with a little coaxing more than with the glitter cardstock. Yeah, it'll come off. It just doesn't like to cut as nicely as other dies do. Mm -hmm. Different. I love this die, but it's just problematic. Okay, it looks like I'll be able to get it out. All the little pieces, hopefully. Yeah, okay. I think I'll be able to get it out. Better than the glitter cardstock, but there are lots of times I've had problems with it, even with just cardstock. And this is a thinner cardstock, too. A lot of my dies will cut right through the the heavier cardstock, but I don't think this one would really. Yeah, it's coming out. Yeah. It's a nice die. I wish it would just cut better. I wish it wasn't such a pain in the butt. It's a pain in the butt. out easier and it doesn't rip it's not taking as much effort to get it out it's not feeling like it's gonna rip it's just that one and I got them all together this die this die that die and that die I got them all together from the same place so I just think that one is just defective this is the only part that's been so far, that one area which did I think rip a little bit. Yeah, see right here I'm having a problem, but it's just so weird how it'll be a problem in like one little area, but not in others. I mean, why you gotta be that way? Glitter paper. Always, always, always.
some scissors because it sucks so bad to repair. My grab can't seem to cut at the tip of them at all. It's like they just decide to stop working. Come here, Jack. See, it wants to stretch and break again. Instead of just whipping. that whole section. Stupid. What's the point of having a die that doesn't cut? in a couple places, but at least I got the majority of it out. I'm telling you, it's just a pain in the ass. Don't buy this glitter paper and expect to die cut with it. It will be miserable. It's this stuff. It's design cut to the views, the glitzy stack. There's the pastels and there's the other ones. Any of those are terrible. Terrible to die cut. They're pretty, but they suck to die cut. They're not no fun. No funds. This stuff is okay. This pearly paper is good. Because it's actual paper. It's not plastic. That stuff cuts well. Cuts without a problem. Working on your play game? Yeah, still needing uh, the, the translucent is really tough. Is it? Yeah, and I'm uh, mixing it with the white still because I don't, it, it's toughening up the white so it's easier to mold. It's oh. tough. Does it hurt your hands to use? Um, not too much. Yet. <laughs> a couple pieces of glitter was still in there. I'm like wondering why it seemed weird. Didn't cut well in those areas because of that. Yes. Ouch. Sometimes it helps to take the roller. It gives some more leverage on the, you know, on the roller than with your fingers. Mm -hmm. And, uh, I did this uh, <clears throat> this little stake right here. Oh, we talked about this. 
Yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. That's cool. I, I got one there. Oh, that's you. There. <laughs> oh, that's so cool. And, and that was on the one that you had already done, right? No. Oh, well, this is the one, you know. Oh, that's a different one? And remember we talked about the steak and different. Yeah, yeah. I just didn't know like if you made that. another one because I knew you had that initial mummy but, or voodoo doll. Yeah. I know the same voodoo doll that you drilled holes into. But now I have to figure um, how to or how to keep them, you know, like. What do you mean? Remember we talked like how to keep them from where you can put them in places, but you won't lose them. Like. Well, you're going to put a little, do you have those tiny little eyelet screws that can go on the top of that pin that you got there? Well, yeah, I do. I was thinking that I was trying to, I was trying to avoid putting it on the top, but I don't think there's that. I don't think there's a way to put it, I would imagine. Yeah. Or maybe out the side of it. I don't know. Yeah. It's probably going to have to go on the top. Hmm. Well, I think I do have. Hmm. Unless I use that for something. I have these ones like. Like we had ordered. Well, actually, I could put. I could put a little eye pin in there. You know, glue a little eye pin. Yeah. I think I'll make one. I'll make one. Let's make it. Yeah. Let's make one. Yeah. That cool. Didn't you get these from me, Janie, when I had them in my store, some of these? I did, yeah. yeah. I got some from myself. Sure did. Um.
What it broke. Oh no! Oh, no. You know what I think it was? It was I. It was the only thing in the oven with these that baked as long. It baked too much. I know it oh, did. Really? They'll they'll break if if you bake them too long. This one, but it's so little. Oh, uh, yeah. So I'm thinking. Hmm. Oops. Can you bake it? Well, can't you make it and then bake it with the thing in it? So then it's already in there. Yeah. Maybe it wasn't because it. I don't know why it broke. Maybe just because I. Yeah, I have to do it before because <laughs> I don't hmm. think it's maybe because I baked it so long. It was just because that thing was, you know, too much for it. Where's my cat? Yeah. Did I cut break? No, I just accidentally had the paper shifted over a little too much. Oh. But it's fine. The paper shifted on me. I, didn't, I didn't, wasn't careful enough. I wasn't being careful. Now we will not have shifting. No shift. No shifting. Don't be shifty. Shifties and nifties. 
Still doing something, Stephanie? You working on something? You doing a little something, something? my other background dies and I want to also use my um uh glossing folders since I have this thing out. When I get the one from you at least I'll be able to keep it by my desk and I won't have to keep this thing because <laughs> I, I can't I have nowhere to keep that by my desk. Yeah. It's so much easier to have a little one when you want to do something quick, you know, like oh I want to just do this background paper or whatever. You know, that's why I sit and have to do things a thousand at a time because you know I know I'm not going to get this back out again once I put it away for a while. Oh, no. If I have that little one next to me, then I'll be able to just go boom, boom, boom if I want something. You know. Boom, boom. 
まあまあまあThis in the oven while it's still warm. I bet you it'll cook just like that because it's so tiny. Yeah. Coloring in your Kirby book? What's a Kirby book? Pink 
King Kirby? Yeah, I don't know what that is. Oh, neither. This is her coloring in her Pink Kirby book. I'm like, what the hell is that? Oh. What is that? What is it? Oh, author? Author Kirby Rothanes. What does she write? I mean, oh, she makes coloring books? I get it. I understand, I think. Hmm. Pink. Oh, not a pink. Oh, I'm confused. Oh, Kirby's a he. Oh, what did I say? She? Oh. Hmm. Duh. Kirby is hmm. more of a name. I don't know why I was saying she. Yeah, I'm an idiot. Oh. I'm allowed to be. This could be a he or a she. Could, true. Could be. You thought you're you, you mean the vacuum? <laughs> <laughs> the Kirby vacuum? Yeah. Mm Kirby from PlayStation? PlayStation. Hmm. I'm not sure what that what? is. Same. Nintendo, I don't know what that is. I know what PlayStation is, but I don't understand hmm. what the Kirby is. What Kirby hmm. is. I'm confused. What could it be? What can it be now? Oh. Oh, Nintendo Okay. Oh, you thought she was talking about Nintendo Okay. <laughs> Stephanie was pulling our leg. Mm -hmm. The goal. Mm -hmm. Right? I think a punishment is in order. Punishment. Mm -hmm. 
30 eyelashes. Give them up. Hand them over. I'm going to make something with my dyes after I cut them out, I promise. Mm -hmm. I'm going to, I swear. I mean it, I really mean it. You swear you're going to. I will, because I'm going to get a, I'm going to do um, one more set of these, and I'm going to do a background dye, and I'm going to do a tree and stuff, and then I'm going to make a fun thing. After oh. I cut some more out. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, I mean it. Cool, cool. I mean it, I really do. Because it's Sunday, and Sunday is stay up late day. Because tomorrow, I can sleep how long as I want. Because I said so. I think so. I don't think I have... Oh, no. Please tell me I don't have a doctor's appointment tomorrow. I'm going to scream. It's Monday. What's to? I know. I don't know where my phone went. Where did my phone... Oh, oh there it goes. There it is. I just got cuts. I hope they didn't send me the thing that says, Hey, you're dying. Hey, hey, hey. Your appointment is... Mm -hmm. Reminder, no RX. So what do I have to pick up? I have first. Oh no. Huh? What? Oh no. Go away. Where? I'm blocking a number. Spam. Reminder, appointment 823. Oh, damn it. Damn it! I do have. I'm gonna probably reschedule it for Tuesday because there ain't no freaking way. I knew it. Like in my head, I'm like, I bet you. I bet you. I'm. I'm just gonna reschedule it. I don't need to go tomorrow. For what? So, and for my pain freaking clinic. Mm. Every month I go, and every month I depend on them to send me the reminder, <laughs> and they do. Uh -oh. But they always send it like. You know, I wish they would send it two days before instead of the day before. Yeah. Try for months. Then at least I'd be more prepared. But they send it literally like the afternoon before, and I never check it until the evening or late at night or the next morning, and I'm like, crap. So I'm going to have to. I'll, I'll reset it. For Wait a minute. Days. They say it's for Monday? Yeah, it's for the 23rd, which is today, Monday. Oh, okay. Mm -hmm. Yeah. I had a feeling because I knew it had to be coming up because I usually get my, my meds refilled on the 24th. So I was like, it, it's got to be. And I thought it was going to be last week, late last week, but then it didn't happen. And I thought, oh, I bet you yeah, it's going to be Monday. And I just thought about it now. I was like, oh, yeah, that might be Monday. I always forget when it is. Because <laughs> I'm unorganized. I'm an unorganized <laughs> shithead. All right, all you little die cuts. And you can just, you can just go ahead and re reschedule like that. Oh, yeah, they don't care. They don't care. Yeah. I've rescheduled it five minutes before my appointment. <laughs> They're like, okay. Oh, yeah. Yeah, yeah, I do it all the time. They don't charge me or anything, which is nice. I think they realize that people have, like, pain and stuff. And it's, like, hard sometimes to get places, you know. Uh -huh. I mean, not that I do have pain. That's not why. And usually I, I tell them it's, you know, my, you know, like, I woke up later or whatever, whatever happened. I don't usually have to lie about it. But sometimes I'll, if, if I do that, like, twice in a row, usually I'll, it. I don't like to do it twice in a row. Like I might do it once and then do it like two months down the road or something. Right. Yeah. Most of the time I don't even have to lie. I can just say I either I woke up late or I didn't get any sleep or whatever, you know, uh -huh. and you're fine. The guy that answers the phone, he always laughs because he's always like, he's like, you, he goes, you have such a hard time getting out of the house. I'm like, yes, I do. <laughs> Cause sometimes like I'll call him and be like, you know, I woke up late and I, you know, I'm not going to make it there. I'm not going to get out there on time. And he laughs. laughs. He's a gay guy counter at the thing. He's so, he's so nice. That's funny. He's like, go back to bed, he'll say. Yeah, really. <laughs> he does. He's funny. He's like, go back and get some sleep. And I'll be like, I am. <laughs> he don't care. They don't really care. That's why I like going to them because they don't care if I miss an appointment. Not miss it, but I mean, I call them. But even if I don't call them, if there's a time when I've not called, didn't know I had an appointment, forgot, and then I would realize the next day and call them and be like, uh, 
I didn't see that my appointment was yesterday, and they're like, okay, we'll reschedule it. You know, they don't really fuss. Because literally the appointment takes five minutes. I go in there, I'm out of there in five minutes. Wow. So it's not like a, I guess it's not that big of a deal for them. I don't want that one. I don't want that one. I just want the smile. Smile and what other one? I don't want love. I don't want love. I want forever. I don't want believe. I put hope, I guess. But I don't have much of that these days. Just kidding. Hmm. I'm just going to smile with the last little piece of paper. It's not going to fit any other way, I don't think. Let's see. Um, maybe it will, actually. Let's see. Can I squeeze it in here? No. It's not letting me. I'll just put it like that. Squeezed it in. Actually, I could probably put hope over here. Stephanie wants to know if you're making kits. I'm making what? Kits? No. Oh, um, no. Not right now. But I plan on making kits at some point. I just have to get more stuff for kids. <coughs> because kids, I have mm -hmm. to get stuff for, unless I make kids from stuff I have, which is sometimes okay, but other times it could be a little hard to do. I'm just going to stick a bunch of crap on here. I don't know where I got this one, but I've had it for a long time. It's been in that thing. I haven't even opened it yet. Hmm. Okay, it's like a swirly thing. A heart. Oh, I see. I do have that. I have the actual original. I don't know where I got that one from. I think that came in as like a freebie with when I ordered a bunch of stuff from the another time. They like sent me that one. Is that going to fit? Barely. Okay. Let's do it. Let's do it. Get over here. Get over here, Jack. Oh, yeah, I know they do. Uh -oh. Did you not pull all that? Oh, yeah, you did. I think. Ew. Oh, I gotta run you back through. Are you guys okay over here? Let's see. Is your little thingy, your little thingy. I might have to run the feather back through, but these guys seem to be um, they okay. No, I don't want to. Is this one okay? Get a new one or first. All right? Cool. Good. Oh, that's nice. 
the uh, rheumatoid arthritis. Hmm. I do have to call this morning at some point. See if I can get my shot. Maybe I can get my shot on the same day that I get my go to the pain doctor. Even though they're not in the same area, I just don't have to leave the I can only have to leave the house once would be great. Even if I have to go to Nashville and then all the way to Hendersonville, but I just don't want to have to go twice. I hate to leave the house. It's annoying. If I could never leave the house again, I would. I'd sit around in my underwear and do nothing. No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> Gold circly swirl thing. Oh, that's I like cool. Geometric shapes. I like things that are just geometric shapes. They're fun to use and like layer up and do stuff with. Now this one, okay, as long as it comes out of here. This one can be problematic at times too, this die cut die thing. Sometimes is problematic. Because it is a little on the intricate side, but usually I can get it to work okay. Usually. It's hard to make a voodoo doll holding a pumpkin basket. Oh, that will be cute. Who's doing that, Stephanie? It would be hard to make a voodoo doll holding a pumpkin basket with candy. A voodoo doll holding a pumpkin basket? Hmm. I don't see why not if you give them hands. We'll just put a thing in front and put the basket there. That's pretty gold feather. It's cool. Gold feathers. Gold finger. Cool. Over there. Mm -hmm. The moon. The moon. The easy way, easiest way to do that to clean that out. Probably take a piece of packing tape and, and just yeah, that works. It's easier than poking them with a stupid thing. No pokey. No pokey. No pokey through the holes. Mm -hmm. <coughs> I tickle in my throat. Mm -hmm. Quit tickling me. Quit tickling me. Being problematic here, sir. Excuse me. I hate you. 
to make you be submissive to me. Okay, I'm going to put those over there. I'll put the dumb colors now. The words, whatever they are. Back in the bag. Play? No, I was putting it in this bag here, the, oh. uh, the translucent. Oh, there's a piece in here. Oh, it's I think I'm falling asleep. Uh-oh. <laughs> to bed, Jenny. I'm dropping off here. I'm like trying to keep myself together. And I'm like, uh... <laughs> Did you not get any sleep yesterday? Um, about three hours. That's it? Jenny. Yeah. Because I'm going to nap. Yeah. Well, you know why? I ended up shutting the door because... Missy was in there jumping on me, and I'm like, come on. <laughs> like, I just shut the door, and Dwayne says, well, she won't bother you. I go, are you kidding me? And then she'd be scratching at the door. I'm like, will you just keep her out here or something and put her out? And I'd hear, <laughs> I had to turn Lex up really loud. <laughs> the thunderstorm. <laughs> Go in hear her. Dang. But, uh, yeah, but I have to, I wonder, tomorrow morning, I have to get, huh, well, I believe it's six, but, so that means tonight I'll just, you, you know, get myself ready to jump out of bed to yeah. eat and take my pills and go, but the dentist, I'm not sure, he's, he still is an open, you know, full 
Right. Well, he never was, but um, right. call him. Yeah, oh, and well, have a, hopefully you'll be able to get in. You have a Zoom on Wednesday. Dwayne says, you have a Zoom with your doctor. I'm like, oh, yeah. that three or four months, whatever it is, James, it went quick. <laughs> Oh, you, you do that every three or four months and it's up already? Yes, he wow. doesn't. Uh, it used to be, well, quite a long time ago. It used to be like six months, but then they cracked down on, you know, anybody that would do like the Adderall and that kind of stuff that you had to. I'm probably because I take more. You had to what, go in? No, now he does just Zoom only. Why? What? Why? Because what does that have to do with the Adderall? Well, then I take you know the different medicines. I think that's why he keeps it you know more like four months or whatever instead of the six months. Oh, see, mine I have to go every two months or every other month right now, but it's annoying. Oh. Yeah, no. I want to switch. Um, switch to another uh, thing because Chris is able to go every six months for his and I'm like I don't want to have to go every because I have to pay $30 every time I'm like this is ridiculous yeah, I'd I mean, so much money if I didn't have to go every damn month or every other month 100 now yeah oh really remember See? that's a doctor that doesn't take insurance oh yeah oh that's weird. yeah, yeah. And I, I just I don't, don't want to switch because, you know, I've seen him for 30-some years. <laughs> but he gives you Adderall? He's a psychiatrist? Mm-hmm. Oh. I mean, I don't know. I'd find somebody else. It's not like they do anything for you. It's not like they talk to you. <laughs> they just prescribe no. you stuff, and that's it. Anybody can do that. True. It saves so much money. But, you know, some of those run into doctors, they give you a hard time. It's like, no. No, uh, not any of the ones I know. I've been to three mm -hmm. different ones, and they've never given me hard time on anything. And you can always try it, and then go back to your other one if you don't like them. You know what I mean? There's no, there's no reason you can't. True. You know. Maybe I can get more than... But paying out of pocket, that's got to be pricey every time you go. I know. I know. He just, you, you know... What did you could buy, Janie? <laughs> I know, right? <laughs> Thank you for oh, that's so hey, fun. yeah. That's cute. Oh, don't you, Kim? Oh, oh, not man. pretty. Wait a minute. Where'd you get that tie? I had this a while. I think I got it on AliExpress or something, but I've had it for a long time. It's a little tree. I have, a, I have a weeping willow tree like this, too, which I really oh, like. Nice. Mine's a big tie. I mean, big, kind of a more of a big tree. And it's, yeah, uh, this one compared to that one is like it's oh about yeah. the same tall, but this one's really wide. Wow, that's neat though. I like that tree, it's cute. Yeah, I like it too. It works. <laughs> nice. Yeah, that one will fit on there. Maybe I can get like, I don't know. But then he, you know, he'll say, well. You know, call Lisa and we'll go, you know, four or five months. And then I'll say four months. And I could always call her and say, <laughs> I mean, you know, what the heck? Yeah. You know, all I can say is, well, next time, you know, I want to see you soon. Because, you know, unless you're having a big, if you're having a problem, I can see that. Right. But not. I just want money. Yeah. Not when you're. You know. Yeah. Because he does what? The uh, Luxapro, Gabapentin, Adderall, the Xanax, the Wellbutrin. Yeah. And then the, the one Sleep Aid, which I don't even bother anymore. <laughs> no. But. Hmm. So. <sighs> I mean, it's no big. It's not that big of a deal but still <sighs> yeah uh, but then with the heck I might as well add him with my dentist <laughs> 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 the dentist will the doctor 
Mm. You still growing your die cut collection? Oh. I'll need more die cuts. <laughs> Add to my confusion. <laughs> I like I like having die cuts on already. I have tons of them, but some of my favorite ones I don't because I end up you know, using them up and then I'm stuck with the other ones, which are fine, but I'm just yeah. like, you know, have, you have your favorites. Where's that gold paper? I don't know. I didn't use that whole thing up. What can I do with it? Hmm. I'm sorry, Rhonda. I didn't. <laughs> I was like, I didn't see your. Yeah, I'm going. I think I'm going to, you know, I'm try to get more of these done. You know, you just go, okay, well, I only have like one. <laughs> If I get a couple more, then I'm good. But, you know, I, I got to try to read along because yeah. it'd be like here before you know it. And then, you know. Yep. But if I can get like two, like three, maybe a few. I've got pumpkins are really easy. These are really are pretty easy. These little um, blue doll things. So what doll? Pumpkin. Not the pumpkin. The skulls, I'm going to try to do the little dresses with them, or the tassel dresses, and if they're too hard, I'll just, yeah, I don't know, do something with just the skulls, and what else? Oh, I got the witch's hat. I'm going to make a couple more. Oh, there. So I got to put my resin on there, too. And I'll get Oh, and those other pumpkins, the regular ones. I love those pumpkins. They came out so cute. Yeah, I always like those. I'm going to paint a little black in the, in the center of these. Um, let's see. Hmm. I'm very straight yeah. now, didn't I? Yeah. Let's put one. Let's put it right there. I'm gonna put the resin on there and make them shiny. I did these, um, I think Laura, Laura Free had got the hats last year. But I think, let's all look back, I didn't get the earrings and then I took right in No, Barbara spirit. got the hat and then you had made one for Laura Free because she wanted one. Oh, who got the hat? Barbara had gotten the hat. Oh. Remember, she had outbid yeah. Laura, and then you had <laughs> want, you went and made you wanted to make one for Laura. Yeah, that's right. Oh my god. Yeah, see, they put the little um, eye pin like under here, and then hmm. hang a little charm or bead or something. I got to do those beads because I don't want to just do something with them other than just. Yeah. All right. They're getting there. Hey, doing better than I normally do, you know? Yeah. I lot them. And we have all pre-baked teeth, as you know. Nice. All the teeth are pre-baked. Bring them that to your helps. dentist. Show them. Say, look, I'm proud of me. <laughs> <laughs> that helps. Right? Maybe using my teeth, but hey, look, I made some for me, myself. There you go. Have one of those put in. Yeah. I'll take, let me see. Ooh, I like these right here. <laughs> <laughs> There you go. <laughs> That'll be nice. That's funny. <laughs> yeah, it helps. It helps. What else did I have to do? I don't know. Oh, my little cups and I want to try. I want to try doing the painting on the little things. You know the flowers. Yeah. They're pretty cute, huh? Yeah, I love the little movie dolls. Mm -hmm. They're adorable. Sweet little things. They're adorable. Look it. I looked at this one. Who did? Do you, who does that remind you of? That one looks like a marshmallow man or whatever. The marshmallow man or? Or the Michelin man. The Jetsons? 
Oh, it looks like Rosie. Yeah. yeah. If it was just gray. Yep. <laughs> no, I'm like, uh, oh my God, it looks like Rosie. <laughs> true. It does. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> That's so funny. You could probably make a Rosie, I bet you. I bet. You know what? Um, I saved. Well, I saved a bunch of things from Pinterest, but one of them did look like the you know the little robot or whatever, and it kind All of right. looked like her. Huh. So cool. yeah, <laughs> I'd like to make a couple different hats. Like I saw the hat that had like ooh, boy, that's good clay, huh? Uh, stripes on it, and then um, oh, also the legs, the witch legs with the striped um tights and the little boots yeah i want to make some of those oh too. yeah the, that would be so cute yeah i really think those are cute i did that for um christmas and i did a halloween like a not a halloween a little bag like mm -hmm. a red bag and then it was a elf that actually it looked like he was in the bag and then his little <laughs> Legs came out with his feet, you know, they look so cute. That is cute. Look if Rosie came back as a zombie. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Oh, God. I know I could put, uh, give her a little vacuum and a. Yeah, that would be so cute. <laughs> oh, God. Oh, God. I like that one. That would be funny. This. I have to find that black. Uh, which I'm gonna call it. I don't think. Did you see that, you guys? Rhonda? I don't know if you guys were even here, but I had made the little um, raffia. Could see it's got holes here for hair. I'm like, these are racist. Uh, yeah, I love that. <laughs> oh, isn't that funny? <laughs> I love that. That's I hilarious. <laughs> So, and, you know, if I cut them down, it would, I mean, of course, it's going to look better. <laughs> it's crazy, huh? That's so crazy. Crazy, crazy. Well, I've got silver, too. i got to make a, uh, i got to make some cutlery. <laughs> cutlery. Oh, Please. Cutlery. For what? Oh. Hmm? What do you need cutlery for? The cutlery for what yeah for my plates and oh your plates that's right the, yeah. and my something else I'm like, oh. my little chocolate chip cookies i have you know i gotta finish mm -hmm. those up yep Let's to finish those up too you should make little s'mores i was thinking that too i saw <laughs> i saw a little s'mores they look easy yeah mm. Well, you already have the thing that'll make the chocolate bar. Yep, yep, because I have the, well, not this. I remember I found out this was too small. Oh, uh, right. oh this was for the waffles. Oh, okay. The little waffles, yeah, with the little little pads of butter on there that, yeah. Hmm. Looking to eat motherboards. <laughs> mm. oh, Rosie. Yeah. He made eyeballs. Oh, James, <laughs> I think I had these stars. They're cooked, baked. I made them memory. Right. I threw those in like last minute because they they were in the molds forever. Oh, and my puzzle piece. Oh, that's right. I lost that. It broke and it went somewhere. I had to find it. Oh yeah, <laughs> puzzle piece. Hmm? Somebody took a bite out of your puzzle piece. I know. I bit it. Sophia, she did it. Hmm. Hmm. Anyway, yeah, I don't know where the other my other background dies are. Hmm. Oh, I think I know where they are. They're in that little tub over there. I saw it when I was getting my thing, but I didn't grab it. I have to go grab it. I want to make some background dies. Background dies? Yeah, these kind, you know, that are like a full background. Oh, yeah, yeah. Yeah. Oh, pump. She make 
Broom earrings. Oh, yeah, that would be cute. Pumpkin. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. Little bat earrings. Yep. Yeah. Yep. I did a cauldron. Cauldron. Okay. Cauldron last year. Yeah. What's going to make? I'm going to look back at my. That's why I take pictures because I forget. So I'm like, oh, I made this, this, and this, and this. Okay. I'm gonna look Go back. Earrings. Then I'll have to work on Christmas. Yep. Thanksgiving. Well, yeah, Thanksgiving kind of blend in. You make pumpkins for Thanksgiving too. Mm -hmm. Pumpkin pies. Yep. Oh yeah, Before I've got some of that. Uh huh. I got those saved. Pumpkin pie, apple. I got all the pies. The little pieces and then the little ones with the strips. The whole pie. And mm -hmm. cake. Ice cream cones. Mm -hmm. I know. I was thinking about the little a, a, a cooked turkey. <laughs> turkey? I know. Yeah. I'd like to see if I could make that again. And you know, sometimes things when you you go, okay, I'm going to try it out. And yeah. They work out great, but then sometimes it's like this, like fluke <laughs> thing. It's like it really, you know, it turns out, but you're not really yeah. sure. <laughs> oh man. Yeah. But you know, hey. I need to try. We'll see. Doesn't have to try. Sorry. Let's see if this is still. Hmm. Well, it's 85. It's 85. 85 degrees out. I wonder if this would cut through here. I don't know if it would. I'm not sure it would, but I'm going to try it. Going to try. It's a little thicker. I mean, I guess it's like cardstock, I guess, but just slightly thicker than my other cardstock, that's all. Frankenstein or something last year, Jenny? There's like a little meat button. Oh my god. Uh oh, did you? Did you notice? Did you make Frankenstein last year? What is it? Can you hear me? Yeah, I can hear you. <laughs> okay yeah i was like what am i doing because i looked and i was muted i'm like how did i do that i didn't even touch anything unless unless i did something because my mouse is over here and, I, and my thing fell on my mouse maybe it, i did it i don't know it oh, okay it's possible yeah, it's possible right now <laughs> i was like then i couldn't hear you i'm like wait a minute mm -hmm. i need to do that right now yeah i'm gonna try to make a witch too yeah i got some witches picked out i'm like i'm gonna try to make one <laughs> Might as well. Make a witch. Make a witchy poo. Did you, make, did you make a Frankenstein last year? Nope, I've got those picked out too. Oh, I okay. haven't did that yet. Nope. Yep. Oh, my Jack. I know I was. Yeah, and I, I unmuted it here, but then I still couldn't, I couldn't hear Stacy until she... Yeah, she did that in like a year. Yeah, so I still have the jacks to do. The jack heads, whatever. <laughs> jacks. Jack o' lantern? The jack skeletons. Oh, the jack skeletons, yeah. Yeah. Just all about those. Gosh. I'm just flying around here. What's that? Oh, I think I just. Okay. There. What are these? Oh. There, get over there, teeth. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. 
Oh, you're not coming out. Come out, come out. There you are. Oh, I've got one. Oh, wonky, that needs... Where did the cup go? Where did you go? Oh, there it is. Okay. Yeah. I am. <laughs> mm. Yeah, I'm, I'm going to definitely make... Yeah, I'm going to make more of those, Carla. For sure. For easy. You have to see how the witch turns out first before you make a decision. <laughs> you never know. <laughs> I'm sure it'll be fine. You'll have to see. Okay. What's that? What? No, it's just a piece of tape that I'm pulling these out. I'm pulling, trying to pull the oh. papers out with. That, that. Oh, it's on the other one. The box should come today, I hope. Oh, yeah? Oh, okay, cool. So the machine is in there, and then Sweet. the bags and that thing to get those. Now, just remember, you know, with that, you know, thing to take the bits, the bits out, <laughs> the comb thing at the end is... Um, oh, know, yeah, it's cheap old crap there, but, but the brush works really good. Hmm. Cool. Yeah. And the girls will have a llama. Then I won't have to do this anymore. <laughs> yeah. At least for a while. Yeah, it's all apart. <laughs> <laughs> At least they're cheaper, aren't they? Uh-huh. Definitely. And they, I mean, that just, it's not even breaking down at all. I mean, it's lasting. Oh, is it lasting longer? Oh. Yeah, definitely. Hmm. Mm hmm And that, geez, that other llama is in there for the girls. Remember? <gasps> oh, yeah, yeah. <laughs> They'll have their, they have their little llama. <laughs> I'll have to make sure Winnie doesn't destroy it. Yeah. <laughs> She's so destructive. It'll be fun. She's a destructive child. Yeah. Well, yeah, I've got some of those too. Thank you. Hi. Hey, what do you guys want? <laughs> they could hear me saying. <laughs> Give me something. They're like, what? Okay. Well, good luck with the getting your appointment done. And yeah, you too. With your two things. If I, don't just... talk, if I don't talk to you, tell uh, tell Dwayne I said good luck with his colonoscopy and have fun prepping all day today. Okay. Yeah, that's right. He, 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 to that. So he's like, I could have coffee. Okay, Carla. So I could yeah, have coffee, coffee but no have milk in it. No, no milk, no sugar, nothing. It's like, we can have sugar in it. He just can't have milk. Yeah. Oh, that's right. Yeah, that's right. Mm -hmm. But, it's you know, he has so much milk in there, <laughs> he's probably just going to yeah. say, forget it. I'll have, you know, the apple juice or whatever. And, you know, I just said, well, you, you just choose not to have like, like the, I know some, you know, you're kind of sick of broth and this and that, but mm. I was, yeah, I was okay with it. What time is this colonoscopy? Early in the morning? He used to be there at 6.15 in the morning. Wow. Yeah, and it's not till, I think they said like 7.30 or 8. And, and we were both wondering, what the heck? I mean, usually yeah. they don't go about that yeah. long. But yeah. Wow. Like, hmm. Some places, is he getting it done the same place he's had it before? Yeah. Oh. Yeah, some same, place, some, yeah same doctor, yeah. Oh, okay. Can you have coconut milk? Well, maybe with COVID restrictions, maybe they're being more like taking longer to process everybody in. And yeah. No, I don't think you can have coconut. I'm not sure you can have coconut milk or anything, any kind of milk, you know. Yeah. Got to be like clear liquids, you know what I mean? Right. Yeah. Definitely. Plus, they're more, 
like with him because of the AFib, like I said, he, you know, he, he had to get clearance from the cardiologist and all that kind of stuff where yeah. last time he got it, they, it, you know, he didn't have that. Right. So, hmm. yeah. They quit the medicines and all that like five days ago. Um, but, yep. Oh, it should be fun. He'll get over with. <laughs> get yeah. over done. Yeah. Um, they let me with when he went for you know for the accident and stuff, and I think it's just. Um, probably when he's, when, when, you know, when he's ready to go in and then when he's done, probably. And yeah, that'll be it. I think they said like one person can go. Hmm. What are you going to do while he's in there? Probably take my tablet and sit there. Hmm. Take something to do. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. It's usually pretty quiet. Yeah. Oh. What are you guys doing? Oh, Chloe's getting a bath. Okay. Uh-huh. <laughs> yes. Yeah. Okay. Well, I will see you guys oh. soon. Okay. Thanks for hanging out. Oh, yeah. Thanks for having me. You're welcome. Bye. Bye. <laughs> what are you doing, Carla? Did you get enough sleep? <laughs> You've been on and off sleeping, haven't you? Stop telling them to come in here. I'm trying to tell the dogs things they shouldn't be doing. They're coming in here to bug me. They're not allowed. And they do, and they get in here, and they get in trouble. And they do things they're not supposed to do. Hmm. Well, I want to find my mother background die. Uh, I have a couple of them, but they're not here. They're right around the corner over here. Let me grab this basket, and then I can die cut them. A couple of them out. Whoa, this basket. Oh. Hold on a second. Get them from over yonder. Let's see where are they at? Over here somewhere. Yep. And my embossing folders are here too. Actually, they might be in with my embossing folders. It's entirely possible. Let's see. Now, I just tripped over something. Okay, let's see. These are my embossing folders in there. Let's see if in this little basket that I've got on my lap, I have. Another embossing folder. Ah, background dies. There they are. Well, no, that's gears. That's a background die. Where's the other one? Oh, here's a background die. Um, here's a background die. Ooh, these are pretty. These le these skeleton leafy things are really pretty too. A spirograph. I don't need that with my dies. Apparently, that's in there for some reason. Um, what else we got? Another background die. Um, well, we getting those out soon. The fall leaves. Fall leafuses. What's this? Oh, there's typewriter things. What are these? What the hell are these? Are they flowers? What are they? 
I don't know, but they don't belong in here. They belong in that little one there. They actually belong in my book, but I ain't worrying about that today. Um, what's that? No, that's not. That's not. Ooh, that's a nice one. I forget I have these things. Um, these are my media dies. Well, these are my tiny little plants. I like those. Embossing folder. Right, and then in my embossing folder bucket of tricks. Um, let's see, is there any dye stuck in here? Yes, there is. Dyes that aren't not supposed to be in there. Actually, there's no other dyes. Oh, no, no, that's not a dye. That's an embossing folder. No. What's this? Embossing folder. I think there's dies in here. I don't know why the hell there's dies in here. Don't know. These hearts don't belong in here. And whatever this is does not belong in here. Where'd they come from? I don't know. Where'd they come from? They're tags? Where'd I get these at? I don't remember. Okay. Mm, I don't remember. Alright, so there's no other dies in there, just embossing folders in that one. That's heavy. Really heavy. Oops, embossing folders. And these hearts, which I'm not really sure why they're here and not in my little thing. Is this supposed to be in here? The hair on there. Maybe if I make a little pouch, I can put them in there. And I can tape it and make it a pocket. these back so that I'm not getting all these mixed up and mushed around. I'm not going to end up cutting that one. Let me get these guys out of here. Yes, I'm going to keep those up with those with the Christmas stuff. Maybe. Oh, the feather. Those. Where'd it go? Where the hell did the feather go? I know I grabbed it. There it is. Get over here. You go in here. And then this plant, guys, can go in this hole over here. hole over here. <laughs> My tree can go over here. Um, I'm probably not going to do these guys today, so I'll put these in here. In this pocket, which will kind of fit in, sort of. Words. I want these words. Stick them in there. 
sticking them all in their pockets. My stash of dies. I have a stash of dies. They are a stash, all right. Pain in my stash. Get in there, fool. Well, well, don't fall down. It's a pain in the ass to find places to put these things. Let's back over here where I put the tree things. Put these in here. Put in there. This works good for, it's like a CD storage case. It works good for things like this, but it can also be a pain in the ass, too. <laughs> Not always perfect. It also likes to be a pest. If you accidentally pick it up the wrong way, well, oopsie, there goes all your dies. <laughs> out the back end of it, or bottom, or whatever, out the top end. Alright, is that all of those? Yes, okay, that's good enough. Anything else? I'll put them in later. Okay. All right. I can go out of here. Okay. Get the guy cuts. I just need to go over yonder. These die cuts. We did this one. We haven't done that one, but I don't think we're going to. This is a background die, too. I like this one because it's very, like, almost boho y kind of. And I like this one's florally, so that's pretty. little bits that are still stuck in here. Okay. That one and that one. And then those two. And these are not background dies, but they're geometric. Geometric shape. Um you know what I like to try to do? I'd love to see if I can cut these out of a piece of watercolor paper. I'm not sure that's going to happen, but I might as well give it a try. Because if I can cut it out of watercolor, then I can put some brushes on it and spray it and make it like really pretty. Where's my scissors go? Uh, I usually cut them for like just to use in the future or, you know, if I feel like doing something now or whatever, you know, like I do want to make something with them, but you know, use them for whatever, but I like to cut a few out and have them on hand. Let's see if it'll cut through this. I'm not positive it will, but we'll give it the old college try. If it has a hard time cutting through cardstock. I don't see it cutting through a piece of watercolor paper. Never know it could surprise us. Oh yeah, look at that. All I have to do is put the shim thing like I was doing before and I think it'll be fine. Shocking. Shocking. Shocking amazement. Just has one spot in the middle, so it actually cut all the way through it. Nice. Oh, you can color them like they could them. Come on now. Come on, you can do it. I have faith in you. Yeah. Cool view. Let's just 
a matter of poking poking out the nerds. I cut well actually. I think it'll be okay. A pokey and a pokey and a pokey and a poke. Background dies are nice when you want to do like a quick card or something because then you can just Put it on the front of the card, add a sentiment, and you're done. That's what's nice about these. They make it easy to make a card. You don't have to fuss. You know, you don't have to go through a hell of a lot of trouble. You don't have to like sit there and go, I don't know what to put on there, because this kind of does it for you. It puts the whole thing together, really. Some of my favorite dyes are background dyes. See, now I wonder if this would cut through that glitter paper since it cut through a piece of this. I doubt it still. It would probably give me issues anyway. Poke, 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 poke. Lots of poking. Do you guys use background dyes ever? Okay, look at that. Isn't that pretty? Mm, I can't wait to put some brushes on that. Let's do another one in watercolor, and then I'll do a bunch of them in watercolor, and then we'll do the brushes and see how that turns out. How's that sound? I'll do that other one with the bobbed wire. Barbed wire. I think bobbed wire. It's not Bob. Who's Bob? Bob's your uncle. I'll do this one. This one's cool. It looks like barbed wire. Paper. I'm not sure if this was the same watercolor paper as I just used or if it's a different, heavier kind. I hope not. I hope it'll still go through. Hopefully. When you're able to cut out a bunch of dyes. Oh, so you have some? Which ones do you have? When you're able to cut out a bunch of dyes, why aren't you able to? You know what? Let me try shimming it with paper instead because that like leaves a mark on the one side. Or if I put it no, it wouldn't leave a mark if I did it on the back side. I didn't think of that. Because usually I need this thing to get the middle of it, so I'm gonna try it that way. And put it on there initially to see if that helps. Hold on, hold on, guys.
Okay, sorry. Okay, sure. Kill me now. You have the florals and stuff? Same one? This is one that, oh, that works well. I think it cut all the way through, too, on the first try. Nice, that works well. You get one of these little guys. It helps when you have, like, a bigger die where it doesn't like to cut all the way through sometimes. This one always was pretty easy to cut, though, this one. I forget who makes this one, but... Um, it usually cuts pretty nicely. Even watercolor paper. And things pop out of it pretty easily, too, which is nice. Well, that doesn't always happen. But with a thicker paper, you can like really bend it and you don't have to worry about ripping it. That's the nice thing about that. Also, if you give it a little bend, it usually helps it a lot to pop out. There we go. Nice and nice. Eh? You have a big scissor and a small one, like you have to always make it three times. Oh, really? You mean the small one or the big one? You've only you've only used three times. Oh, you have a tattered lace one. Oh, that's cool. Tattered ones I see is my hard to say. How come? Do you ever find the creative reuse? No, I don't find. Well, I mean, I have found dyes at the creative reuse, but usually they're older, like really older style dyes. You know, nothing like super nice or anything. And most of them, I think I put a whole bunch of dyes recently in the. Yeah, because the ones that came with this machine, the little machine that I didn't end up putting in the auction, well, I put all the dies for it in the auction because I didn't need them because I really didn't, those weren't the kind of dies I, I use a lot of. But other than that, I don't typically find dies there. Let's see, what other one do I have? This one here is nice. See how well this does. How well that does. Doing that right there. Oh, did pretty good. A couple spots I have to fix. I think over on this side. Actually, I'm going to do it on the die side so that it doesn't mark the paper right on that side. Tipped it over. Don't know my own strength. You got it. You got the right from my dad. Oh, really? Oh, that's cool.
watercolor paper so it's on the thicker side. Oh, I keep tipping it over because I'm leaning so hard on this side over here. See what I did with that? What are you trying to do to me? Things that was right here. Can you believe that? It was sitting right there. Uh -huh. problematic. Oh, 
I'm going to pop them on you. No, you are not. I'm not going to allow it. Oh, there we go. All right. A lot of little holes to poke, which drives me nuts, but overall it's pretty much done. It just needs some holes poked. Other than that, it just needs a few of the holes poked. It's pretty, isn't it? It's a pretty one. Pretty, pretty. What was 15 pieces for um, $25? What you talking about, Willis? The Reese brand is very affordable. Oh, you mean the embossing folders or dies? Oh, embossing folders, yeah. You can get those pretty cheap. Yeah, the Doris ones are nice. Okay, and then we have this one, which I should be able to do on this piece. Oh, that's because it embosses it in that spot. Okay, yeah. So it cuts and it has like a little embossing, but it didn't do the embossing as well. Oh, no, never mind. It cut it. Never mind. I thought it didn't do something, but it did. It did it. It did it. It cut all of it. There we go. Okay, cool. out of metallic though. Probably do four. Oh no, I can do four. I could do three if I do it this way.
Good shot. I'm going to open it over the garbage or pull it off over the garbage or else it's going to be all over the damn place. Get out of here, peaches. Come on. Come on, peaches. Peaches drive me nuts. They can derive a system that cuts it out and then the pieces stay like automatically stuck to something. I don't know. The paper. That would be great. Kind of like cricket. When you pick it off the mat, it automatically sticks to the mat. Never thought of that. Cutting, put the putting my paper, cutting a cricket mat, and putting my paper on the cricket mat, and then cutting. I don't know. Well, the dye would probably cut my cricket mat. That might not be a good idea. Okay, good enough on that one. Um, flower one, no, this flowery one we do out of the gold. Gold. Yeah, there. Get out of that. Ow. Stupid ass. Stupid ass. I told you, the stores are not going to have nearly any good stuff like this. The stores don't have crap. They're kind of useless when it comes to, like, dyes and things like that. You're not really going to find good stuff in the store. The good stuff is always online. I almost never find dyes, nice, like, background dyes in the stores. Or embossing folders. Embossing folders you might find a little easier, but still, uh, lately I haven't seen the last couple times I was in a, um, any kind of craft store, I didn't really see much of anything. out but pretty in the gold
I wish the stores would have better stuff and better selections, but they don't. Mostly probably because they cater to so many different crafts, you know, like art and paint and, you know, clay and this and that. So they can't put a lot of stuff in, you know, of one thing. They have to constantly be careful how much inventory they put in the store. Good enough. Good enough. I would like this one out of gold. Get it out the stupid thing. Okay. Well, that is our full copy. Okay, and I'll do this one and then another. Do the other one fit on this one? No. No. Yeah, poop. Tuck this one off. Cut it off. Yeah, I do. I have holiday ones. I have ones for uh, Halloween, Christmas, and all the holidays. be all right.
holes for paper to get trapped in. Look at how many there are. I'm gonna sit here and clean the whole damn thing. Nope. Not gonna happen. I'll just cut it. Get out the big parts and then we're done. Good enough. All those little bits will have to come out later. How many times are you going to fall in the garbage can today? Oh, thanks, Carla. My whole four of them. <laughs> okay, oh, five of them. Sorry, I have this one too. I'm not going to gold, but... Um, what else do we want to do? Uh, what was that other one I brought over here? And this, I got these. Which are like little mixed media tattered dye things. So, we can do this one. A little bent as they get. Very destructive. You make them fit on there, so we're just going to put you over here like this. Ah, come on, even up here. Those two. And Come on. Get in your little slot, you pain in the ass. Get in there before I kick your ass. Get in. Thank you very much. Thank you very much. Yeah, it does, but then it, then it falls apart. But Jamie found one at her um, at her beauty supply, and so she's sending me one. But yeah, they do work well. They just fall apart after a while because the bristles aren't like glued in; they're just in the thing. I don't know. It's very weird. It's stupid, but.
Oh, she went to bed. Uh, that didn't even die cut. That one did. For some reason, I didn't. Maybe I didn't go far enough. I think I didn't go all the way down with it. So, I think I did not go all the way. You gotta go all the way. There we go. Forgot there was two guys in there. Now it's done, sort of. What are you up to, Laura? That would probably help the situation a little better. Where is it? I have a stiff bristle something or other. Where to go? Is it? Mm, I don't know, but that should work a little better. I'm trying to see if it will. This one. Get out! <laughs> Get out of my holes. I don't like the where's my stiff one at? I had a good stiff brush. That's all they need to make is like a good stiff brush. And I had one. I don't know what the hell happened to it. I mean, it wasn't perfect, but at least it got the little things out. Unlike this method, which is too much of a pain in the butt. making punched out butterflies oh nice yeah i, I have some uh, butterflies to send to her too they need to make self-cleaning dyes how hard would that be really dye should be able to clean itself kind of like an etch-a-sketch just flip it over and shake it and it's all clean Don't you think? It's not fair to have to sit here and poke all this out. Let 
It's not going to cut very well if I don't get it out. self-cleaning die. Myself is cleaning it. Therefore, it is a self-cleaning die. You clean it yourself. And that's better. Bunch of little doodads. Okay, let's take this. Cut one out of here. I'm gonna put that on there right away because I know how problematic this one is. I just know it. What were you punching them out of? Like actual like little punches that you have? Or like butterfly punches? Excuse you. What are you doing? Get off. On the way back. Slide it down that way. Try again. Thousand little holes on this thing. Yes. Nobody got time for this. We all got things to do. What are you doing? You're stuck. Stop being stuck. I don't like stuck. Stuck is not a good word. Not a good thing to be. You're so far in there. What is the matter with you? You got problems or what? You're deep into the crevices. Of this die there but that's why like this will cut it'll come out nice and clean but everything stays inside the die and there's like very little left in here usually so it's pretty easy in that aspect it's just hard to get out of the die itself It's a dolly. Okay. And then lastly, I have these leaf thingies over here to cut. Which are kind of like those I like those flowers I have, which are around here somewhere. Can you get out of here? Oh, I don't know why they tape them on. Just put a magnet in there, people. Okay, let's do these 
I don't think I've cut these. I thought I did, but then I realized I don't think I did. Um, I'm going to cut them out of, oops, I'm going to cut them out of this. I suppose. Leafuses. I might have to actually take these on a little bit because otherwise it could be a problem. Could it be a problem? some stupid reason. Some stop it. For some problematic reason. Hey, did you not hear me say stop moving? I'm gonna put these on there. Let's see if that helps. It's a little intricate, but they might make it through. Actually, you know what? I'll try it without it first and see if they make it through, okay? That's a good idea. These two here are not good. These good. These guys are good over here. We're good. That one's good. That one looks good. That one looks good. That's my tape. These two need a little help. They need a little help from my friends. The metal plate. flower petals. I realized that my flowers are like the same color dye. They're like a purpley or something. And I thought it was the same ones, but then I realized, oh, these are leaves. I don't think I've cut these yet. I've had them for a little while. A couple of years, probably. They look like they come out pretty easily. Oh yeah, look at that. Ooh, those are pretty. I like those. I do's, I do's. They cut nice too. Pretty easy to get the bits out of them. There's another. Another. They're pretty easy. Nothing left in 
the dots either. <laughs> so I found this one. There's like two things left in there, but other than that. Tape is on the back, that's why they're all sticking in there. Other than that, Cool. They were pretty easy to cut. There should be some more. There should be some gold ones. Shall we? Some gold ones. We have gold paper. Well, you know what I do? I have some silver paper. I can put them on here. Might as well. Might as well. It's not going to fit on there, is it? No. Let's put them on here first. Put them on there. We can look at this piece here. What's a pretty color? Oh, the pearly paper? Yeah, I love the pearly papers. They're really pretty. I don't even know where the hell I got them from. But these put these. Alright, we'll start with putting them on here. Put the shim on there, and then I'll put it on the back side. And we'll go back through. Yeah, I like the pearly papers. They're pretty. And usually not hard to cut or anything. They cut just like any cardstock would cut. That one even cut yet, yeah, did, but just didn't. Order missing. Oh, never mind. It's all good. It's all good. Get out here so I can reach you, jackass. Come on, jackass. So clean out of there. Crazy. And cut all the way, it looks like it. What about these guys? Yep, they all look good.
everything. You have a Biscuit Punch and the Martha Stewart's? Huh, I think we have the same ones. I think I have Biscuit and the Martha or mine's EK Success and Martha Stewart. I just got the Martha Stewart one when I was at the Creative Reuse last week. I didn't have that one before. But now I have it. I'll do this over the garbage can so it's not such a mess. Flick, 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 flick. Silver leaves. Silver bells. Silver bells. This Christmas time they should be. I don't think it should be singing Christmas carols. It should be illegal. It's not even Halloween yet. What it is about these purple dyes but they they work so nice i can't remember who makes it well actually i have the package duh i just got it oh i didn't just get it i just opened it oh these are prima that's why that's why they were probably expensive but i don't even remember where i got them from i don't know where i got them from did somebody give them to me or did i buy them i didn't buy prima dyes never I don't think I could have afforded it. <laughs> so either somebody gave them to me or some so sort of malarkey like that. Oh, right there. One more. I don't think I would have bought these. I'm trying to think. It's possible I got them at the credit release because I've gotten a couple of dies there here and there, but almost never find dies there. It's very rare. Usually, if I do, they're usually older. But yeah, I don't remember getting it. Man, I don't know. No, I don't think so. I don't know. What are the, um, those, the flower ones are around here. They were here. Maybe they're not anymore. I don't know. They were here. I had the ones with the little dies here. Did I move them? I might have moved them. Oh, wait, here they are. I found them. They're here. These are also the same brand. I don't know they're over there. I don't know. Who knows? These ones got clogged up a little more than those. Maybe because I used them a lot. Maybe after a while they do get a little clogged up. But they still cut real nice.
Anybody doing any creating? Time for a sip. Let's see if that will. Too late if it didn't. No, it did not. Damn it. We have to line this up. I've had to do it before. I will do it again. Okay, this time I will tape it a little bit. It did not cut all the way through. I have to use my little metal shim. I did not put it in there. That one seems to have cut all the way through. These two need a little help from a friend. children. Good little die. Good little die guts. Good little die guts. You did a good job. Mama, proud of you. Now get out of your thing. Get out. Come on, get out. That's it. That's it. You're born. You're free. Born free. If I were to take the washi tape and do this, if it would. Oh, yeah, look at that. <gasps> mm. That kind of does something, don't it? A little bit. Be quick and don't let it settle. You can quickly grab your bits and bits. Most of your bits, anyway. Be careful. Don't grab your bits. Don't lose your bits. Yeah, good deal. Go. Gotta make the sound effect or it doesn't work. I wonder if it'll let me do it from this side. I just do that. Oh, I don't take it out of the thing. Well, it still does. It works. Just gotta. Use a new piece of tape every five seconds. Eh. What else do I use my washi tape for? It's not like I use the damn stuff for anything else. Am I right? Well, no, none of you use it either. That's an industry that was like a gold mine for people, <laughs> for the companies. A lot of people bought up all this washi tape and then never used it. And now you, now, now companies can't sell their washi tape because people don't want to buy washi tape anymore because they're like, I don't use it. So why am I going to buy it? I mean, I don't buy any washi tape anymore. I used to like go crazy buying washi tape. I loved it. Yeah, that works. You get all the little bits on there. I we? Oh. How come you ain't coming out? You better not be stuck in there. I'll kick your ass. <gasps> they might be. Oh no. They're going to be stuck, aren't they? Kick ass. I will kick your ass. No, they're not stuck. They're just stuck. It's regular stuck, not like stuck stuck. They needed some coaxing, that's all. Good enough. Can't get them 
that there very well, but. You just get, would you stop it? Drunk. I swear that thing is drunk. I need to get some more pearly paper, like pinks and different colors. All I have is silver and gold. And I think white. A few things are white, but not even a lot. And I like the pearly paper. It's nice. Oh, I want to do some flowers on this because I like this color. It's an apricot color. Let's do it. Shall we do it? Come on, get off. Only one piece per thing. I hate when little pieces of wash tape get stuck on my fingers. It's kind of annoying. Oh, I can do. No, I just want to do the flowers. Where's the other flower? Oh, you gotta be kidding me. You ain't gonna fit. Oh, I'm gonna make you fit. You, you gonna fit. You gonna fit. That's right. You are gonna fit. You gonna do what I say. You gonna fit. You gonna fit. I don't take no for an answer very right? easily. Haha, <laughs> it fits. If you fits, you die cut. I was gonna say if you fits, you sits, but if you no, if you die cut. You might even be able to fit a little leaf thing. Another little leaf thing. Actually, there's more room over here for this one. There's enough room for that. So we'll just shove them all on here. Why not? We can do it. What in the microwave? The glue? I mean, the clay? Are we putting clay in the microwave? All right, I'll do one side on the way there, one side on the way back. Because I don't have a big enough piece to cover it all. Actually, you know what? I think, well, no, that piece is pretty wide because it's a Gemini. But I actually might have another piece. That is not for a die cut machine, but might work because it's thin metal and it's a little bit bigger than that. And I wouldn't have to this way, dummy. Yeah, just fell over there. Let's see how old did that do? Hmm, pretty good. Pretty good. It looks looks to be. I'm gonna peel off the damn washi, which is like uh, all weird. Weird and stupid and stuff. Come on, washi tape. It doesn't wash anything. Why do they call it washi tape? It's a Japanese word. Get off. I think it just means paper, tape, or something like that in Japanese. I was going to say in Japanese. Japan, Japan, Japanese. <laughs> I'm losing it. See, if I had that little brush thing, it would come off a lot quicker. I need that scrap box. So cute. So cute. Med check. Mid-church. Check your meds. Or our nurse. And Carla, too.
Now this one will be a good candidate for the tape. 10 seconds to what? It's 10 seconds. I'll go here, I'll go boop, and we'll go there, and we'll go bloop, and we'll go here, and we'll go bloop, and we'll go here, and go bloop. That really filled up fast. And we'll go here, and we'll go bloop, here, and go bloop. Washi tape has a purpose after all. For getting the little floops out of your out of your thing. Okay, how come they're not coming out of that one? Oh, it's coming out the back side a little better, I think. off some paper, but at least it's the back side. It's a good place to do it, just in case your wash tape's a little too sticky, like mine is. To the rescue. There we go. And the leaf. Well, this one I can just go like that. Wiggle it. Wiggle it just a little bit. Anybody remember that song from the 80s? No. What other color? Okay. Ooh, pink. I got pink. I got yellow. That's pretty. You know? Yes. I need to do some flowers, I think. What color is that? This is the other foam, but it's going to help me. I have blue too. I have blue. I have blue.
tape is holding everything together. And it makes it not want to come apart. Problematic washi tapes. Come on. I stuck to my fingers. Stop it. Oh, I don't like you. Oh, me. Nobody likes you, washi tape. You suck. But <gasps> Nina, there's Nina. We were just talking about you earlier. Were your ears ringing? Were your ears ringing? Jenny was like, "Where's that Nina?" At? I said, <laughs> and I think I told her like three times that you did, you weren't you weren't having internet or something at the time. I said, "Remember, she don't have internet." Oh yeah, <laughs> you got internet. Do you got some internet to use? get all these out later but I'll just bring it through and wiggle it a little and this one Oh, okay. Oh. Oh, dang it. But we miss you, Nina. You need to come back. Hold them still. Oh, what's been going on, Nina? When do you think you'll have your 
you know, regular internet back. Or ability to come in and chat stuff. Is she only able to chat or are you able to see the video too? Make sure you see the video. Oh no. That dog destroyed your slippers. I have to run that through one more time for this one, but otherwise it's good. This one here needs to be run through because there's a section that is not being very nice. I'm not gonna make it work here. Butters and, and Sophia should be friends. Butters is a brat like Sophia. <laughs> Steals things and eats them. Still there, Nina? Or did you leave us already? Stubborner. Oh no. Oh no. There are some stubborn pieces in this one.
Oh, thanks. Oh, yeah, they're cute. They're really cute little ones. I'm gonna, when it comes time to like fall, like in a couple of weeks, I'll probably sit and make a bunch more of these and like, especially the leaves in like different colors. Or I'll like watercolor some paper in like oranges and stuff, like fall colors, and then I'll cut these out. I think that would be really pretty. And the other leaves I have too, I'll do the same thing. Oh, let's see. That one. And I'll do them on the Cricut too. So I'll have like a bazillion, gazillion leaves. Oh. You know, just because that's what we do. We make an overabundance of things that we're never going to use. <laughs> Actually, I will use the flowers. I said I'm not using them today. I just want to make sure I cut out enough colors because I do want. I love these flowers. They're so pretty, and they're nice to layer with like um, the what other flowers that are usually layered with these. Well, you can just layer these together by themselves. But I think there was another flower that I had cut out. That I used to cut out and have them for that reason. Um, I had blue. Over here, should be some in blue. And I'll do some leaves and flowers in this one. Imaginations. Don't stop sticking to me. What's the matter with you, giant bully? Ha! Ah, got it. See, we can do anything. We put our little minds to. We can make it work. trying to connect to your broken internet. Oh, that sucks. It's like, please let me on. That's what your computer is saying. <laughs> it's like, please stop neglecting me. Yep. Oh, yeah. You can do all kinds of things with these little guys. Fun things. Keep getting kicked out of the chat. That sucks. Stephanie, are you kicking her out of the chat? <laughs> I think it's just because of her internet. I think that should do it. back and forth three times because I'm going to do it that way. Like that. Like so. Like so. Like, share, and subscribe. Shocked the hell out of me. Thank you very much. That's shocking. Oh, that sucks.
Well, I hope the months go fast so that you can see you soon. talk to your friends and not be able to be online either well you're able to you, do you have unlimited calling on your phone nina If you have unlimited calling, you know you can call me, right? And we can chat. And then at least you'll feel like you're social sometimes, you know? I feel like sometimes I have to do without sleep to do anything. I don't have one home that's seven miles away. Well, oh, that's good that you met somebody for breakfast. I read that wrong, Kim. I read. 
I'm still here listening, coloring polymer clay pieces with dental markers. That's what I, I don't know why it said dental markers to me at first. And then I read that back and I went, no, she meant, oh, she said alcohol markers, dummy. <laughs> I'm like, well, I was about to go, what are dental markers? And then I realized it said alcohol markers. And my eyes checked again. You have unlimited calling? Well, then call me, Nina, sometime. Yes, as of last night. Seems right. Oh, yeah, yeah. I think she's sending some to you and some to Jamie. It's awesome. You'll be claying it up. Uh oh, dog alert. Come on, get off of here. I'm trying to get this guy off here over the garbage can because as I'm doing it, dropping. Oh, I ripped it a little bit, but I can fix it. I ripped it just a little. Jamie's box should be here today, so it might even be here now. That's what she's barking at. I might get to go out and get my box and show you my happy mail. Hold on, I have to go to the bathroom anyway, but I'm going to go see if it's my box. I'll be right back. Got a box from Janie. She said it was coming today. Let's see what's in it. You have chocolates in the fridge. I'm going to steal them. Well, Nina, you could text me, message me, call me, and keep in touch with me, and we could chat that way. 
and you call me sometimes. Ow, ow, ow. Open, stupid. What is this thing? There we go. Get in the groove. Box. There's another die cutter in here. Oh boy. Two bags. She always gives me bags. She uses them as packing materials and I use them to go to the crazy rooms with. Ooh, look, I can use that. That's the thing that she got from it's from a um it's got this little rakey thing. Ooh, that's probably good too. What is that? There's a poodle in there. Oh, little, there's all kinds of things in here. Oh this is the little llama for the girls. Isn't that cute? I'll have to take the chain off of it, but so that they don't eat the chain. Actually, it has plastic eyes. I might have to be careful because Winnie will eat the plastic eyes off, so I just have to keep an eye on them when I play with it. I'll only let them play with it supervised. Ooh, scissors. What are these scissors for? Well, let me get all this out first. Ooh, more bags. <laughs> She's my bag liaison. Her and Katie, because Katie got me bags too. <laughs> and here's this little tiny scissors. Which is bigger than the other one, so it should work with my texture plates. And then if it does, and it works with the dies, then I can get rid of that little one and just have this one. And I can put the other one as like, I don't know, an auction item. What is all of this? She, when she packs things, it cracks me up how she packs things. I always think, like, what goes through her head when she does these things? Like, you see the rubber band wrapped around it and, like, down here? I always think, what is she thinking at that point is going to happen? That she needs to wrap it up like that. It makes me laugh. <laughs> it's just funny. What are these scissors from? I don't remember her saying she was sending me scissors. I don't know why. I don't remember her saying she was sending me scissors. Ooh, I like these little ones. These got curved blades. Ooh. Let's see. But, you know, I always like scissors. I'm always desperate for sharp scissors. Scissors. Whoop, whoop. I'll put those in my little box. With all my other scissors. I need to go through my scissors and see which ones I need and don't need. And then my little tool. It's actually a hair comb cleaning tool, but it's now going to be a dye cut cleaning tool. And it's got a little rake. It literally looks like an outside rake that you would rake the yard with. Let me stuck this to here. Ooh. Come on, me out. There's a poodles. There's two little poodles, and there's a piece of. Ooh, I want to do something with that. Oh, how cute! Look at the little purple poodle, and then look at the little purple or the poodle charm. That's gonna go on my um my charm bracelet that I'm making. I'm gonna have to put a. Maybe a hole in that or something. And then there is a cool crystal. Look at that. I turned that into a pendant. It's cool. Okay. And then... It works. I know, right? This <laughs> break like in three inches at a time. <laughs> it's for a fairy garden. <laughs> it's a rake for a fairy garden. Pick it up. Ah, oh, that's nice. I make sound effects or it doesn't work. Uh, where'd my tool go? Boop. Nice. Nice. Oh, 
Oh, so I don't reach in the back and stab myself. That's why she put the scissors like that, probably. Hmm, I'm dropping that. That's really annoying. That's so much nicer. I'm trying to pick them all off. Sound effects. Pew, pew, pew. Cooperates. This should make it go much faster to get these stupid little bits out of here. I can just go. And then rake them. <laughs> I don't know if the rake's going to be any good at anything, but we'll find something to use it for. If it was metal, it would be better because it's plastic. I'm afraid it's going to bust. I was afraid I'm going to break it. A couple little bits in there, but I think those are just more stubborn pieces. I swear, how many times have I dropped that now? 10, 15 at least. I cannot seem to catch that and hold on to it. Not to save my life. Gonna get her chocolate. She's gonna rub it in our faces. She's got chocolate. <laughs> okay, all those little bits, they can go away. Okay, anyway, let's open this little doodad box thing. Ooh, pretty. Okay, look at that. Ooh, pretty. Looks like Got your instructions. Ooh, look. Got some little bits that are already done. It's got the handle. It's got stickers. It's got an embossing folder. It's got the little plates. Those are nice and wide. Wider than the ones I have. The other ones, the little one. Oh, it's cute. Ooh, it's cute. Let's move you over a minute. Let's try you. Let's give it a try. Let's give it a give it a, a whirl. Let's put those here. Well, that's not an actual brush dye thing. The one that Jamie sent is from it's for doing hair. But I used to have the one, so did Jamie, that you get with the thing. But um, it even comes with a screwdriver to put it on with. Well, dang it. That's preparation for you. We both had the, the I don't know, it was a Ranger Sizzix something or other. It was just a, it was but uh, it broke. Both of ours broke after a while. Winnie is having issues today. in the hole and stay in there. Why aren't you going in? There we go. Go to rubber dang. We're cranking. Although the cranker goes close to the table. It's lower than I expect it to be. <laughs> supposed to just emboss with this and not die cut i wonder what this fit in there i don't think it will will it no that will not fit in there 
I don't think you're supposed to die cut with this, but I'm going to do it anyway, not with these plates necessarily. I mean, I'll do it with the plates. I don't care. I'll get, yeah, I mean, it doesn't matter, right? Because you can emboss or die with it, right? I mean, I know you can. It doesn't show that because it's supposed to be just for embossing for some stupid reason. Uh, oh, I see. That's because I see. I get it. Yeah, it's supposed to be like just for embossing, but I remember J Janie Dye cut something with it. I told her just put a, put a shim in it because it doesn't give you things to shim it with, but you can make your own shims, obviously. All right, I'll try the embossing folder situation. I'll grab one of mine down here. So let's see how it does with these here. Now, these big spellbinders don't fit. But the littler ones, which is the most that I, the most of the time that I use, is these here. Um, these fit. Let's see. This one's just wide enough on here. So I use these and the smaller ones mostly. These um, cuddle bugs, and then the small. I have ones that are smaller. The little cuddle bugs that are smaller. See the difference? I use those the most, and the bigger ones. I don't use those that often anyway. So they're like the spellbinders ones. So I'm not that worried about it. These will be good for when you need something in a pinch. In a pinch. Actually, let me use a full something that'll be a full kind of sheet almost. That would go all the way on here just for the heck of it. Actually, I don't want that color because I want something I'm gonna use. Give me this. <laughs> Me. I have to It doesn't have suction cups on the bottom. I can fix that problem. I put suction cups on it. Let's see. Did it emboss? It did. Pretty lightly though. It needs a little, probably needs a little shimmin. A little more of a shimmin under there. So let's add a piece of paper or two underneath of that so that it'll have a bit of a shim shimmery shim shimmery because it needs a little more paper i know she said it wasn't the greatest thing in the world but i think i can get it to do what i want it to do at least i hope i can if not well you know we tried but we're gonna try to get it to do something i just need paper so do I have a piece of chipboard in here that'll fit this better? Okay, light lighter chipboard piece. Let's see. What is this? Oh, that might be too thick, but we're gonna try it anyway. Mm. Where's my big scissors at? There we go, that'll work. Let's try that and see if it'll go through with that chipboard piece in the top. <laughs> I don't want to grab it. It's a little too thick, I think. It's a little too thicky. Mm, this might not be better for anything other than... Come on, jackass. If it would have the... No, this paper's too thick. I'm going to cut back. All right, you damn thing. All right, you boo. 
Yeah, let's try this piece. Too thick. Too wide. Uh oh, don't do that. Okay, let's try that again. Okay, now now we'll take it. So basically, this is just supposed to be for embossing and flinging things off the table left and right. Okay, I think that's all I needed. Yeah, there we go. There. Just needed a shim of like a piece of this really, really light chipboard, heavy cardstock. And it worked a little better. But die cutting, on the other hand, let's see how that does. Let's grab one of these dies. And we're going to put this in along with, where's that middle thing at? shims. We don't need a shim. We might need a couple shims for this because I forgot the embossing folder is quicker. What about that piece I cut before? The chipboard piece? Because now it might work good. I don't know, but just a hunch. Just a hunch that it might work better now. Yeah, it seems to be grabbing it anyway and it's not really going very needs a little more of a shim I don't think that's going to cut it just got to find the right thing for this to make shift it to work how you want it to it should eventually find the right mm, I don't think that's going to work it needs a little more it's still a little too loosey goosey I wish I had suction cups on the bottom. That was really dumb of them not to put suction cups on the bottom. Kind of dumb on their part there. Okay, I'm going to put this another shim over top of it. Let's see. Mm, maybe, maybe. I don't know. Not sure. Doesn't feel like there was a whole lot of resistance in there. Bye, Nina. Let's see, did it cut at all? No, it left a light impression. <laughs> Need more. What's this? This uh, these are really thick piece of chipboard. I'm not sure this would. It might be too thick, but maybe not because of the embossing folder was. Love that. Mm, damn it. I'm using a cutter. Ah. <laughs> it's so thick. Ah. Let me get Carl to help me out with that. He'll cut through it. Come here, Carl. You jackass. I need your help. You're going to have to cut this piece for me. we'll find the right thicknesses of things. 
some point in time here. It'll work out. Hopefully. Otherwise, I'm going to scream. Okay, let's see. We'll just grab it and pull it. Oh, that feels much tighter. But still not quite, I don't think. Maybe. Oh, maybe. This thing really needs some suction cups. I had to steal the suction cups off the other one and put them on the bottom of this one. Because, good lord. It's not heavy enough of a machine to not have suction cups, you know what I mean? Yeah, that didn't work, I don't think. What is behind me that I keep knocking into the other box? Okay, let's see. Did that do anything on the paper? Nope, not yet. <laughs> I don't know, this might not work out for die cutting. It's being a pain in the ass. A royal pain in the ass. Come on now. Cut something. Don't act like you can't. Think positive. Where's the other thing go? Did I drop it? Uh oh. Where's the other board? I'm confused. The other plate is missing all of a sudden. Did you guys see what I did with it? What the hell? Seriously? Am I losing my mind? Or is the other plate missing? What is happening right now? Where the hell did it go? Anybody you see the other gray plate? Because I sure as hell don't know where it is. Literally, it just literally vanished. Literally vanished. I'm extremely confused by this. What the hell just happened? <laughs> is it like, is it going, like, I don't get it. What the hell? I just had it. How can it disappear? I swear to God, I'm going to go insane. All, all I did was pull this thing out, and that's it. And then the thing disappeared. It's not on the floor. It's not anywhere around me. Why? Why do things have to be a pain in my asshole? Seriously. God damn it. Where the hell did it go? It didn't fall in the garbage. It's not on top of the other ones. No, it's not. This is it. On top of what ones? This is it. This is the only one. These are the cardboard pieces. The whole piece is missing. What the hell happened here? I don't know. I have no idea where it went. It literally vanished in literally in front of our eyes because it is nowhere to be found. I'm so confused right now that I'm like, I swear like something stole it because I haven't touched anything else. I had this in my hand the whole time. I didn't touch anything else. I didn't put it anywhere. Uh, I want to scream. I hate this thing already. What the hell happened to it? Is this a joke? I didn't even put anything down. It's been in my damn hand the entire time. There's nothing over here. Nothing at all that it could have gotten into. Fell. It's not like it's a tiny little thing. It's big. No, it's not glass. It's this. I'm looking for this. The exact same thing. There's two of them, and one is missing. One just walked off the face of the planet. Somehow. For some reason. Oh, there it is. How the hell did it get over there? It literally went behind my Carl under my desk. 
Anyone tell me how that happened? I don't know. But somehow that happened between the time I die cut it and pulled it out. Oh, Lord, help me. Lord help me with all this crap. Just cut, you stupid fool. Now I put it in here with this and it didn't it didn't do anything, right? Or did I just have the cardboard in there? Maybe I didn't. I don't know. Let's try this again. Let's see if it did anything. I don't think it did. I really needed need to put some things on the bottom of that. No wonder Janie didn't like this thing. No, it's not cutting. It just refuses to cut anything. Let's try another shim. Before I pop this thing in the face. They really need suction cups on the bottom. It's so stupid that they didn't put that. No wonder this thing is. And it's extremely hard to crank when you're starting to do anything other than emboss. No, it's not wanting to cut anything no matter what I do. So I don't think this is going to work for me. I'm going to have to. <sighs> yeah, because this is a lot of trouble for something that just isn't working. Why? I don't know. Maybe it just doesn't have the pressure that other ones have. You know what I mean? So it might just might not work. I'm not going to mess with it anymore. All right. I'm probably going to put it in the auction or something. I was hoping it would work, but it isn't. It's garbage. That's why Janie said the same thing. She's like, I don't know if you're going to like it, but I thought, well, I mean, it could die cut, but no matter how many shims I put in there, it just wouldn't die cut. So forget it. I can't be bothered with all that garbage. Nope. Definitely not. Why it wouldn't, why it doesn't die cut, I don't know, but I'm assuming it's because maybe the rollers on it are not very, I don't know. I just don't understand why they'd put something like that out. It doesn't make sense. They might as well just put out a small die cut machine. Why put out something like that? It doesn't make any sense. It beats me. I mean, I don't need something just to emboss because that's just another thing. You know what I mean? I was hoping it would do both what that little tiny one does next to my desk and emboss at the same time. But no, it does not. It does not. It does not. It is a snot. <gasps> Look what I found. Ooh, I have a couple of pieces of pink in the pearly color that I did not think I had. Well, that was rude of it, of it to do that. Get all my hopes up for nothing. <laughs> but that's okay. It'll find a new home. Okay, where was I doing? I don't even know anymore. I'm gonna put these things back in there. Back, back in there. Back over here, jackass. Okay. We need these guys. That's what we need. We need to put our little dies on there. Use other one. Yeah, that's what I'm figuring. It's just stupid. They might as well have not even made it. <laughs> really, it doesn't make any sense to not have it have enough pressure to die cut. What's the point? Because anyone who wants to emboss is going to want to eventually die cut. So why? I mean, I, I get it. It's a gimmick so that you buy more stuff. I get it, but it's not right. It's not fair. It's just not fair. Not nice. It's not nice. Am I missing something here? Yeah. Okay. Well, wait a minute. I just want the flowers out of this, not the leaves. I don't want to cut flowers out of it. The I want the leaves out of it. The I lost my washi tape and everything on the floor. You have one that just embosses? Yeah. It's kind of 
I mean, I guess if somebody just, I don't know who would just emboss things and not ever die cut. I don't know. I think that's kind of weird, but somebody might like it who has a couple embossing folders and that's it, you know, or something. I don't know, but hmm, we'll see. Too bad. I was hoping it would die cut. I thought for sure if you put a few shims in it or something, it would die cut. But nope. I don't know if Sizzix was like, hey, let's make a machine that is not strong enough to die cut anything, but it'll emboss, sort of. Because it really doesn't even do a good job at embossing. Because you notice I had to put a shim on it just to emboss something. So I don't know what the hell they were thinking. But, hmm. Uh, not impressed, Sizzix. Not impressed. No wonder I've never heard of it, and nobody probably ever has it. <laughs> Just not nice of them to do that. Because there's no reason why they couldn't make it strong enough to emboss. I mean, really, would it have costed that much more money to make it that way? No strong enough to cut, I mean. Nope, it wouldn't have. But they just wanted you to get hooked on embossing, so that then you're like, hmm, I want to die cut, and then you buy a whole new machine just to do that. See, that's what they were doing. They were trying to steal our lives. Oh, that one needs to be run through again. That one's good, and that one needs to be run through. Uh, I hope they come out with another Vagabond. I'd be interested. Even though there's nothing wrong with this one, I'd still be interested because if they make it a little wider, it would be better. You know? Like the Gemini is nice and wide. I like that about it. So if they made the Vagabond but made it a a little bit wider. I think it would be perfect. It is a very good die cutting apparatus. Apparatus. Laura, I have a, an enormous bunch of scraps for you. Now it's time to have fun. See, this one has two ro rows of brushes, whereas the Sizzix one only has one row of brushes, bristles, brushes. Raking. <laughs> Maybe you can rake it when it's like this. You can go. On there. No, I think the rake is pretty useless in this situation. Or I can look, I can rake my leaves. It doesn't even do a good job of that. My hands do a better job. I'll find a reason to rake that thing. <laughs> I'll be a raking fool. Oh, my dogs are barking because Chris is feeding them and they're just way too excited with themselves. I could poke it through the holes a little bit, but it's like it feels like it's gonna break. Where'd my poker go? Oh no. Oh no, not again. There it is. It's for cleaning your brushes and combs out with, not for your hair. No, it's not for raking your head. Not exactly sure how it cleans your brushes and combs. There was like a picture on the thing, but I didn't really pay much attention to it. So 
be of being stubborn. Oh, that's because you're stuck in there a little bit. Okay. There's a few in here that I didn't get cleaned out from before. And this one. That one has a couple pieces that won't cut properly. <laughs> you got it right, Nina. So scratching your head and thinking of what you're doing next. Like, Hmm, what should I do next? I know, it's for scratching your ass. Be a good ass scratcher. <laughs> Reach around and go, oh yeah, scratch my butt. And then you take it and you, <laughs> and you clean out your die cut. Just don't put that part in your mouth. <laughs> my dogs would probably love it. Scratching them. Don't fall on the ground, please. Nope. So I couldn't clean all this out before because I didn't have this too bad. And then, like a miracle, it showed up at my door. Who to fuck it? Miracles do happen. Butterflies do exist. Yeah. You all cleaned out. You look like you all cleaned out. No, nope, you're not. Crap, I turned on my tea water again. But guess what? I need to go out and actually get the tea. Just a stubborn couple of pieces in here. Sometimes they hold on by just a little fiber of paper. Did you get mail? Is that in the mailbox? Yeah. Cool. What is it? Oh, this is my thingies. Who's the Irish ladybug? This is the doggy thingies. Oh, yeah, the rest of them. Yay! Is this online? Yep. You are? Yep. <laughs> That's what I'd be. My entertainment. I love these colors. They're so pretty. These are like my favorite flower dyes. These ones here. I definitely recommend you getting these Prima flower dyes. Because first of all, they're nice dyes. Second of all, the flowers are so pretty when you put them with you layer them not just with themselves but like with other flowers they go behind things really nicely they're just so pretty so i advise you to get them too bad there's only three flowers in the set and there's a whole bunch of leaves i wish there was more flowers i wish i don't know if they have any more or they came out with more i don't know because i don't even know where i got them from <laughs> either somebody gave them to me or maybe i got them somewhere but i don't think so because Prima stuff is usually on, on the expensive side, so that's, I don't think I would have bought these. I didn't even know Prima made dyes, so unless I got them on clearance, maybe they're old. Either that or somebody gave them to me. Alright. My puppy dogs. So now I have all eight of my puppy dogs on pennies. So that I can make my bracelet. So very excited. Tigger's getting fed, so he barks at Chris the whole time. 
Oh. Tigger. Whoops. Buddy. Winnie. Willow. And Sparky. Oh, it's going to be hard to show. Let me do it this way. And the other ones are up. I think I have them on my desk over there. Because I got three before. See, Sparky and Willow. And the date on the penny is the date that I got the dogs. Not necessarily their birthday, but the date that I got them. So I got Willow in 2017. I got Sparky in 2006. I got Winnie in 2017, even though she was born in 2016. But that's just the date that I got them. They arrived in my care. Hello? Focus, stupid. Tigger, of course, I got as a puppy in 2007. And then Buddy we got in 2008. He was a dog that I rescued from somebody who was treating him. Well, just not caring for him properly. And anyway, I'm... I'm making a charm bracelet with these um, for myself. Those are the only flowers we got. Yeah, well, I mean, I know I have more flower dyes, but these are the only ones that like this that I got. And yeah, you heard the dogs barking because Chris is feeding them and Tigger always barks when he, when he feeds them. Um, so, yeah, they only came in a pack, I think, in three. I mean, that's all that I had. I don't have the package for the other ones, but they were in a package like this. This is the one for the leaves. But the flowers, I should look and see if they were like the Prima flowers, if they still make them or not. I don't know. I don't know how long ago they came out. Uh, well, these didn't come up right away. Uh, ooh, I like those too. Those are nice. Um, uh, yeah, I'm not seeing these. Maybe they're old stock or something. Huh. Yeah, I'm not seeing them. Maybe that's... Either I got them on clearance or some, I don't know. Yeah, I'm not seeing these anywhere. Huh. Mm. Huh. Yeah, they don't even exist. I see other flower dyes by them. I'm not seeing the same ones. That's not fair. Hmm. I'm going to go to their website. Let me look on here and see what these say. Whoops, I dropped my keyboard. What years does it say? Of course, it doesn't say a year. Oh, 2014. Okay, so they probably are old stock and they're probably retired. Because if the leaves are from 2014 that are kind of the same, they kind of matchy-matchy a little bit, you know, then it's got to be the same. Like, they don't exist, probably. That's probably why I got them. I probably got them on somewhere on sale or something. But the package, I have the package somewhere. Or maybe I threw the, threw the package out. But... Um, Can't, yeah, I can't find them. I put in a couple different words. Weird. That's weird. Huh. But they wouldn't even have them anywhere. Oh, well. Okay. Yeah, I guess you can't get them anymore either. <laughs> well, I better not lose them. Because that would suck. Oh, no. Am I melting things over here? No. That would suck. Ow. Anywho. I got 
these flurs out. Okay, excuse me, washi tape, would you mind? I better hide them, I know. <laughs> I know, I better hide them because somebody will steal them. They'll come and snatch them away from me. Don't take my toys. Yeah, I must have gotten them on clearance and I must have bought them. Or, or somebody could have given them to me, but the uh, likelihood is I bought them if they're if they were on sale or something, maybe. I probably snagged them. I've had them for a few years, but I don't remember where I got them from. That's the only thing about that. So it's likely now that I probably bought them some at some point. You know, let me see if I can find that metal piece so I don't have to keep doing this back and forth. Let's see if it's over yonder. This one might be too thick or too big. I have this piece, which is a tad too big. Okay, but I have this piece, which is still bigger than that one. This one's as thin as that one, but I think it's just aluminum. Alum aluminum. But it's just as thin as that piece. That piece has got to be a piece of aluminum, right? I would imagine. And it's got sharp edges just like that one did. So I'm going to put tape around the edge kind of like I did on that one. Because I don't know what they sell this for a, the little Gemini machine or something. I think it was Gemini brand for die cutting. But the edges were so sharp that somebody would have cut their fingers on that like without doubt. So why they're selling that like that, I don't know. It's kind of bizarre to me because I would think they would not want to sell something that has like razor sharp edges a little bizarre that they did and was like okay with it <laughs> let's just put it in there like that willy-nilly we don't have to worry about them cutting their fingers who cares <laughs> it's just kind of weird <clears throat> so i will washi tape the edges of it myself Should work the same as the other one. I mean, I don't see why not. I can see a difference in the two. It's just that this one would fit through the little one dive machine, and this one does not fit through the little one. I tried it. <laughs> okay, now we're protected. So now, like, I get more coverage, and I only have to move it over twice instead of three times or I could try putting it in with that one and see what happens probably nothing it probably won't work it's probably gonna it might make that too thick I don't know we can see if it does then we don't do it 
me say no, just say no to drugs. You're killing my machine. Winding down. Um, let's see. Is that working one pass then? No. That's the edge where I put that one. But all the rest of it went. So now I can use the little one to go right here. Because I don't need the big one. Just that one little tiny area. So I have both. Yeah, and it's going to do the same thing it did to that one. I'll warp the crap out of it. But that's okay. That's just what will happen. Where'd y'all go? Wake up. It's playtime, damn it. Get up. There we go. Nice. Nice. See, the tape slowly starts to come off of this over time. As long as it's not sharp, it's not. It's fine. It's fine. I just tell myself it's fine. Oh, did I do this one? Oh, yeah, I did. Stephanie's here. You gonna come on and do some crafting, Stephanie? Hmm. Oh, no. Get back here. You know what? You know what, chicken butt? This little pad thing might be the answer that I need. I don't remember what machine that goes to, but it might help me get out the little bits a little better so I can lay it down. It's usually I have to like hold it up and try to do it because the flat surface doesn't let it come out, but with this it will, won't it? It will. I mean, business and it probably keep everything on this little thing maybe and not be such a mess. Or a mouse pad, yeah. That would be good too. Although, I think that works pretty good. I used to have a piece of foam that I used, but I don't know what happened to it. Nice. Nice. this everywhere a little bit but not as bad I guess little paper bits love to fly around they should make a machine that all you do is put your die cut on it whether you put it like after it comes out you know whether it's on the die or you're just your die cut and it'll like brush roll it as it goes through that's an idea there's a machine right come up with that and just put your die cut or the die with the metal like if you can't get it out or whatever and it'll do something to get it out that'd be a way to make that happen this has got to be So like you can put it in like this with the die and everything or if it's already out of the die but it's got little bits in it you can just put it in like that and it would clean it all up 
when it comes out the other side. All the little bits go in like to this little catcher in the bottom. How about that invention of a lifetime? How do we make that happen? Who's investing? I need some investors. Get out, jackass. You guys are going to make me have to go on Shark Tank with my ideas. Come on, get out. Or not our? What'd you say? Oh. Oh, yeah, I understood what you meant. I speak fluent typo. All right, I'm gonna get shake. Oh my god, did you see that? They jumped all over like they were jumping beams when I tried to move them. <gasps> that was weird. It must have been some weird static cling alien stuff going on. I moved that thing and they all went ping like that. Whoa, that was creepy. Like that. We're all over the place. Not fair. Okay, I can fit one more on here, probably. Maybe two. But not the flowers, just one flower and then the leaves. I could probably get three leaf assistances on here. Maybe just two. This one. Maybe there was a smaller one. No paper. Does who make videos, Rhonda? She makes videos. Right? Do you make videos, Rhonda? Why don't you come on, Stephanie? Why aren't you doing art? What are you doing? Sleeping? One shot, it cut them nice. It's because of my fancy new shim thing that I made. <laughs> courtesy, that was courtesy of the creative for use. Courtesy of the creative for use. Put 
of the washi tape on the end, which is making the knitting stick. I better clean it out when it's in the dye because it makes it a little easier to control it and get it all out of there and then it just usually just pops right out but I didn't, I didn't get it all out pretty It did? It closed? Katie went to sleep. Look at that. Isn't that pretty? She's pretty. off the washi tape it's stuck on there and this other glued on piece of crap that won't come off i don't know why it's there but it is driving me you know what i probably put some alcohol on it and that would come off these pieces of tape back here drive me nuts i don't know why they do that because it's kind of like dumb oh, come on let me have it give it chunks of tape off because everything sticks to it like dirt and blah 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 let's see I know it might work actually um, my razor well, I can get it flat enough. There we go. There we go. Goodbye, crappy tape. another piece on the back of this. See how it's like all that tape? All like gunky? That's been like that since I got it because that tape has been there and it's making it hard to get the die cut pieces out of the thing because they get through the holes the tape is and it sticks to the little piece and it never comes out. And it just gets grosser and grosser as it goes. Got it. Got it. That worked well. Good. I'm going to get these other little bits out of here that have been hanging around, taped to the thing for the last year or two. Besides my remnant washi tape on that one, and then there's a piece on this one. And washi tape, get off. Look at that. Everybody should get these from the dollar store. Because they're great for your glass table. They're great for getting little tape off of like flat surfaces. They're amazing. They work 
fantastic. Okay, what other color do we need, folks? Look at this. Oh, this one. Is this a different color? Ooh, that's pretty. I didn't do that color. Let's do it. Got it. Oh, baby, we got it. Okay. You know, if I would have put those sideways, it would have been a little easier to do. That's all right. It's okay. It's going to be okay. All right. Why are you doing it back there? Can you just stay in your lane? Stupid thing. How much is going on over there? Over where? 
one more. Where are you at, Rhonda, again? I forget. I forget. Michigan. Oh, I bet. It's going to be tough to do that anywhere, but yeah, I can imagine it ain't easy where you live. Is that what happened to you, Rhonda? You went from 40 to 980? That's crazy. One piece will hold it for long enough to get it going. Oh, your was it your husband you said? Shim works pretty good. Why do they have to go so far away? They just fly up here and go everywhere. They understand there's a pandemic. They shouldn't be roaming around like that. Color should I do next? I'm only doing like one color or two colors. That's it. And maybe just one color. I did a yellow. I did set a couple of pinks, like three pinks, and a blue and a silver and a white. Like a white pearl. Anything but red or green. I kind of did an orange too, but well, not really. It's more of a yellowy orange. Oh no, I did like this one. That's right. 
This is kind of orange, but it's not like orange orange, more like tangerine. Gold? I could do gold, I guess. I didn't do, did I not do any gold? No, I didn't. Did I? No, I did silver leaves and gold leaves, but I didn't do the flowers and gold. I could do gold. <laughs> this is red. No red. I can do purple or lavender. That too. Maybe I'll do lavender and gold. Throw them on there. Okie doke. Okie doke, smokey pokey. So I missed it. What does your husband do? He's done. Okay, I'm gonna get my tea. So I was asking, um, what what does your husband do, Rhonda? Or what did he do again? I forget what if you said what he did. Let me go get my tea in the interim of this mess. Because uh it's out there waiting. Spot for the damn tea. I bring it back in. I also have this one. This one I bought at, I think, Hobby Lobby. That's a Hobby Lobby sticker. Yeah, it says Hobby Lobby on it. I think I got that on clearance a long time ago. All right, I'll be right back. Give me a second.
Sorry for the delay. I had to pick the tea myself and dry it out and steep it. <laughs> Can you imagine? I'll be back. I'm just going to get some tea. <laughs> Never come back. Right, why do I have this hot glue gun on? Because I don't really need it on right now. I really don't. I need my my teacup warm, warmer thingamabobber though. That's more of a necessity than the other. Keep my tea warm because it always takes me nine years to drink it. Anyway, I was asking what your thing, your boy, your, yeah, your husband does. He was a facilities manager. He used to handle contractors building big boys from ground up plus fix equipment. Oh, cool. And what is he doing now that you said he makes $9.80 an hour? It sucks that so many people lost their jobs. Chris used to work for Amazon. They, they, they start you off at $15 an hour. Unless that's not what you're talking about. That would be good if you can get a better job. Okay. Get the rest of these out of here. Okay, so these are my little two. Oh, that would be good if you got my Amazon. things will get back to normal at some point in our lives <laughs> and we'll be able to hopefully people will get more jobs back and you know because it just sucks it's hard to cut it when you don't have enough money coming in thought it was over and then it's like oh wait hold on <laughs> we're gonna have more it's like uh
I know. I know it sucks. Because if everybody would have gotten it, there wouldn't have been a Delta variant. You know what I mean? And this would have been over with a long time ago. But the longer people wait to get the vaccine and not get it, the more variants spread and the worse it gets. And one of these variants could very easily become vaccine and everything resistant and just go around killing people left and right, which would suck. But, you know, you can't speak reason sometimes. It doesn't make sense. Oh, whatever. So you just deal. gold. I might have to do it this way. Sorry, not my mouse is right here and I keep knocking into it and it keeps making me do things I don't want to do. <laughs> thing. It's forcing me to do things I don't want to do. by the thingy. You have a hard time letting go of it that's the worst part that's the part that you need to tackle first is letting go but i don't know i guess my only suggestion is to look at things in a way of if you haven't used it in a year or more it needs to go <laughs> you know what i mean that's the best way to do it if you haven't touched it in a year or you know a year or more then then you know 
and the odds of you touching it anytime soon is slim to none. That's the only way I know how to decipher something like that. But it's just something you gotta... You know, because it's hard to, for, you know, it's hard to tell somebody else, get rid of your stuff. You know what I mean? It's like you have to kind of come to terms with whether, you know, with needing to let it go and stuff. You know? Yep, you will. But yeah, you, it's it's a, it's an evil game that your brain plays with you though, right? Because you, you know it'll be better if it's gone. But yet, for some reason, in your head, you know, like you can't seem to like you know what the rational thing to do is but yet your brain just says screw you i want i want to keep my crap leave me alone <laughs> you know see i don't have a problem getting rid of things and that's not my problem it's you know my problem is finding space for the things that i do have and need and then getting things cleaned up in a way that i can get it situated where it's not in my way because if I try to clean one room another room ends up getting messy because of it and that seems to be like my worst problem and I don't have enough help to also get anything done because you know trying to find somebody to help me around here is virtually impossible piece of washi tape get out of there jackass <laughs> well I used to do organizing and cleaning for a living but because my house is beyond right now it's very hard to do because there's really nowhere to put anything so I'm trying to tackle all that because every time I have an auction you know I bring the stuff upstairs to pack it and so my living room becomes crowded with stuff and then I'm trying to work around that and that that ends up making everything worse and then I have days where I don't feel good and I'm just like not in the mood to deal with it. And then when I try to ask Chris to help me, I get, you know, bitched at instead. So it just puts me in a bad mood. And so I never get anything really done. I just end up in a vicious circle. Eventually, we'll get our stuff straightened out one way or another, either that or we won't, <laughs> but either way, something's got to happen, right? Something's got to give. That's too big. Yeah. You have a lot of material you're selling, yeah. Yeah. 
Yep, I understand the feeling of being depressed with all the crap in the house. Oh, yeah. It's depressing. yard yeah i don't see why that that's not fair that's totally fair i think that would be you know awesome Christmas crafters will be all over it. You must have a lot of fabric, huh? You do a lot of sewing? Rhonda? Oh, really? You used to run a craft show? What do you mean a craft show out of your home? What does that mean? Fit it all. Sell it out of your house twice a year? Oh, I see. So, how would you sell it out of your house? Like, people would come to your house? Oh, really? You didn't go to craft fairs or anything?
can sell your stuff there. Okay. Well, that's good. Just settle down now. Settle down now. Ugh. Get up here, jackass. You get back here. Settle down. <coughs> Come on. Ugh, these pads are always such a pain in the ass. They should just make metal ones and not do these plastic ones anymore. I think they're so stupid. They don't make any sense to do it that way. Susan. Oh, I haven't been up 24 hours. Not yet. insomnia and I don't sleep well unless I'm super exhausted but I'm definitely not manic I just have I have ADD and insomnia that's it All right, are you gonna come out of there you're coming out you're coming out and you're coming out the other one's not coming out with that one well, that one and that one can come out. They just have to go back through the machine. They did not cut all the way through. So these two are going to go back through and through. And cutty cuckoo. I wish this would stay together and stop being a jackass. Oh, okay. Well, yeah, you have company. I'm always on at least a couple times a week for long periods of time. Getting something or other done. <laughs> CPTSD. What does the C stand for? Never heard of that. I know what PTSD is. I've never heard of CPTSD. I have PTSD or I have PTSD. I don't think, I don't know. Maybe I still have it. I don't know. But it doesn't bother me like it used to.
Oh, okay. Oh. Sorry, I had to go through that season. I've been there in both situations. I think that's where part of my PTSD stood for was came from as well as from childhood abuse and whatnot. No, don't leave. Where are you going? Nobody said to leave. Hmm. Back here. Oh, that cuts flying around. Lavender, I think. If I smell lavender anyway, I don't even know if I do. It's going to be pretty. That purple. For lavender. Oh, wait, is this lavender? That looks lavender to me. Well, it might not look it on camera because the camera washes everything out, or the lights, I should say, but it is. I also have purple. But I think the lavender will be the trick. I do, I do. I think, I think, I think. This one I just want to do flowers out of. It's not the other things. You should talk to more, Susan. We are your friends. Uh, ouch. Get off there. This thing's being a pain in my ass. Come on. Don't be a pain in my ass. Please get in there. Do it. Do it. Okay, sort of. That's, That's why I don't like the little borders on this because it's kind of a pain in the ass. Okay. 
scrapey scrapes. Scrapey scrapes. Pretty. Pretty lavenders. Sorry, Susan. Well, you don't have to be lonely. You can come hang out with us. Being lonely is not fun.
Don't you get into any gold on the big leaf. Whoops. Okay. Pretty. Whatever it is. Funky thing. I think funky. That's true, Rhonda. true there's nothing wrong with that either but you know i know some people you know depend on coming into the chat and being able to talk to people you know helps them feel like they're not so lonely have somebody to talk to. Yeah, it's nice to know you're not alone. Yep. here for Try one first. <laughs> I don't want to leave the whole thing if I can only get. I can't get one to cut.
will say that's actually good. 